piece of shit. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb called Raccoon City. It was later revealed that the terrible disaster had been caused by the T-Virus, a mutagenic toxin created by the international enterprise Umbrella Incorporated for use in bioweapon experiments. The Raccoon City Police Department's Special Stars Unit immediately began investigation of the affair. The case was apparently closed, thanks to the efforts of STARS members Chris Redfield and Jill Valentine. But the Umbrella Corporation's experiments were far from finished. What have we got here? Guy's a maniac! Why'd he bite me? can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer.
arrived in town, and the whole place went Great. insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah, first day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it with you. in one piece. All right, here I am, and coming in, here I am. All right, so straight into action here. Uh, so we're playing, obviously, Resident Evil 2. Uh, for the PlayStation, since the N64 crapped out on me. And, uh, no, shit, 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 shit. Okay, anything here? No, no. All right. Cutscenes, my mic go off, and we'll have plenty of time to talk here. Freeze! Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human! <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. All right. So, anyways, there's a file here, right? So yeah, welcome in everyone. Uh, yeah, I, um, there's a digital foundry, um, video that's pretty good. There's a file here, and I will come off it. There's a file here. Give it a file. I know there's a file. I'll come off it. No way, dude. Are you serious? You know, I could swear there was a fucking file here. Oh, okay. Well, sorry if there was a file there. So yeah, plane. There you go. Oh, I think the file might be here. So yeah, uh, please no backseat and they. I, I'm not an ac expert in this game, right? But I, um, but I played enough. You know, I want to solve the puzzles that I forgot and that kind of stuff. So we're gonna have a cutscene. I did not tend to get the shotgun here, and I know about, about Brad and how to see him. I'm not picking items and all that. I'm not doing that. I don't want the costumes right now. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, and I get the fuck out of here. Now, uh, I love this game. This is my favorite Resident Evil uh, of all time. Although the fourth one comes in close. I just realized that I'm goofed here. Just a, <laughs> just a minute. I um, I fucked up with a sat uh, earlier. Just a minute here. That's why the, the wall here is kind of janked. Oh shit, here we go. Bitch. There we go. It's completely, there we go. Because I had to come in with a CRT here earlier. Sorry about that. So, uh, yeah. Good to see you, Summer Teeth, Cat, Jerome, everyone here. I probably learned how to do a pin message. It's not that hard. Uh, hi there, Feller on YouTube. How you doing? 
Synth Lord. There we go. You're live now. All right, let's go back. And I'll put this here, drink here, and that's it. So yeah, uh, there's a Digital Foundry video on uh, all the many versions of the, the Resident Evil 2, right? For me, the, the PlayStation 1, it'll always be sort of the OG, the, the one, right? Um, there is one, I, can, I can't remember which one it is, but you can, um, it has high resolution assets. The problem, the problem is uh, sometimes, oh shit, okay. Sometimes it is a, a bit of a mismatch between the uh, the characters and the images, the static images they use here, right? And uh, so, but, but there's a, a version, I forgot which one it is. I, I can't remember if it's the PC version, but you can um, force it 240p. And so you have 240p image with high resolution graphics. It's pretty good. And I agree, the N64 is, a, yeah, I do tend to shoot them here. Look, I don't play this game perfectly. Uh, you pathetic fuck. All right. Um, but I, I'll do my best here. I have played this game before a few times, you know, and back in the day. Good to see you all here. Uh, and yeah. <laughs> ah, you Fuck out of here, you freak. God, I always think that shit is an item, and it, it, it isn't. I'm a killer right now. There's no auto-aim. I do prefer auto-aim, to be honest, but uh, it's just off. If the GameCube can... Ah, oh, that's that's right, Jerome, thank you. That's the GameCube. So, yeah, if you want a, a very good experience, like you care about the graphics and all that, uh, I might do it sometime. This is a game that I, I, I wouldn't be... I just realized I fucked up. I wanted to declare A and Leon B, but A, I made my choice, right? I actually never, I always, I always choose Leon because I like him a bit more. Nothing against Claire, but I just, Leon is my favorite character of the series. Now, I did hear once without taking hits. Fuck you, bitch. Damn it. Ah! Damn it, I already fucking, you know, I swear to God, I did it on the N64. I've been through this whole place without taking a single bite, and this three already? How are we doing here? Okay. I tend to just do avoid most most zombies here. Hey, bitches. Fuck off. <laughs> this game still gets me a tiny bit about, you know, on the scare factor, to be honest. So, the lady on the bus here, like this here. So those of you gotta shoot them. Right? That's just the way it is. So lay the crawl in here. Take care of her. Sorry, man. Eat lead. Uh, you can. I just avoid him. There's no reason to. Is there more things here? No sign of life. All right, let's get the fuck out of here before I get fucked. There's a. There's this video by Avalanche Reviews on all the Resident Evil ports. I believe I've seen it. Is that a guy that sort of acts like Dr. Spock or something? Um, he goes like, he does uh, greetings. Very good video if that's the one you're talking about. I think it might be the one. Okay. We can't avoid this whole bullshit. I don't know. I, I thought it was a nerve there before, but I, I don't think there's none. Is there? Is there a nerve here? I don't think so. I think I came here before there was nothing. So if you come here, uh, probably most of y'all uh, know this already, but if you come here without picking any items, you're gonna meet the pilot, the helicopter pilot, the first one, uh, and all, who was also on the third one um, here. And I think it, it's probably after, I don't know about the Lord too much, but probably after Nemesis fucked him up and infected him, right? I, let's just go in. Yeah, that's him. Good old Brad. Yeah. So I haven't played in a long time. Last time I played Resident Evil 2, and it's not the one time. The time I did the stream, I had to kill the stream because the shit, uh, as the internet doesn't count, obviously, I had to kill the stream. I still have uh, like a one hour stream before the N64 crapped out. Uh, before that, I think a couple of years ago, I played 
Leone and Claire B uh, on the N64. The PlayStation one is, I think, has been has been a long time since I played it, but uh, I'm just I've been in a mood to play Res Resident Evil. It's uh, along alongside Castlevania, Mortal Kombat, um, Mario, Silent Hill is up there as my favorite franchises in all of all time. All right, let's use the computer here. I think you need a card. You need to talk to the feller. But it's, I like to see the computer anyways. So, yeah. Take the ink ribbon. Yeah, the, the music is something that I, I listen to quite often. Okay. Uh, I will hope the PlayStation doesn't crap out and I don't die here like a dumbass and have to repeat the first part. But if it happens, like I said, I'm not a pro at this game. I just, I played it before, but I'm on a very casual level. So lower your expectations as far as gameplay here, you know. Because this is a game that's been played to death. I mean, people know the game so well, right? We'll talk to him here. And again, every time there's a cutscene, I'm going to go ahead and, and mute the mic. Good to see y'all here. And, um... Uh, Good news, the internet is still the same, so it looks like I'll be able to to play, no problem. I'm wearing this weird-ass shirt here today because this is a very ref reflective monitor, and my pale ass skin was uh, reflecting on the monitor, um, so I have to, you know, have to wear this. It's the only way. All right. You must be the new guy, Leon. Sorry, but it looks like your party has been cancelled. What happened? About two months ago, there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other STARS members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the truth, but no one believed them. Not long after that, all this started to happen. Uh, uh, hang in there. Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But... Just go. Fine. But I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. Alright. And once again, we don't have the, the stuff anymore, so I'll try my best to do the clip. Uh... Moogie Boogie here, as let's face it. I'm not going to do it forever, you know, but I do it for now. See, if I can remember, I don't remember word for word. Let's face it, you're you're a cunt. And the only thing is going to change over time, and then you're going to become an even bigger cunt. Maybe have some cunt kids. Or maybe have some more cunt kids. <laughs> let's face it. Hi there, Woogie Boogie. So let's go to the OCRT here. Yeah, I should have paid attention to shows Claire. It's just instinct. I just pick Leon because I really want to do Claire. I'll do it. I'll do it over some other time. All right. I won't. I really. I never. I don't think I ever did Claire A and Leon B. To be honest, you know, back in the day, I I actually didn't do the B scenarios. I thought there would be like the first one, just changing the character pretty much, and barely changing anything about the game. Boy, was I wrong. You know. So the game is vastly best appreciated if you do all the scenarios, right? Of course, y'all know that. Mammy TV, hi there. How was my day? Pretty good. I uh, I managed to get. I had to take care of my one year old. I managed to, to keep her there with me in the bedroom while my my wife was in town with the two other kids. And um, yeah, I know there's a laker here. I don't know if I, I think only the hunter can kill her instantly. Huh? Let's go to the safe here first, and I'll think about it. If I do one first save, so if anything happens, I don't have to repeat the whole intro and all that. Because that'll be kind of embarrassing. Um, not really, to be honest. I'm, I'm never embarrassed about my gameplay, to be honest. I'm never, you know, I never proclaim to be a pro, so 
whatever happens for me happens, you know. Plenty of pros out there. Police memorandum. This letter is just to inform everyone about the recent movement of equipment that has happened during the precinct's rearrangement. The safe with four-digit lock has been moved from the STARS office on the second floor to the Eastern office on the first floor. And I will be writing things down the old-fashioned way. I'm taking up motherfucking pictures here when I was smart and that crap. I don't think I even know where my phone I was here. So, okay then, this fucking book has seen better days. Uh, RE2 PS1, and let's go ahead and and put here safe combination. We're we'll right down 2236. Good to see y'all here uh, again. I couldn't be happier. So yeah, uh, so yeah, my wife came back and uh, and I was able to fall asleep because yeah, the kid wouldn't sleep really to be honest. Uh, and then I, I was laughing to like fucking fucking late, you know. Uh, but here I am. I uh, I wasn't going to stream today. I was going to focus on trying to f fix my sleeping schedule here. But then I thought, and it was kind of weird. I just fixed the internet. Uh, well, I didn't fix shit. Yedge did. My friend Yedge from Scotland found a problem. And it's kind of weird. I, I'm excited to stream, you know, so I just kind of want to stream. So I don't, I, I think if I stream later, oh, sorry, later, late, a little, if I stream late, I think it's better than no streaming. But I'll be working on on streaming earlier. Okay, uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead go ahead and save. I do tend to save a lot in this game. I do, I do need to be watch out for that saving excessively. Uh, the liquor's in there. I don't know. Just I don't want to repeat the whole intro. So I'll do a save here for now, and I'll try to be a little bit more economical with the saves here. Love the game yesterday. The stream yesterday was great. It's great to be able to stream and be left in peace, you know, without worrying about the internet dropping off and none of that shit, you know. It's been a dream. And to, to wake up this morning, I had a computer on, test the internet, and see that everything is just working perfectly and sta stabilized. It's just, it's, I'm, I'm very grateful, man. I just, I'm over the moon. I really am. I don't, take uh, things for granted so I, I will always be very thankful to remember the shitty internet that I had and how good it is now you know it's it's fucking awesome uh, you might see uh, I have noticed obviously that I'm not using the DualShock and this is the DualShock edition I didn't have the, the regular one on my uh, my SD card here this is the X station there's no disc spin in here take a look at that this when I was a kid man I was like, fuck, what the fuck was that? Summer Teeth says the internet got fixed. Yep, we're back to 10, it p 60, and shouldn't be any problems here. Hopefully, it should stay that way. So the problem, if anybody missed, it was the, the router and this angle here. One thing is cool about, about Resident Evil is you, most of the time, since the first one, you can actually hear the enemies before you see them. And it gives that uh, sort of sense of apprehension, you know. It's pretty cool. There we go. So for me, it's tank controls all day. I'm not interested in playing uh, older Resident Evils with uh, analog, and it includes N64. I know it makes the game easier, but I'm just not into it. For me, tank controls make sense, and I love them. Uh, for this type of game here, so I'm fine with it. So the cord, oh y'all know that. Had his mission since I have been twisted off. When I read that too, when I was a kid, I thought, holy shit, something's a coming. There it is, the iconic scene. Shit, I should have tried that door. Give me that herb. Give me that herb. Shit. Shit. You're fucking around. Get out of here. Fucking liquor. 
He did hit me one time. But that jump of his, that reminds me of uh, the hunter in the first Resident Evil. Just one fucking jump sometimes. Or one slide and just your cuts your head clean off. Fuck. It's so, then it, it adds a fear factor because, you know, when you're around a hunter, you never know when you're going to die immediately. And this shit here, too. I'm always shitting bricks coming through here. All right? <laughs> With the, the arms come out of the den. I also learned recently that you can actually shoot them. I tell you what, I, really, I, I, I enjoy watching a lot of... I uh, can't believe I'm already on... Took all those bites in the beginning. Idiot. Operation Report. Try to read those quickly. Uh, the Raccoon's police department was unexpectedly attacked by zombies. Many have been injured, even more killed. During the attack, our communications equipment was destroyed, and we no longer have contact with the outside. We have decided to carry out an operation with the intent of rescuing as many survivals, as many possible survivals, as well as to prevent this disaster from spreading beyond Raccoon City. That ship has sailed. The details of the operation are as follows. Security of armaments and ammunition, Chief Irons has voiced concern regarding the issue of terrorism with a series of recent unresolved incidents. On the very day before the zombie, zombies attack, he made the decision to relocate, relocate all weapons to scatter intervals throughout the building as a temporary measure to prevent the possible seizure. Unfortunately, this decision has made it extremely difficult for us to locate all the ammunition uh, caches. Uh, it has become our top priority to recover these scattered munitions to unlock the weapon storage. As stated earlier, it will be extremely difficult to secure all the ammunition. However, a considerable supply still remains in the underground weapon storage. Unfortunately, a lot of fucking unfortunates here. The person in charge of the card user access the weapon storage is missing and we have been unable to locate the key. One of the breakers went down during the battle and the electronic locks are not functioning in certain areas. It has become a top priority to restore the power in the power room and secure those locks. Recorder David Ford. Oh, and there's more. 1 p.m. The West Barricade has been broken through and another exchange ensued. We shouted the injured in the confiscation room on the first floor temporarily. Twelve more people were injured in the, in the battle. Three additional people, they're getting fucked here, were ki killed following the sudden appearance of, a, uh, of an as yet unknown creature. That's a liquor, right? This creature is identified by missing patches of skin and razor-like claws. However, its most distinguishing characteristic is its lance-like tongue. I like how in the remake they showed those two fellers dying. That was pretty cool. Capable of piercing a human torso in an instant. Their numbers as well as their location remains unknown. We have tentatively, tentatively, never used that word before, named this creature the Laker and are currently in the process of developing countermeasures to deal with this new threat. Tentative, tentative, tentatively. I don't read books. <laughs> Gotta learn that word. All right. I love the environments. They look, I know there's a tiny bit of more array. Let me know if it bothers you too much because I like, it's a constant dance here between the more array on the screen and making sharp. So I got rid of the more array earlier, but it was way too, um, kind of way too soft for me, you know, so I, but let me know. Any technical problems, if you're one ear, anybody using headphones, if it's on two ears, uh, if everything's working, just let me know. Please don't be afraid, let me know. It always bothered me to this flag. Uh, it's kind of not, <laughs> it's not hosted correctly here, is it? They also change a little bit. This you should be, um, you should look like Coca-Cola. And I think they got scared of maybe getting sued. Uh, so I don't remember where everything is. I don't play this game religiously. So I'll be looking around and mashing the uh, cross button here all the time to make sure I don't miss anything. There we go. Such as this, you know. I can possibly remember where everything is. Uh, good to see you, foul deed. Your mother's a liquor, you motherfucker. You see what you did, you cunt and daughter? <laughs> the exorcist. Fireplace, all painting, painting hangs above it. The title is A Sacrifice to the Hellfire. Do we have a lighter with us? Yeah, he does. Audio, audiobooks are good. I like audiobooks. I used to listen to audiobooks. 
you should work in Nevada and we'll be on a truck for a long time installing furnaces all around the what is Washoe County uh, area and um, I'll be listening to a lot of talk radio and um, with my boss and his uh, Silverado and uh, a lot of audiobooks are pretty good and one time when I used to work at a warehouse I used to uh, listen to audiobooks all the time and it really helps the time go by while you're doing picking and sorting packages you know are you sure there's nothing here Leon how is that caution eh? oh, I gotta be careful I shit man I don't know, you take an herb from that liquor area, but he ends up hitting you, so I don't know if it's worth it, because you're going to have to use at least a... There we go. Fucks. <laughs> okay. I do get scared even with the old games. I don't know if it's not about it. I get very immersed in it. In it. Isn't that the county from, you know, country for old men? No, if I recall well, I like that movie. That, um, the movie set in West Texas but it was actually shot in New Mexico. So it was just pretty much a similar biome, just a different state. Washoe County, Washoe County is where Reno, Reno is. Fuck. Those here, I just kill them all. I don't, I don't see the point of leaving them alive here. You, you use this hallway quite a bit. Keep pressing start here. I always try to reload it here. Yeah, miserable sack of shit. There we go. Get down! I love shooting zombies. Something about it. You faker. There we go. Yeah, no country for old man. That was a good one. That was a good movie. I like that actor. I liked him too on, um, what was it? One thing I always thought it was funny, uh, Men in Black 3. One of the things I always thought it was funny when you come back, I know it's to do with the memory as a video game, right? But you come back and the cleaning crew clean all the zombies for you. They're gone. So I'm not doing this in particular order. I'm just kind of sailing through here. And let's see how it goes. I like it that way. I don't like to, I haven't played Resident Evil 2 or any of the Resident Evils enough to know exactly where to go all the time. So if you get the, if you get the key, the special key from Brad, if you meet Zomber Brad, who by the way, takes a lot of bullets, um, you open this year and you get uh, special costumes, I believe. I actually never did it again. I seen Brad, I don't, I don't know if I killed him. And this here, listen to this a tiny bit. I'll, I'll be quiet. Because this is, this is art. Resident Evil, uh, such a beautiful, um, such beautiful compositions here, you know, it's awesome. Yeah, I made a zombie, that's appropriate, I made a zombie emote a while back. <laughs> that fits right in, save your progress, uh, no, 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 um, let's see here. Yeah, I always, uh, fuck around with any ribbons too much, I get, I'm paranoid. So you can develop the film here. We all know it's clicking the desk 50 times. I don't know if I should do it. Let's do it, I guess. We got time. And the picture's weird, it's like Rebecca's, I know it's supposed to be a Rebecca, but it's, it looks like her face is photoshopped. I mean, I, it's been, this has been mentioned to death, right? Is there anything else here? No, dude. Uh, is there something, files here? Yeah. Operation Report 2. Early morning, zombies overran the operation room and another battle broke out. We lost four more people, including David. We are down to four people, including myself, who failed to secure the weapons cache and hope for our survival. 
and the hopes for hope for our survival continues to diminish. We won't last much longer. We agreed upon a plan to escape to escape through the sewer. Uh, there's a path leading from the precinct underground to the sewage disposal plant. We should be able to access the sewers through there. The only drawback is that there's no guarantee the sewage disposal plant is free of any possible dangers. We know our chances in the sewers are slim, but anything is better than simply waiting here to die. In order to buy more time, we'll lock the only door leading to the underground, which is located in the eastern office. We'll have to keep behind in the western office since it's unlikely that any of those creatures have the intelligence to find and unlock the door. Oh, but Nemesis uses a rocket launcher and fuel is here, he'll be opening doors. I pray that this operation report will be helpful to whoever may find it. Thank you, Elliot. Still 1080p? Oh yeah, the internet didn't tank. Hi there, Yudz. So Yudz here is a fella to fix uh, the internet for me um, and pretty much save the fucking channel. Sal with John Cusack? Uh, just watch it, wasn't bad. No, uh, I do like a movie with him. I haven't seen that one. I do like a movie with him at 1408. Uh, love that movie. I thought it was excellent. Right? 1408, man. I'm gonna wait for red herbs here. So, is this the... This is not the unit. Is that the, the red geo? I, do put, I don't think it is. Okay, I can't remember. And again, uh, no backseat. I'll figure it out. I'm trying to remember if that's the jewel that goes in the... Um, well, we don't need to be here then. The jewel that goes inside the uh, the unicorn statue or whatever. Oh, uh, let me organize things here. I like to uh, keep my things sort of organized. So I like to put, um, put the healing items in the middle. And that gives me plenty of room here. And weapons, I like it uh, here on top. And then key items, I start stacking them up here. There you go. Uh, I don't use the knife too much. I don't know if I should use the knife. Every time I use the knife, I get fucked on health. I think I'll leave the knife here. I'm no good with the knife. The knife is overpowered on the uh, Code Veronica. That's some knife. It's a zombie movie. Okay. Uh... What I do here, let me test the internet real quick. What I do here, I tend to type the name of the movie if it's something interesting. I'm not every fucking movie, huh? So, Cell, Jean Cusack, The Cell. And there you go, just leave it open. Let me see it. The speed is 24 megabits per second. So we are safe, and I think I'll be able to stream here. In a damn time, I won't. And that's fucking awesome. Zombie move. I do like zombie moves. I think the genre got a bit oversaturated. I mean, you know, Walking Dead and all that. They kind of went nuts with it for a while. Let's see if the cleaning crew took care of all the zombies here. Uh, keep up with YouTube here. The CRT is pretty much what I'm looking for. Nice. Sorry it takes me a while to catch up. I did pop out, pop out the chat. Uh, Rex and folks, this is RGB. Yeah, William, uh, Sundad Moves, this is a good CRT. It's from the 1970s, it's a PVM. Um, this is RGB, this is RGB. I almost played RF today, but I was having trouble with the fine and everything. Uh, sounds like the X-File themes from Thrillers from the 2000s. Now, one thing you mentioned X-Files, H-Chilicon 1. Um, one thing you can find, I don't know if I should go to the second floor right now. Um, where's the map again? You gotta be a button for the map here, right? Is there? Select. No, this is the options. Triangle. Where the hell's the map? I have to go to the... There's no shortcut. Okay. I'm gonna keep her... Ooh, there's a liquor up there. I'm gonna go to the other... I'm gonna stay on the first floor for now. Wait a minute. It's open here. Oh, it's locked. Okay. I'm just really happy. Looks great, Shio. Thank you. Yeah, no, it's it's fantastic. Look, if uh, I decide on 1440p stuff, it's a bit ambitious right now, and I fuck that. Um, if the 5G ever come to this area, I mean, at some point it's liable to come here, right? By God. Now the future's got to come at some point. Uh, 5G comes in here. Uh, when 5G is active here, and that was what caused, caused all the trouble. It is about 40 megabits per second. It's very good. It's very good uh, for me here, and I was dynamite. 
Uh, I'll do 1440p. I'll get rid of the Elgato stuff. And do 1440p. Yeah, I'm not gonna go up there right now. I'm scared of those fucking things popping out. They get me every time. Shit. Watch out. Oh, the liquor's gonna be here. I'm just gonna run past him. I wonder if this is the right decision. Fuck it, let's go. But if I get hit, I might go to danger. Yeah, I I think that's kind of dumb. I don't think <laughs> I don't think I want to come through here <laughs> on, on caution without healing items with a liquor around. That sounds like something stupid. I mean, I could avoid him, but <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and pursue other ventures here. Sorry about that, babe. Hopefully they'll run some fiber optic through your area. No, that, that can never happen. That will never happen here. And that's because it's, uh, it's kind of for this place here. Uh, it's middle of nowhere. So there's no reason for them. There's not a neighborhood. It's just your businesses in the middle of the fucking woods. You know? So what I do here, I'm a living security guy for this, this place. Oh, let me tell you something that I didn't know until, up until recently. That's why I love watching stuff about Resident Evil. This this door here, I always thought it was a gigantic fucking mystery, right? Uh, what What's behind there? And then a guy pointed out that you actually go to the other side, and I'll show you when. Seal from the other side. So this is not a secret room. You actually do go in there. Okay. So one of them is going to be the diamond stuff. Come on, dude. What are you doing? I don't want to heal with one single herb. I try to avoid it, but TV looks sharp. Thank you. It looks, uh, I got the looks down today. Not too bad. It's not that different from what I'm seeing in person here, to be honest. It, I mean, it's, it's always better because of the camera that I have now. If I have a G, GH5S, it would be better. But uh, it is close enough. Uh, the downside is the more array. I mean, I could get rid of the more array right now. But uh, the image will be very soft, too soft, you know. So I'm trading in a tiny bit of more array that you see here in the corner. Like, that's not visible to me in person. That's the camera. I cannot see the more array here, obviously. Well, not obviously. I might not know that. I might think that that's the way the image is. I could touch the fucking camera, but let me tell you, it is in a precarious position right now. If I touch it, it will go black for sure. Is the Elgato doesn't like it. So it drops a signal and then Elgato goes, oops, I drop two. People are dropping, I'm dropping. Now I think that's a two a bus, but two lady bus statues is not the, the unicorn thing at all. Uh wait, I see his mud here. Give me a second. Go back. Hold a mo. There we go. Bit of a smudge there. That's it. Can I go through here? Yeah. Ask for it, mister. Step back. Don't come any closer. <laughs> like Claire talking to the zombie, trying to reason with it. Get down. Is there another one? The auto aim is a bit on the cheap side because if you come here, you're not sure. It does break the game a tiny, tiny bit. Even if it's the original one in Japan, right? Because you come here. If you press aim, he will aim automatically, so then you know there's an enemy in there. So a, a little bit of the fear factor, factor is gone. Uh, so we'll do the film trick here. Howdy, Jess. Got some PS1 horror. Oh, yeah. It's time. See on a bit woogie boogie boogie. I'm sorry about the things being gone. The alerts. I know you like them. I'll try to reenact them here for a while. Yeah, and I'm in uh, an easy mood today. I don't, you know, sometimes, I'm not raging all the time. I'm not a raging lunatic that goes rage all the time at stream. So sometimes I'm, a, I'm a, you know, I have my moods. And today's an easy mood. I'm playing a game I really like. 
So pardon me if I sound a tiny bit boring sometimes. I can be like, whoa, jingling keys here all the time. You know what I mean? Sometimes I'm, I'm in an easy mood and just relaxing. So let's read that. Barry Strofe is one of them reads Marksman Contest winner, Chris Radfield. I like this picture here. There you go. So we can see Wesker, Jill, Forrest, Barry. There's Brad. I don't know some of those other folks. I wonder if this one is the, the black guy Dewey. That's supposed to be, it wasn't a prototype. Yeah. Very cool. I wonder if those are real people. I think this looks drawn. It's all very interesting. I like too how they're pursuing the, the, uh, the actors, you know, and trying to find them. And they found some in, in Jill. There you go. Got to look around, Ross. Got to look around. So you check the table 50 times, I think. I, To be honest, I never bothered. I, I think I did. I remember having it. So I'll have a smoke and we'll check it 50 fucking times. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, so you get... You do this here for a long time until you get an item. It's a bit of an Easter egg here. I think 50 times a bit overboard. I mean, I could have done it like, I don't know, 10 fucking times or something. This is a really one of that hidden. And the rewards, look at the CRT hanging in there. Is, is, is that one of those side speakers? So yeah, this is a, uh, wow, they really wanted to hide this shit. His first and last four filler. I've been tempted to get the GameCube version of the RE2. There we go. We got the thing. Is it was it 50? It didn't feel like 50. I um, we were talking about that a bit earlier. So it has higher assets, and you can with Swiss. If you, I don't know if you're doing real hardware, but I, I get, if you're doing this on CRT, it might be an interest to um, lower the resolution to 240p. So you're going to have the the OG game on the CRT. Uh, but with higher quality, than, much higher quality than this. So I don't know, is the original one in... So if you play the GameCube and it don't force it to 240p with Swiss, is 480i? I know 480p would be available, right? But 480i, really? Probably reflects the owner's personality. It's true. You can, see a lot, you can tell a lot about people by just little things. Chris's Diary. I talked to the chief today, and once again, he refused, but he refused to listen to me. I know for certain that Umbrella conducted t virus research in that mansion. And the one, in fact, it turns into a zombie. But the entire mansion went up in that explosion, along with the incriminating evidence. Since Umbrella employs so many people in town, no one is willing to talk about the incident. It looks like I'm running out of options. We've been receiving a lot of local reports that about strange monsters appearing uh, at random throughout the city. This must be the work of Umbrella. With the help of Jill and Barry, I finally obtained information vital to this case. Umbrella has begun research on the new G-Virus, a variation of the original T-Virus. Haven't they done enough damage already? We talked it over and have decided to fly it. Uh, to the main um, umbrella headquarters in Europe. I won't tell my sister about the strip because doing so could put her in danger. Please forgive me, Claire. It's a recurring theme that he says, please, please forgive, forgive me, Claire. He's very protective of his sister. And of course, the premise of Code Veronica has been set. And another thing, if you play the Nintendo 64 version uh, that came in very late, they, they add a lot of files that get into the Code Veronica stuff. It's pretty cool. That is not available on the PlayStation because, you know, Captain Hindsight and all that. So, yeah. I got a device that can use the digital output in the GameCube. Which one you have? I have that, too. I have the GCHD MK2 by Eon. Uh, and I really love that device. There you go. There's a unicorn metal. It's not a fucking gem. Oh. Good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not going to find your brother here after all. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up 
Look for any survivors and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. I can't believe what is happening to this city. All right, CRT, CRT 4K, you just rated the channel. Oh, you're streaming out there. What were you playing, CRT 4K? Thank you, welcome in Raiders, and let's play some Resident Evil on an old 1970s PVM with PS1. Um, if you come from CRT 4K, you already know what the deal is. Um, pretty much the same thing. Not as good, but I do... Uh, you know, do a bit the best that I can. Uh, CR Team 4K, I love this VVM. I remember you mentioned it. I, I was going to use another one, but I couldn't find a cable for it. And so I just went, oh, I think this kind of fits in, right? So you're doing one world per day. Uh, what were you doing today? Which world you're, you're in? Retro Prius, Bit Prius, HDMI. That's a good one. Cheetah Con 1, I know that one. How far are you into this game? Just started. Started not long ago. I've been streaming for not even an hour. 50, 52 minutes. So just kind of started. Yeah, 52 minutes ago. Um, there's the glasses. Must be where they get information. This is the first aid spray here. The amusement park. Oh, that area. You know. It's very memorable for me, the uh, amusement park, because when I had a DK um, C2 cartridge back in the day, I didn't have a battery. It was defective. Uh, it was the first mod I ever did, which I put a battery in there. And but for a long, for the longest time, I wasn't able to save. So what happened is I would get to. Oh, I think there's a shotgun here, right? I think. Yeah, yeah. Life is cool sometimes. So I could only get to the amusement amusement park in one day as a kid. Uh, I tried to keep my hardware on, the Super Nintendo on, but because of the light, they turned it off. My aunt, they were very, they were freaked out about the electric. And I even tried to put some clothes around one time in disguise, and I got I got beat up for that because she, she called me a liar and then turned off the, <laughs> turn off. I want, so made in heaven, there's a jacket. I think it's uh, Chris's jacket from the first one. I can't believe what is happening to this city. You better believe it. It's happening. Good chances her boyfriend. I think we got everything here, but I want to make sure. I always like to make sure. I don't care if I'm wasting time. I don't care about the fucking ranking. If I care about the ranking, I'll play very differently, right? We already seen that. Um, making sure there's nothing here. We got the film. You know, this film is here. I remember doing that with the Genesis. Yeah, <laughs> it was, uh, yeah, it's miserable when you don't have a, a battery and all the saver games. And you, you, yeah, that, and another experience I have with that, let me drink some Coke here if y'all don't mind. Uh, another experience I have with uh, Donkey Kong 2 is, uh, and that's kind of recent, about, I don't know, 2018 or something. I tried to play with my cousin uh, via Hamachi with emulators, and it just didn't work very well because of the lag. So, and that ties in with, with, with the place you're at right now, because the, um, the amusement park it has that part with the carts and uh, the lag, it was impossible to beat. And then it turns out, about a year later, so my cousin, the same one actually came in, came here in person, spent a month here. We should live in a different trailer, but the same place. And we, we played a game this time, no online on the emulation on, on a real Super Nintendo, using my 25 inch screen to Tron. And we beat the level first try. It makes such a such a big difference, you know. Maybe it improved by now, but at the time there was so much lag. It was it was playable, but just barely. Evil Alex says, "Howdy, Mister 4G. I am 4G man. I am very surprised of how well the 4G holds up." And it's it's great. I'm I'm very thankful. Again, I just I'm over the moon with the internet working. I'm being able to stream now. It's just so it's so peaceful, you know. So I just head on out. How about the fax here? Does the fax machine do something? Uh, sir. 
If you come, if you come back, is she still there? Or does she dematerialized? No, she's still there. Well, we're right. Are you going to make a stream schedule now? I do want to, and I, I will. Uh, I need to work my way towards it, though, because uh, the last fuck up was I corrected my time because I'm a night owl by nature. Uh, I, but I corrected my time because it's good for me and my family, you, you know. And then what happened is I came here, and I was very excited to stream. And I was like, finally, I woke up. It's daylight, you know, it's morning, and I can stream. And then what happened is the Internet got fucked for eight fucking hours. I couldn't stream trying the whole day. And being here with the CRT on, the console on, and ready to go. What time they have done, everything done. Couldn't do it, you know. And uh, and then when it finally was after eight o'clock, it started working again. And then because I was so eager to stream, I went on the stream. But, you know, about two, three hours in, I was, I needed to go to sleep. I usually would have gone to sleep. But no, I streamed for like a gazillion fucking hours. And then that fucked up my whole whole operation. So this week I'll be trying to today I'll try and progressively to go to bed a little bit earlier, you know, and see what what I can do here. Um, yeah. So I do I definitely do want to work towards a schedule. I, I, it's important, right? If you if you're taking this kind of semi series, you know. Reminds me of a CR2 YouTubers that plays Resident Evil on a CRT. Oh, give us a, uh, Evo Alex, it's fine to promote other folks here. Give us his name. And Super Botter, Botter 66 on YouTube says, one of my first games on PSX back in the day. I uh, got acquainted with the first one, first and foremost, and that was my whole draw towards the PS1, that and Mortal Kombat Trilogy. Those are the two games that I was like, I need to get into that. Uh, I didn't buy a PS, PS1 for a long, for the longest time. I had an N64 that was given to me. Um, but, now probably do a save, I think. I think it's about time to do a save. So let's see the picture, Rebecca. So, so what happened is, uh, most of my friends had a PS1. My cousin had a PS1, so I'll be in their places all the time. And I'll just play there, so I didn't really have a need. But it would have been cool if I had it. When I got a PS1, it was right at the time I exited from playing games. So I didn't enjoy it as much. So, but most of my cousins had it. I lived in places that one of my cousins had it. So in one way or another, I always play some PS1 here and there. Oh, I know him. He's been here. Uh, and in fact, I tell you, uh, Evo Alex uh, with Alexander is an awesome dude. Uh, good channel. Uh, with Alexander, when I was looking to do this thing, I, I came across his channel. Was Well, it was Retropalooza first, but I, it's not a look that I wanted because it was all zoomed in. I was looking to do something like this, and I was wondering if somebody ever did it. And I came across Alexander and um, started talking to him. And then I, that's right around the time I started my channel. And then when I started my channel, I looked up again. I'm constantly looking up, and YouTube just buries you under a bunch of Linus Tech Tips videos. <laughs> And I found another guy called Subtor, who was still friend friend of mine. I talk to him all the time. He's still making videos. His lighting is beautiful. He does CRT to you on YouTube, Subtor, with two R's. And then there's another one that I found recently still. After all this time, a guy that does a, I, I think it's called Retro Scan Lines, and he makes, uh, he mostly does uh, uh, Apple, but he has other stuff too, other CRTs. So. But uh, and he helped me out with buying my uh, Apple monitor because I wanted to make sure to support a VGA and he was very kind to tell tell me. So yeah, there's a lot of good folks out there. CRT and 4K here, obviously. Uh, I don't think I'm sorry. I don't think I had a mod here. On, I keep forgetting I got spoiled by the mods. And in fact, I'll, I'll give a shout out to him because shit, he uh, he uh, rated the channel earlier. Sorry about that. CRT and 4K. In 4K. If you check him out, obviously, I think most of you know him. But CRT and 4K has a fantastic stream, and he, he's doing very well. And I'm very happy to see his channel growing. He's playing some good games. He's got a good personality, and uh, outstanding quality his content. Uh, in fact, I'm, I'm not uh, ashamed to admit way higher quality than, than my own. You know, and I'm never jealous of people. I, I'm, I'm happy. I learned from him actually a few things, and I'm happy to see him uh, doing well. You know, it's good. Uh, so there's a shout out for him. Check him out if you haven't already. Hi there, Persian Air. 
and Alexander Chu on YouTube and Subtor if you like this kind of stuff. Definitely check them out. So there you go. This is the... You know, I gotta say, it still looks a bit weird. But... Um... It looks less bad on the CRT, I would say. I'm not simping for CRTs here, to be honest. I'm just... It looks... It looks better, but still, it's not convincing. So that's Rebecca from the first one. The film D has been filed. Thanks, Rex. I'm having fun. That's what it's all about, man. If you're having fun. You know, I'm very happy, to be honest, that I did it. It's a lot more work. I'm gonna lie to you. It was a lot of work. It was a lot... I had to move... I had to move five CRTs today to get you this one. Because all the way in the bottom, because it's built like a tank. So I stack them up, you know, according to their strength. But it's so nice you'll be able to just have fun, uh, not be tied up to a console like I did the console week. The console week is supposed to, was supposed to save me the trouble and get me streaming more constantly. Um, but the, 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 the internet didn't cooperate anyways. Uh, but the problem with that is sometimes I want to play games on other consoles and now I got the whole that console, which is not, not a bad console, whatever console it is, but I'm tied up to that the whole week. So I like the freedom now to just move around like I used to. My channel used to be like this, every stream. Uh, every video I would change all the equipment um, I'm still not gonna okay no 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 I keep things organized so where where was it uh, I keep it in, in the middle okay so I, I like to put it here so that if there's more of the stuff we're gonna use that now we're not gonna use the the jewel uh, we're gonna use the unicorn I should probably take care of that liquor that guy's gonna be a massive pain in the ass I'll go, I'll tell you what, I'll try to avoid him. If he hits me, that's it, he's done. I'm going to come in, guns are blazing. I'm not going to heal because I, I want to, I really want to find a red herb. That's the hope, and I, I am going to save now because a lot of things happen. One thing with the Resident Evil, if I, I don't save for a long time, that's the thing that fucks me up. I don't know what the fuck I did, and I get confused, and I, where, where, where did I go? What, where, what was lost, you know? So I'll try to save this one time here. I know I don't like to change my setup much because a lot it is a lot of work. He knows. It is a lot of work. It is a lot of work. Like, look, I have to go to the shed and find a cable. The CRTs are fucking heavy and burdensome. And with the way I stack them in the living room, you see the wall of CRTs. I had to dismantle all that shit. It's, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a lot of work. I got a cool idea for something I'm trying this weekend. It's always good. What I like about you, you're coming up with a lot of cool ideas. I'll be honest with you, I'm more on the, on the boring side. What you see here is probably pretty much what's gonna it's gonna be it. But maybe when I get those black and white monitors off your hand, uh, if you still allow me to, um, I'll, I'll do something special, something different. But for now, it's pretty much gonna be this year. There'll always be CRTs. There's, there's never gonna be a time that, unless again, everyone in mass said, look. We don't like a CRTs. They're stupid. You're stupid, and you should do capture. I do get. I thought I had it. I don't have it. You doofus. Sitting there until you want. I'll thank you. It's very good at the reassurance because I I think I could do some cool stuff with it. It'll give me I think some more space, and I'll be a little smaller. So you know, it sounds good, man. Um, I can't wait. I'll work towards uh, saving the money too. I think we'll probably, because you say, oh, I'll, I'll wait until something more worthwhile, but I think I'll, I'll probably focus on those now um, and save money for the shipping. And uh, where's my fucking ink ribbon, man? What are, you, what, are you, what are you doing here? Let's put the ink ribbon, like, right on top. Like, that's it. So he's always there. Let's stop it up, bullshit. So I'm going to save. Again, I'm not going to heal, because, eh, I don't know. It would be nicer if, you, if I could get a, get a red herb here. If you see anything that you ask worth getting, let me know. Yeah, that that green one, man. I want to have a prison CRT. You know, those are those are definitely stuff that that look cool. Uh, definitely. Uh, I'll probably. I think I'm all set for RGB this or RGB that. Uh, the one th piece of the puzzle I had missing, uh, I got it the other day. It's supposed it's going to be delivered here at some point. I got it for a good price on bids on eBay. It's. Uh, I wasn't short of a. You see, I brought the Dell here yesterday, but the Dell is 17 inch. So I wanted, most of my CRT is the ones that work best here with the content that I make uh, are 14 inches and, or 13, don't matter, you know. Um, so I don't have a VGA that is that size. 
And I always wanted a sunny CPS 200 ETS EST something. You know, it's a white little 14 inch uh, monitor, Trinitron. I always wanted that one, but it just never came up here on eBay. And it did recently, and I was able to outbid the folks out there because they're bidding dreamer shit and dreaming there with their bids. And uh, I was able to get it, so it's going to be delivered. The guy's a pro at packing, so I'm not too worried about that. Usually, I'm, that's the part that worries me the most. And so it's going to be good to play GameCube. Uh, a lot of stuff, because, uh, yeah, sometimes the, the VGA monitors are a bit too big. Because I have big CRTs here, so it's not possible to do content with them. I can't even, I cannot literally fit through the door here. The door is 20 inches. Anything bigger than 20 inches, and I'm out of luck. So. Ah! <laughs> it gets me every time. Every fucking time. <laughs> My heart jumps. No! Get off me! Bastards! Did that hurt me? Worse. I'm all tensed up here. This game still gets me, what can I tell you? Play Silent Hill Homecoming and try to finish it lurk here watching you play. Yeah, I'll get you that adventure. My next Silent Hill, I'll play one and two here already. So you'll be Silent Hill 3, that's the next one in line. Gonna grab some food, I'll be back in a bit. Thank you. Uh, CRT 4K and Bon Appetit. Bon Apple Tea. <laughs> Good to see you as always. And thank you for the raid over here. Sorry I didn't uh, shout out right away. Go, go, just fucking go. Mother fucking bastard. Is it coming? Damn it, he hit me, shit. That was fucking awkward. <laughs> that was an awkward interaction with a, with a liquor. Yusuf, I'm Turkey. I know, I remember you. Every time you come here, you said you're Turkish. I got it. I got it, Chief. <laughs> we we hear you loud and clear. Did I forget? Oh, lock beacon. Uh, good to see you. I know I think you don't understand English from what I remember, so that's okay. Just enjoy the show. So I'll go get the... Um... I love this game. It's just nice and cozy. Oh, the dogs will get me, though. Silent Hill Homecoming. Are you are you enjoying that? Home, homecoming. It's all right. Okay, let's use the thing here. I think now go to the other side, and hopefully we're fucking red herb here and the key is not okay and the map oh the map so the, I'm, I'm sorry I, I thought I remember having a shortcut for the map it's been confused okay one explore the other side now ba, 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 da, ba, ba, ba. let it play in this game I was gonna play something short today but I was like you know what fuck it just uh I just want to play this game. I want to play. I've been wanting to play this game. Obviously, when I tried with the uh, with the N64, that failed miserably. Too bad for Luigi Time. There's a lot of them here. There's a fucking shit ton of them here. No, no, no. I'm gonna do something here. That's good. It actually saves me ammo. I think. Shouldn't have been given away so that. Uh, shotgun. I'm gonna get the shotgun. I like to get in there and just blow them all up with a shotgun. Might not be the correct method, but it's my method. There's a method to the Magners. And I, lo I love doing it. It's one of my favorite parts. Oh, shit. Come on. No, oh, that's it. Um, whip. Like going in there and just blasting them to oblivion with a shotgun. I'll try to aim up. Sometimes you shoot them uh, in the middle and they, they get cut in half. <laughs> it's fucking... First time I saw it, I was like, you know, back in the day, I was like, holy shit. Keep crawling towards you, you know. Okay, let's blow them all up. Ok, 
Okay, now that's enough. Say some nice shotgun. I don't think that was a fruitful end of work. I don't think that was a fruitful thing, what I just did. I, I need to see him. It was satisfying, but I don't know. I think I could have grouped them a little better. Those here, I know they took damage. Stand up, you faker! Here's a lot of them. Come on, bitch, give me a fucking rat herb already. So, it's a mixed bag. I like the over shoulder view and story, but the game's dark camera. It's a thing with modern games, like the darkness, for fuck's sake, you know? Lay off the darkness already. The camera's low moving around and it'd be too hard and unfair sometimes with strong and too many enemies. Silent Hill 1, 2, 4, the better. That seems to be the consensus, isn't it? Uh, let's put the shotgun away. I think you're done goofed here. Uh, this here is pistol territory. Hey, Flavio. Hi there. Spartan says he's juicy. Yeah, I'm a bit of a freak with the uh, uh, things here. I don't like to be carrying a bunch of items. I try not to, but it just happens sometimes. Yeah, and I hope the lighting is good here. I had to reduce it a bit. Bit this so this CRT here doesn't usually have it. Well, it doesn't doesn't always have ever. This here has one of those glasses, but guess what? I put that in there. It's a tinted acrylic because this fucking CRT it's it's reflective reflective to the point of being like a neon light. It, it's like think of the most reflective CRT you ever seen in times a hundred. Or maybe not a hundred, but you know what I mean. Exaggerating here. Can I be dramatic sometimes? You know, it's just, yeah, it's, <laughs> it's reflective. So the only way, I recorded one time without doing it, I think it was rock and roll racing. You got to turn the lights so low that there's not even a point of doing this. So I was thinking of a solution for it, and uh, I tried to do the acrylic stuff, and it uh, worked well, and it looks nice. It fits in. To secure it in place, I got some butt Velcro buttons, and uh, that seemed to do the trick uh, and look nice, you know. So where are we at here? Get my side me. Where, where, where are we headed? You know, check it here first, I suppose. Nothing's wrong. No liquors, huh? I'm always uh, apprehensive here on what's coming up next in this game. Shit, wasted a bullet. Okay. And what's always fucked, you hear them, but I'm not sure if they're just here. They're not, okay. Ah! Fuck. The thirsty dark dragon follows? I think I'll have to kill those bastards. There's no other way. You gotta fight your way to freedom. Thanks for following, bud. Back off, asshole. Let them come. If you build it, they'll come. There's a lady, lady of the night. There's a movie, a zombie movie that I watch that has a, a weird ass scene. So this guy is sitting in this car. Stand up. I think they're dead. Never know what those fucks. Ha! See if you have auto aim, that's a another bit of a cheat here, because it can you can kinda tell by just aiming if they're still if they're faking. I think I think that goes outside or something, right? Finally, goddamn. There you go. So if we take another hit here, hopefully don't die, I can just use this. Let's combine, finally. God damn it, it took forever. Hmm. I hope that more array is not too bad. Let me know if it's bothering you. Not not on this here, this here don't matter. It's just my other ass face, so I mean on the set here. Because I think the game is so busy uh, that the more array don't matter as much. Because again, if I, I can 
get rid of it at a cost of a lot of the uh, sharpness. So right behind me, right, is here. Club. So that's a weird fucking door, huh? <laughs> Nothing unusual. Can we check it here, I suppose? What the fuck? It's always something. What's behind this door, you know? I'm always apprehensive. I'm, 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 I'm an anxious. Oh, shit, is that crap, huh? Oh, fuck me. On the other side, I know what I know what happens. And it probably still get me still. Oh, let me see the... Uh, uh, give me a second here. Let me just see the stream alerts. I forgot I'm using a PlayStation. It's not... It's not the end of the world to have the Nintendo one. Just give me a second here. I just need to go to uh, stream alerts and just make sure to cha change the sound. I think I have I might have a PS1 sound here. It'll be a little bit more appropriate. If you don't mind me being as bold to say that. So I've low sound. Let me see here. PlayStation 1. Do, do we have it? PlayStation. There we go. So now if anybody follows or anything, it is the PlayStation thing. There you go. That's it. All right. So let's see what we have here. Small key. I think I'll be able to open that little cover there and I want to part of see the liquor. And you can see on the other side, it's such a cool part. I, I nearly had a heart attack first time I went to that room. It is beyond fucked up. Nothing special here. Is that it? And there's a CRT in here too. Anything here? Are you sure? 100% nothing here. Yep. I like to check everything because I'm, I'm a dumbest fool. There he is. You miss out on things, you know. Okay, so the other, the other one is right here. Oh, shit. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I didn't want to go in there now. Diamond. What's the other one I had? Recent. Okay, so let's check the map. It's locked. It's locked. So I think it's. I, I went upstairs already. So I, I probably wanted those few here. Well, let's go then. Oh, don't forget. Walk around here with just one in the chamber. I love the environments here. And uh, yeah, I forgot the chat mentioned earlier that uh, one of the good advantages of the um, those pre-rendered images that they use here. I haven't been here already. I know there's a lot of fucking zombies here. I'm not sure how I'm doing on ammo here. Let's uh, let's go check that uh, that place. That wonderful place with a covered little desk. I think I think that key might open that. So yeah, uh, so not only do they look very sharp, it's a very whoever came up with this trick here is a genius. And the other thing is, uh, it allows for the, uh, as far as I understand, for the character should be more detailed and everything. You know, so it's pretty cool. We kind of need it, yeah. All right, that was it. And the music and atmosphere of this game is just unmatched. I love it. Yeah, I feel like with uh, games like Resident Evil 2, there's not much I can say about the, the game that hasn't been said already. You know? It's just so, such a great game. Anything here? Nothing to care about. All right, so this area here is all, with all the desks. And uh, there's a bunch of zombies here, so good. We got some ammo. Um, what the fuck? Fuck off. Goddamn sack of shit. Uh, I think I could... Let's, let's go this way. Fuck me. Fuck me, fuck me. You fucks. Okay. Time to 
Eat a lad, you fucks. And there's no auto aim. So I gotta make sure I don't waste your bullets here. So many of them. Lay down already, you fuck. Something in here. I thought something was shining in here. Make sure you reload and yes, that guy laying down there, he's alive. The other one on the other side I think is dead. Stuck faster here. Yeah, this one. Fuck. I think the coast is clear. I'm sure, you reload it all the way. Mm. Spent a lot of fucking. I spent a lot of ammo here. What the fuck? I think they're dead. You want me to safe? I will check around the dash and everything. They should be able to put a lot of zombies here, so the game is fair with the ammo. Herb should have some ammo here somewhere. Oh, two green herbs. Here I am for your money so that I can spend on my vacation. Why my precious money will be used to buy water graded video games. Oh, everything here is water. I only do water stuff. See, so the way it goes is you buy the, you look on it for water authorized resellers or, or eBay. eBay is one of them. And I'll, we'll check the safe in a bit. And what you want to do is the only way is you buy a water graded game and then smash the acrylic tombstone with your with a mallet and then you take the disc out of it and then you dump the disc and then you can use your your emulation devices there that's the only way before hey doing good you doing all right doing good playing a good old classic game here so so yeah man love that water stuff can't get enough of it and my my children my children will go hungry here while I'm buying water stuff. Sell my CRTs, sell the games. I don't I don't get the point. Graded graded fucking stuff that sits on a shelf. You got a file here? I know we do. No. I'm clicking everything. They're dead Leon. Twitching still. I like to do Twitch here. You know, I thought there'd be more stuff on this here desk. Could swear to God, there was more things. Kidding me? That I got nothing out of this. And then sometimes I just miss out on stuff, and I, I don't want to do that now. So pardon me if I'm really ferreting around here and looking around. Uh, I think I got everything. I thought something was shining here, but that's just my figment of my fucking imagination. What do you think of Mark from Classic Game Room? I have to look Classic Game Room. I, uh... Oh, I know, I think. Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, I was surprised it was back, right? I'm drink some Coke here. I was, let's pause. I was uh, beyond surprised that he was back because uh, with the t-shirts and the music and stuff, it kind of dis it was weird. I don't know what happened there. I read about it because there was one time he disappeared. Yeah, that's the guy, right? I agree, um, sometimes that is better. Because I think, look, you have a channel. You, you, you stopped, right? We have the combination here. Let me enter this combination and we'll talk. What was it again? Two, two, three, six. Shotgun. I hope the next one is a file. It is. Police station map. Awesome. So yeah, you have a channel. Benny Vivi. It's a cool name. Cheered 100 bits. Thank you, Benny Vivi. So yeah, you have a channel. 
But see, I got here. I got CRQs. I've been playing. I mean, it's the same shit. This is, this has been for, for, I don't know, a year now. I, I, I've been streaming since July on Twitch. Before that, I was making videos on YouTube. And then one day I come here and I, I don't know. I'm talking about t shirts. Don't show my face anymore. You start talking about t shirts. Well, I didn't show my face. It's not even about showing your face. About your content is completely different. I don't get it. And the expectation is what? That you're going to. The viewers that you have are going to stick around for that. That's what they're supposed to do. They sign up for a type of content and you're not, you stop doing it. You just gave them a big middle finger. I will never do that. I think the right thing to do if you're legit, legit want to do another channel, but it has nothing to do with what you do currently, you open a second channel. That's it. If you, if you have the, the makings of a varsity athlete, then you're going to make it on your own merit on the second channel. But you using your subscribers as a sort of a step and ladder, I think it's disrespectful. But much of my surprise, you did come back, right? Ben and Vivi say nice shooting back there. Love to set it. Oh, thank you. Turning to a grifter had all this content. No, I know about I know about all that. Yeah, I know. But he did come back recently. I don't know if you're aware. Unless he went out again, went on a limp again, and took off. <laughs> Because he was, uh, he did, he did make a comeback, you know. And thank you for the compliment, Benny Vivi. So now we got things are blanking here. Uh, I know out, out here there's herbs, but I, I'm kind of out of space. And if, if I go up yonder, that's all new. Hmm. Just thinking about how far is the safe. It ain't that far. I'm gonna go to the safe and unload. I, I can be carrying all this crap around. Subscribe, like, follow, buy merch. Yeah, I'm not big on that. I don't. I, I don't. I never once ask like personally uh, on any of my videos to like and subscribe. I don't. I, I know everyone else does, or most people do. Um. I don't think it's necessary. I don't care if it improves the, um... Look, y'all grown ass man. I don't want to be here jingling fucking keys in front of you. You know, if you like the content, subscribe. If you don't, you don't. What can I, what can I tell you, you know? Uh, my favorite YouTuber of all time never did it. So I go by that and it's not my personality to be bagging. I'm a very proud man and I don't like to be bagging for anything. Especially stuff that don't mean nothing like like subscribe especially on youtube like and subscribe it means nothing doesn't mean anything because at the end of the day there if you're doing ads the views is what matters right isn't it i mean with the ads right uh, so i don't not only is kind of pathetic is unnecessary heard a guy saying one time that he does the uh soy jack face because that's what everybody does maybe don't do it you know maybe uh, you stand out somehow Okay, so we're gonna put ammo. Let me think ammo around here. So we got weapons, ammo, healing items, key items. First, we're gonna keep the key. I think I'm gonna keep a. Yeah, definitely gonna keep that. So I'm hesitant to save. I think I won't. I will not save. I hope that's not a grave mistake. Raid Shadow Legends. Uh, there'll never be. I'll never do Raid Shadow. I know that a lot of people, every man, you know, has is on price and people do sell out uh but i think i feel very strongly on raid shadow legends um i think it's a scam i think it's gambling and i don't want anything to do with it and i i think i will not i think my, my strategy would be to if i ever get to the point that i get any emails from them first i don't check my email anyways anymore it's just a bunch of junk in there but if i was to check an email uh i think you have to put a business email thing so I won't do it. I'm a very proud man. I'm a very, I have a lot of very strong convictions. I, I don't want to do Sh Raid Shadow Legends, so it is the way it's going to be. Um, I don't want to take the money I, and run. I don't want to I don't, I can't possibly come here ever and tell you to play Raid Shadow Legends and pretend that I'm playing it. Uh, I won't do, I won't do any of that stuff. Um, trying to remember some other, look, their sponsors are good. Um, I would, I would probably, uh, PCB way, well, it's related, I work on PCB sometimes, I'm not a genius, but I work, stuff that is 
not harmful, I think, and doesn't hurt your integrity. It's there forever, you know, if you, uh, if, if you do it, it will always be there. You'll always be the guy. And, and you know, I've seen even some real big YouTubers. I don't know if they're there. Maybe they want a new boat. Uh, they trying to buy something very extravagant and they do Raid Shadow Legends. And I always feel, I feel a bit disappointed because like, oh man, even this guy is doing it. Huh? They got him. <laughs> I always thought that saying like and sub was unnecessary until YouTubers said it and reminded me to actually do it. Uh, I was like, I see the light now. That's true, uh, and I am aware of that, Jerome, um, but I refuse. That's as simple as that. I know there's some things that I know it hurts the you views, number of views, and and people subscribing. I um, people subscribing there, but you know. Uh, John C. Speaking of YouTube, John John over there says excellent choice of game. PS One has so many classes, absolutely. And the basement says cool setup. Thank you. Yeah, I think I don't know. I don't want to ask. I don't want to ever do it. It's against my. It's against my principle. I'm a man of principle. My principles. I'm not saying you you don't have principles. If you ask people to subscribe, I'm aware of that is important. But I'm it's just against what I believe in. I don't want to do it. And it says, uh, I've never been able to say, I'll never be able to say that like a door. Yeah, I can never work as a door to door salesman. I'm, I'm too proud for it. It's my flaw here among many. Um, same thing with a Raid Shadow Legends. I know it's a lot of money. People do for a reason, you know, but it's scummy. And also, I've seen videos, uh, you got to look at his mock creators that got fucked by uh, Raid Shadow Legends. Uh, and did not get what was promised to them. Uh, there was shenanigans. Um, pretty sure it was Raid Shadow Legends. Wow, well, I just dumped a bunch of green herbs and I was like, is it a more? Uh, maybe there's a safe up here. Let's... Ah, fuck. Blocked. <laughs> you ain't going no damn where. <laughs> I'm like this, man. I can be poor. I am poor. I'm a washed out hunk of shit, to be honest. You know, I've never been good at finances, making money. That's something I ever accomplished in my entire life. But uh, at least I have my integrity. Uh, that's They can't take that away from me. And so I, 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 I think respect is very important to me. You know? I go for around a lot and all that, but at the end of the day, it's like, you see me here, I'm very angry with small things. Guess what? One time, we're here in the trailer. Let me have a, a tiny, tiny, enjoy the atmosphere, a tiny, tiny smoking break here. One time we're in the trailer, in um, an older trailer that we had, and right under the kids' bed, but there's no kids there. We only had one kid, and she's like with us, so the, the, it was a bunch of boxes there and stuff. But it shows it was a kid. Imagine if it was in the future. Uh, the previous owner did a shitty-ass job with the electrical, and the, the fucking thing caught on fire. Right under the bed in a compartment. Uh... My wife's mallet, she went in there and yeah, fire under the bed. So I, like clockwork, I went outside, I got the fire extinguisher, I put it out, not a word spoken, my wife is freaking out. Um, so many things like when it, when push comes to show with serious things, or people are in real life that I meet, they're dicks, you think that I'll be angry, but I'm not like that with, when it really matters. Like I am a guy who loses temper, for, gets frustrated with small things, but not big things, if that makes any sense. So I have my certain, a certain code on how I, I act on things. So if I'm telling you there's, there won't be Raid Shadow Legends, it's because there won't be. Um, I know the money can be tempting, but I, at least my, you know, if I won the lottery, you know what I would do? Honestly, not a lot. Uh, I would fix my Dodge Ram. Uh, it needs a paint job. I would get my, uh, the parts that I want for it. I wouldn't buy a Ferrari, none of that. Uh, and I don't think I will move out of here because uh, it's working. I don't see the need. And I don't like big mansions. Uh, I'm quite happy to be in a trailer. I think I belong in a trailer. Uh, I like it. And I don't I don't think I need much of anything else. Uh, I would say do something with the internet, but the, the, that problem has sorted itself. So I, I'm not that much tempted with a lot of money. I don't want to have a lot of money. Uh, it, money is good. You know, I'm not some kind of pinko that says, you know, all oh, money is bad. No, I like money. I could use money here to do a lot of things uh, regarding the setup, regarding, you know, things. You know, money is good, but, uh, you know, 
I'm not saying if I won the lottery, so what, I, what I'm saying, if I won the lottery or came across a lot of money, um, I don't think, I don't think, I don't think, no, I'm sure. I'm very the size of person, so I know it would not affect me as much as you think. In fact, uh, I think the thing I would look forward to the most is that it can leave off interest, and I'll be, I, then I can be left alone and just, I don't want to make an impact in the world. I didn't, and I, I will not do it. Um, I want to coast through life and make as little of an impact and as possible and just, just live, just live a healthy, fulfilling life, watch my kids grow up. That's all I can think about, you know, uh, as far as life goes, I don't have big expectations. Never had AP do controllers, sponsorship. Yep. Yeah, stuff like that. Uh, a hundred percent. No review, I refuse. Uh, yeah, stuff like that. You know. Look, I'm full of flaws. By far, not a very remarkable person, but... But I have my principles. And they shall remain. That's the one thing. I like to be direct, I like to be honest. I'm not rude out of time, you know? It's, uh, the liquor is going to be a bit of a problem, isn't it? I don't know if he can, if he gives me a big hit, he could kill me, and that, that, my temper will go to shit. That, that liquor is becoming a bit of a liability, my good sir. And I think we need to, we need to get rid of him right the fuck now. I think I've had enough of that liquor in there. That's, that's enough. I got a healing item. I'm just afraid of him killing me, because, you know... I have two shots. No, 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 no. We, we have this. See, I could save, but that's what I'm talking about. I, I tend to use too, I think, I, personally, I think, I think I tend to use too many ink ribbons, too many saves, being paranoid and too careful. But then the minute I said I shouldn't do it, I get fucked. You know what I mean? Like, if I die now, I don't even know what was the last thing I did before saving. Did I save one time, two times? No, two times. Decisions. Hmm. I'm thinking here, my own head, if I should save before confronting that liquor. No, nope. roll the dice, live in a danger zone. Welcome to the danger zone. If that motherfucker jumps on me and kill me, I'll hate myself, I know it. Fuck you. Man, this is this is the fear. Fa this is the thing with games have saves all the time. You don't feel that pressure. If I fuck up here, I'm I'll be fucked. If he jumps here and kills me with one hit on caution, it's, it's no good. It's no bueno. Motherfucker! took three shots. I thought it was sure. See? The fuck-ups, man. And look at that. Right on time, bitch. Leaving La Vida Loca. <laughs> Shitting breaks here, to be honest, because if I died here, I don't fucking know where the, where the fuck was I even at, you know? Okay. Well, I think we can put this here. Wait. Is there, there's another like... Well, the other one, if you... Okay, I don't think it's now. And thank you, Benny Vivi, for the, talking about our principles, yeah. That's good, it's good to have principles. And look, some people don't have principles, what, you know, big fucking whoop. There's fucking, gotta be fucking Buddha here all the time with your fucking <laughs> poetry. I'm nothing special. It's, that's just a reality. And I'm, I'm happy with that. As long as you're happy, dude, you know. Yeah. Mm, perhaps a nerve here would, in case I come across a red one, so that was kind of useful. I'm gonna open the doors here. I, so, so this is a blue key. So that, by that logic, the blue keys would be. It's, it's that one right now. So we're right at home here. <laughs> yeah. Let's go ahead and, and try it out. So, see, even this here is reflecting on the CRT. It's crazy. This this one here is very sensitive to uh, 
reflections. <sighs> the environment is so good. Yeah, we'll get the cord here later. And as you know, I don't know if some of y'all might know, the head, the motto of the head is still here. It was supposed to fall, but they cut it for some reason. Okay, be prepared, bitch. Come on. No, this is not. This is the crank. Uh, I was trying to remember if there's a lot of zombies here. Or any. Patrol report. Blah, 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 blah. We received a report of a suspicious individual sk skulking around the sewers in the outskirts of Raccoon City. I searched the area and located the individual, but he ran away before I was able to question him. I recovered the following, item, following items, a small amount of C4 plastic, ex plastic explosive, Jesus fucking, an electronic detonator, a uh, 9x10 parabellum rounds, infrared scope broken, and a report. Somebody's been snooping around here. Don't fuck with umbrella. I report you. Ink ribbon, love it. So I like I like go clicking here everywhere because you never know what you're gonna get, you know. Cabinets. I just pretty much go every like collision box here, hitting everything. Eyes are twitching again. Well, just just uh, just one side. So this here. I always think there's a door here, but there's none, right? Every time I come here, I know the... Yeah. Every time I come in here, I think this is a door somehow, but it's, it, it isn't, really. Nope. Well, ah, I can't believe the internet is just holding up. And a good bit rate, too. So we're going to use this here later. I think after I do this and return... Probably a save would be a good, good practice here to do. My good sir. So I think we we is done with all this. So let's see the uh, the next one, the next challenge. Okay, this one here. Oh, yeah. So second floor, and I believe there's a yeah there's a save room, right? Is it? You go in here. I thought this was a save room, it's not. A safe room. It don't matter, it's right here. So I think I'm gonna save. We did a liquor bit. That was good. Yeah. I tell you what, though, this game I'm somewhat familiar with, right? I, I'm trying to be modest here because people go like, well, if you're familiar with it, then why did you do that? So I'm familiar. I played I played a few times, you know, not recently, but back in the day. Uh, in one time recently with the M64. I'll tell you one I'm not very familiar with, and that's the third one. Tell it, The third one I didn't play that much. I think it was right on the cusp of me not playing games anymore. Is there a... Wait a minute, is there a... There's no save here. Oh no, right right in the middle. So let's go. Let's go ahead. Yeah. So the third one will be interesting because I uh, didn't play. I know I, I, I played very little. I know very little. I know everything about it from watching content. I watch a lot of Resident Evil stuff. I like Sphere Hunter on YouTube. So I watch a lot of content on content creators. Uh, all those videos you mentioned I, I watched. And... Uh, but I still playing it personally. I haven't that much. I know my cousin who loves the RE three more. So I, I think maybe that's it. I'm not as familiar with the. And what, how about that door there? Did it ever open? Let's go in there. Oh, should have saved after that. Let's go go check. I don't. Did he? Did he open this door finally? No, still locked. So the third one will be interesting. You know, because I'm not as familiar with it as far as playing. I don't have an experience with the uh, on hands experience with uh, with that with that game. Debating if I bring that that herb. I think I might leave it behind here. I think Bush comes to show like an just kind of run away and come back to one of those save rooms. 
Yeah. I think having space and inventory is a bit more important. And besides, we're just saved anyway, so. So, I reckon we're gonna head on upstairs. So, this one was. Is that the bit that was closed? That was the bit that was closed. Okay. Now, did I explore this? I don't think I go into the second part of it. Could come this way, yeah. Alright. Let's do it. Do it, do it. Is that a one-time wonder thing? I hate when it crap in here. It fucking scares loud. So I think, um, yeah, there was a thing. It's right. What is a? Wait a minute. So this is a bit that, this all, I've been here, right? Ah, oh, it's right under the stack. Yeah, I see what that makes up. Oh, could have saved here, I guess. All right. Okay, yeah, I think now we should be able to open this here door. Ready open? Oh, it's here. If you go back here, Claire, she's long gone by now, right? I mean, has she? Been here the whole time? No. I picked everything up here. Yeah, I did. Okay. So that's why I also don't do the, um, the candle to get the, the shotgun there. I don't think you're gonna get it later on, anyways. I used to get it at some point, but I thought it was like, this kind of why would I do that? That I agree with you, Stark. It says, uh, yes, the key is useless. Why, why would you keep it though? And that'll be forever in your inventory you have to put in your safe, and even though there's a lot of space there. Shotgun time here. Definitely. I don't want to waste all my fucking handgun bullets. Sorry for the backtracking, but I uh, I want to do what's best for me. And it's right down, right around the corner here, down the road a piece. I'm going to get me some um, the shotgun. Maybe keep the shotgun just in case, because this is kind of, yeah. Maybe keep the shotgun, right? If I start uh, running out of space too much because of the shotgun, then I'll just leave it behind. But I think. There's been twice already that I had. Maybe don't carry the uh, carry five just while you have it uh, on the shotgun itself. I think it's five, five or six. Yeah, because it's a safe room here. Yeah, this is good. This is good, Bizania. So I'm going to keep the shotgun. I think I have enough space here. I, I just want to make sure it's five yeah now it is because i left one right yeah i need to make sure sorry i i'm not i'm i doubt myself a lot yeah thank you i just i want to know i needed to know it's like before uh Yudge came up with the um the solution for for the internet here i was uh, me and my wife were debating about getting the starlink again because if it didn't work that would be fucking rough right or getting the antenna, and she say, I might as well just go for the uh, Starlink. And then I was thinking, well, here's the thing that you only live once. Shit. If I never try the antenna, then I'll always wonder what could have been. 
you know, like I go with Starlink and I didn't get the antenna, then I'd be like, hmm, should have gone for that thing, you know. So what I'm saying here, if you ever have, if you ever want to try something and you're in doubt, but you really want to just try it, because the worst case scenario, you know, it just doesn't work out. Uh, let me equip this here already. Oh, I saw a funny video too. A guy beating Resident Evil 2 without, uh, without walking. And he did it. So by basically doing this. You might not know, but you're moving. The shit that the whole game. <laughs> it's on YouTube. It's hilarious. Some, I think it's a British guy. So just aiming. He does it with a shotgun though. Okay, let's. Alright, it fucks. Okay, now I get the, the handgun. Yeah, I think it just saves me a lot of bullets. Yeah, that worked out uh, very well. Yeah, so I never actually encountered Mr. X. So this here, right? Uh, if you go to the map. So this here is the other side of that place, right? So the statues are here. So that's not a mysterious room. It's just here. I, I actually didn't know that un up until recently. How long did that take to play the game by just aim shuffling? Oh, uh, I think to clear like three, the first three screens is like 50 minutes. And he did so on stream too. Uh, yeah, man, that's a lot of patience. <laughs> and all because he saw an article on Famitsu and there was some video of it. Uh, and the guy actually didn't do it. And it, I, I strongly suggest you watch that movie, that, that uh, video, because they're funny. It culminated with him. The guy didn't do it. At the very end, there's not enough time after you kill Nemesis, you get out of the, the building, right? Because of the timer. Um, I wonder if I missed out here. And he managed to do it by bringing shotgun shell. First, he tried with a magnet shooting, and then the recoil will move him kind of going backwards, moonwalking with the recoil. That's what he tried to do. Ultimately, he did by getting a shotgun, aiming down, and shooting, and Leon stumbles back, and he was able to actually do what the guy on Famitsu didn't even do it. You know, it's, it's a lot of patience from that crap. Commodore Crash, hey there, Commodore Crash, how you doing? Oh, I love this room. I love this room. Because the music, the music is very good too, I, I agree. And yes, uh, G Star, he said that, and I, I thought of it. I was like, yeah, I've always, I've always thought it could have been more of this room here, somehow. And I know we're gonna go up there. Look, I know the game, right? Somewhat, somewhat reason. I don't know, like in a speed run level. Hey, I love those. But I know you're gonna walk there and fall. It's first time, yeah, you bet. I was like, what the fuck? No. Uh, so come on, our crash. This here is a PVM 1300E, and is a PVM from the 90s. 1990s, so it has RGB. Uh, not a lot of TVL, so but it, it looks nice. And uh, I mean the image and the monitor as well. They have a lot of buttons here. I like all the everything is a physical switch. And you adjust. Oh, where? Wait. I think we ought to do we fall right now. Fall and do that. Yeah. Yeah, the first time I was like, oh shit. But one thing I never spoil for myself is the, uh, it can turn off collars and it's interesting. It can leave like just green, just blue, sorry, just red. There's a virtual boy version. You could leave, uh, you know, just, what do you do? Just green. There's your game boy. And you have bias, gain, operate, set it, and sync internal, external. And you have RGB, you have Y. Uh, that makes it black and white. Uh, and
and this is the composite. Composite is not doing well on the set, but I don't I don't use a composite on it anyways. I did it for the commercials, but you know. When I used to do the commercials. So. Just trying to get comfortable here. A bronze plate with a picture on it. Uh, yeah. I'm terrible at this of memorizing things. So move this. Yeah. Pretty much just arrange it like it is in a picture. Yeah, a lot of people play this game a lot, so they know every bit of it perfectly. I'm not like that. I mean, on this here. Um, is that to the right? Is that sound about right? And this one to the right, is that it? There you go. Got ourselves a plug or something. Shop plug. Doing well, thank you. There's something about PS1, how, something about how PS1 games look. I love the looks of it. Yeah, I'm playing through Abe's Odyssey on PS1 at the moment, despite there being a PC port, both versions are practically identical. It just looks fantastic on the CRT with fat scan lines. I think that game looks amazing. I did play it on stream. It took me four fucking streams. I, uh, my problem with that game is the uh, controls. I'm not a fan of. Um, Prince of Persia controls. I see how it fits the game, but ultimately I do think it was a very memorable game. Uh, incredible. Um, way ahead of its time. I know it was overused that term, but it, it, it really is. The, the scenery is beautiful. The colors. It's That game looks fantastic on a CRT, I would say, yes. Um, I make a lot of cases that, like, you know, a case for playing on flat, flat panels, modern flat panels with scalers. PS1 is not one of them. I unfortunately, I, I don't know. I don't I don't I don't like it. I don't think I like it. The looks of it on a big flat panel. Everything else, even the N64, I was okay with it. Send about the PS1, and I don't like the enhancements either, because they have like all 4K enhancements and this and that, and it's like mm, I'm just not feeling it. You know. Mm, what we got here? Oh yeah, and there's zombies here, right? Uh, is this a room like we don't? And then we can go to the other side now. And I feel like the controls are fine. Everything's on the grid. I I don't feel they're fine. I despise. Uh, I disagree with you vehemently on that. I can't stand Prince of Persia controls. I think they're sluggish. I think that uh, for the sake of animation and realism, they they do that. I I hate. I don't I don't like it. I we agree to disagree on that one for sure. I don't like the controls on Abe's Odyssey. I can't stand it. I prefer unrealistic, snappy controls rather than slow pace, realistic with a... It fits the vibe of the game, but for me, it's a major... It's... I hate it. I can't stand it. Yeah, I'll play the second one eventually, but everything else is fine, though. Like most games, I have a thing or two that I don't like, and Abe's Odyssey happens to be the controls. I just... Not for me at all. So we could use a crank here, I suppose, right? But yeah, I uh, defend you to death, you're right, you like the controls, there's nothing. Just because I don't like it, don't mean that everybody else, you know, obviously. Uh, we make a joke of uh, Mr. Leaf on his ear, he said the controls are fine. I, I, I don't think they're fine at all. Oh, is that it? Is there anything else here? Oh, so the zombies are in, uh, down below. It's okay, we need to come with a Crank here, isn't it short over the shit? I think the problem with PS1 using a scaler of modern displays makes the limitation of relativity very obvious. I had a dealer in sort of fuck. With the lower resolution textures like a texture filtering and poly count models look very jarring. Yeah, it doesn't it just it doesn't it doesn't I don't feel it, you know, when I play it. Uh let me make sure I know where in the map. I I did is you know, if it's a, like a pixel art game or something like that, it's all right. Some people like it. Some people they don't. They don't. They don't mind. I want more power to them. I. I can't. It's just something I don't. Don't enjoy. I'll play is better than nothing. You know, it's not like I think it's absolutely disgusting. But okay, so yeah, I think here. 
you, you haven't been, haven't been to, uh, let's see here. I just gotta memorize, so... Right? It's, uh... Well, it's this area here. I just gotta remember to come back with a crank there. Yeah, I haven't tried PS1 Digital. I have here PS1 Digital, but I haven't had it installed. Jerome's gonna install it for me, so maybe, maybe they'll do something. You know, they do have some scan lines and stuff. I don't know. I don't think it's disgusting, but it's, it just doesn't do it for me like the other ones. Just remember being 12 years old when this game came out, I was stuck with a Sega Genesis deal. Oh, that's a rough. So, it's a tough ragged. I want to play this game. Did you eventually get it? Rant on YouTube? I wonder. It took me a while to see the PS1. Uh, I, was, I remember first time I think I seen it, I was playing Super Nintendo in this place where you could pay to play per hour because my fucking hand wouldn't leave me alone with playing games. And um, I looked to the side and there was a guy, there was a few older teenagers, oh fuck, playing Mortal Kombat Trilogy and I saw them with the bosses and whatnot. And I was like, what the fuck? What is this? Mortal Kombat? And it looked awesome, right? And then soon enough, I went to a friend's house and he had Resident Evil. I liked it so much, I recorded on, I recorded on VHS and brought it home to watch later. That's how cool it was. I think I'm using too much fucking ammo here, man. Is there anything here? Adopt, I shouldn't have used, look. Kill the zombie for nothing, god damn it. There's another one down here, but now I can lower the sling here, right? In a, in a moment, sir. All right, Emma, you got my full attention. Wait a minute. Yeah, I'm thinking I have, an, uh, I have a lot of herbs, but not, not a lot of ammo. I think uh got to start doing some of this here, you know? It's a survival war. I can be... You, you gotta go, because you're, you're, you're just blocking everything. I may believe that other guy and try to dodge him. There you go. It's a nuisance, but hey, you know, gotta save some res resources here. Spartan but Stud, have a good night. You're going ahead and heading to bed. Well, have a good night. Thank you for stopping by today, as always. Uh, I got another GameCube, but never open. If it's extra seal, you should keep it that way. Haha. Uh -huh. Yeah, until it rots, and then we decide on seal it. Uh, you might as well seal, yeah, because uh, yeah, the GameCube has some problems with this. Not all of them, obviously, but there's a lot of uh, disc rot. So basically, you get those uh, cracks. Mm, I know where I could use that. Uh, you get those cracks uh, on top of your uh, disc, and that's bye bye. You know. It's a shame. Uh, I don't get seal games, but if you, you know, because I could, I could sit here and tell you, ah, um, games are made to be played. But you could pop this, uh, you could play this game on Dolphin. You could buy a second copy. I, I don't know. Maybe if you, if I had a seal copy, I, I think I'll also be hesitant to open it, to be honest. But, but in the end, it's like, why though? That's just a, sort of an instinct, really. Want to crash it? Love in the background, wrapping all glory. Oh yeah, I put all glory here. It it turns out that um, I love our flag and it, I think it's beautiful. And it turns out that uh, like if I'm wearing black here and there's a black band, I look like a floating head. So <laughs> some people say that, and it's true. So a flag gives out a nice background, you know. And I, I love looking at it. Uh, I accidentally moved one of the stone statues on the second floor when I leaned against it, but the chief found out about it, he was, when the chief found out about it, he was furious, I swear the guy nearly bit my head off, screaming at me like, never to touch the statue again, if so important, then maybe he shouldn't have put it out in the open like that. I heard that uh, all the art pieces from the chief's collection are rare items, uh, literally worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. I don't know which is the biggest, bigger mystery, where he find those tacky things, or where is he getting the money to pay for them? 
I wasn't surprised to see the chief come in today with yet another large picture frame in his hands. This time it was a really disturbing painting depicting a nude person being hanged. I was appalled by the expression of the chief's face as he leered at that painting. Why anyone would consider something like that to be a work of art is beyond my comprehension. Well, art is subjective. It seems like, uh, you know, as much as Chief Irons is a bit of a prick, he'll seem like a prick to you. You know, judging him, snooping around where he's getting the money. Are you the mayor? What's wrong with you? Leave Chief Irons alone. <laughs> Many times I want to open, especially when the Resident Evil 4 first came on the cube. Yeah, I... I would have... Uh, you would think I would tell you if you've ever been here before to open and play the game, but... I don't know, seal. What if you unseal it and there's this rod? I, I, I don't know. Maybe just keep it. Buy an unsealed copy. I mean, this is yours. You can do whatever you want with it, but... If it's been sealed for that long, I, I get the appeal of keeping it sealed. So, Bishop Plug, we're gonna keep it with the items here. Uh, crank, we're gonna need that. Oh, no, 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 no. what am I doing here? Uh, get the crank, uh, get our green herb and mix with a, a, with a red herb. And I think that's about it. Uh, oh, reload the shotgun. Yeah, we can do that. Uh, Resident Evil start as a graphic impressive series and still happens to be impressive in the because you said I just beat somebody just beat the remake on a PS5. Uh, I heard a lot of good things. I I um I never watched a video about it. No. I never watched a video about it. I kept myself in the dark because I think I will really enjoy it. And I have it here. My wife has played on a PS5. I haven't played it yet, uh, but I'm looking forward to it. That's for sure. It looks amazing. And I look forward to it. Definitely. Now I remember where the fucking little cabinet was, a little desk. It's gonna be a pain in the ass. I can't fucking remember where that was. Hmm. Carrying a bunch of items here. Well, uh, I think we'll do the, um, let's do the crank first. I think, I think that's it's around here somewhere, right? Didn't I kill you? All right, I had enough. Get out. Get out. Get out! That's it. I want to I wanna be able to walk around here. Pissing me off already. Oh, that's using my bullets. What the fuck? You mother... F I could swear that I saw the red coming out. Now, there it is. Jesus Christ, this guy's a pain in the ass. No, he's, uh, this, this corridor here is too narrow. I thought I killed... How the fuck did... I thought you were here before... Okay, let me think here um, on what the fuck I'm doing. So, I need to head on upstairs, right? So, is it? it's here, I think. And then go, yeah, that's that room with the cool music, and then head on up. Up yonder. Padoka Game Show Evening Cowboy Internet's too good. It's a bl it's, it's been a blast and a blast. It's working perfectly. It's it's excellent. I'm loving it. It's uh, so a matter of fact, just for the, just for the hell of it, um, do a test. So last test was 24 megabits per second. It's just it's been so fucking stable. It's unreal. It was everything I ever wanted. You know, 23.7 from 24. It's just so stable. That's it. I think the the internet troubles are fucking over. Thank Christ. I feel so blessed. I feel I feel so happy with this man. It's just. Oh man, I was looking to get this, get that, get Starlink again. So I mean, and, 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 uh, and that's for 720 at best, you know. And uh, thank God I, I don't have to do any of this shit, man. It's just it's working. That's you know, what can I tell you? Thank you for uh, for asking. I'm so I don't even know what to say. How how great it is. And once again, thanks you Yuds. So okay, so yeah, use the crank here. Love the environment in this game. Everything looks fantastic. And yeah, Resident Evil has a thing with cranks. Everything's cranks everywhere. 
Okay, and and then. Oh, uh, where did you lose the crank? I don't, I don't understand in here. So you use the crank there, and then it's gone forever. I thought that you it stays with you, and you use it again or something. And I, uh, is that normal? So this part here on the N sixty four is in four eighty i for some reason is a bit bizarre. So just a kaga moves and is missing. It's interesting. I could swear that you you would keep the crank. So this is going to open later. So it's just a tally, but you know, huh? Don't keep a crank, huh? So my my memory with some of this game is a bit spotty sometimes. I'm not sure what it is with a crank here. What's the deal with the crank? So what? It, it's a square hole. The crank just disappears. I hope that's not. I hope that's not some glitch or something. Glad things worked out. Yeah, it's just good. Thank you. Uh, you can play as Leon's PlayStation 1 graphics models and skin on the new version. I thought they would, uh, they usually do, do add that, even uh, Resident Evil 4 has, has that. It's always good to appear on nostalgia, there's nothing wrong with it, you know, you want to keep your core fans hooked in. It's a nice way to pay tribute to the, the folks that have been sticking with the franchise for a long time, you know. I've been here since the first one. Uh, granted, you know, it took me forever. I played... Resident Evil 4 only relatively recently, 2017, first time. I was hesitant because it was, uh, I was like, oh, it's not survivor horror. I'm thinking where that fucking cabinet is. Let me see if it's back here. Is this, is this the way to go? There's a little desk with, uh, and I could use, uh... yeah, there it is. Oh, thank God. I was, I could not remember what that was. What is this? H count parts. Oh, that's that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. So go here, combine, and that's it. Cool. Cool. Okay, now. So I think I used the items that I had. So I reckon we can go this way here then. Explore this area. I bet we're gonna find stuff there. Hand is itching. It means I'm gonna make money if it's the right hand. That's what I heard. Really enjoyed Resident Evil 2 remake. The zombies being able uh, to tank. I did play the demo, and I did I did pirate a game at first just to try it out, uh, and I decided it was very good, and I stopped playing. And then later I bought it physically for the PS5. Well, PS4, but we got the, the I think some sort of upgrade for the PS5. Uh, zombies being able to tank them, I was impressed, I mean, and I found that game scary as fuck for me. It's fucking stressful scary. Very dark and greedy and fucked. Gives a great sense of tension, a lot of tension. That is why I think the Silent Hill 2 remake will be shit. The gameplay review trailer look more like Resident Evil 4 with the game throwing multiple monsters after your waves rather than a few enemies. I'm willing to give it a shot with the uh, Silent Hill 2, a very careful shot. But um, don't forget there's Silent Hill F, yeah? I'm actually hoping, I, 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 I'll be a fool to say I'm more eager to Silent Hill, uh, you know, anticipating Silent Hill F more than the remake, but I think a little bit I should because if Silent Hill F, if they still go on, on with it, does well, uh, that's gonna be fantastic because it, it opens a, uh, it opens um, the door for a new, for the for the franchise to continue instead of just a remake. And so, uh, you know, maybe uh, how about maybe the remake won't won't do well, but maybe the uh, yeah. Am I struggling with ammo here? Pretty much. Yeah. yeah maybe the the main entry there will do well. Who knows? Uh, there was a PS5 patch where you can play the remake with ray tracing or 120 hertz. I'll take 120 hertz in a day. I, I, the ray tracing is it goes to below 60. So, nah. Jazz just got back with my supper. Uh, not only do the backgrounds in this PS1 games look plain on the CRT, the tube gives an illusion of 3D depth. 
to what otherwise is it does it does the uh, digital founder man mentioned that is true i couldn't eloquently put what they're, they're talking about but it does give it uh, an illusion of depth definitely i think i'll save here i think it's a good spot to save i'm kind of struggling with the ammo now that i'm looking at it here's a bit yeah maybe i've been killing zombies too much uh i've been trying to be less liberal here with the saves um yeah, I don't, I'm just not doing no ammo here. Oh, I hope I think we're having good. I hope I get some ammo here soon. Uh, let's do a save here. And uh, we go ahead and have a tiny, tiny break. I need to go to the bathroom real quick. Okay, uh, we'll be right back. Okay, back, just gonna have a quick smoke here and we continue. Uh, I've, I'm looking forward to the, the remake. I, I don't know, I, I, it was exci it's exciting to me. I know it's hard too, it's Konami and all that, but who knows, and maybe we get, of course I'm, you know, what's it called, um, aware that a most likely stink, but we'll see. And also Silent Hill F is uh, not a lot of people talking about it, right? There's the movie too. I actually liked the first movie. I thought it was very good. I have watched it in a theater back in 2006, I think. I uh, really enjoyed the movie. I don't care if it's not related to the game. It's a movie. <laughs> Come off and off. It's got to be different. Um, sometimes it goes too different and things get fucked, but yeah. I, uh, I enjoyed it. I have a small cure. I enjoyed the, the movie quite a bit. Yeah, the Bluebird team. Yeah. Who knows, maybe they'll do good this time.
beautiful music. All right, then. This last news is kind of fucking up here. My gums. All right, so let's drop this uh this thing here and carry on. And make sure everything is fine here. Just a minute. Yeah, it's fine. Everything's fine. One thing is interesting when I bring CRTs here to these uh, tiny room where I scream out of. It's um, every one of them uh, makes the room smell different. Uh, this one is not unpleasant, but it's like a old smell. I don't know when it's on. It's, a, it's an interesting smell. I do have a couple that do actually stink. Bad capacitors and all that, right? Uh, Actually, just one, one of them things, just one. The tiny white Japanese set I have a 90, 90 inch or inch, depending on where you're at. I'll finally go here. Uh, yeah, but this. Uh, fuck. Is this more wasteful or. Oh! Stay down. I, uh, I'm not doing good on ammo here. What a, <laughs> I think I'm doing something terribly wrong. I would say. I did avoid all the zombies. I'm not sure what... Is the game not going to give me a lot of ammo? Is this the room with uh, the sisters here? And that room freaks me out because I'm always expecting the liquor to come out. Ah! Okay. I need to do some of this and... Okay, I got me that bastard. Okay. Nearly got me. Okay, can't go there right now. Very interesting to see a later cutscene of what took place there. Very interesting stuff. So for now, I, get, I reckon I can go in there, obviously. So, you know, come on, dude. The only place it goes here. I like the zombie stays on fire. It's pretty cool. <laughs> so far, uh, Ben and Vivi, I haven't, I haven't, oh, the crows. I haven't done much work on it. Any of my CRTs, to be honest. Um, sort of a, short of a pot adjustments and stuff like that. I haven't had, uh, I don't even know where to begin. I mean, what I do is I'm, uh, so I need to go quick here with the over. Okay, please give me ammo, dude. <laughs> Fucking needing that shit, you know. They're gonna break and touching. 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 <laughs> Get over dramatic. Oh, be careful what's in here. Okay, so that's pretty cool. So here's the part I'm... Is there going to be another valve here? Because... Excessive pressure might rupture the water tank. No, it's a hexagon. Oh god, there's a lot of fucking zombies here. Uh, yeah, I can be... I can afford to go. So yeah, I watch Shango. I watch a lot of folks. But uh, I feel like those people are so fucking smart. I, whenever I watch, it's like... How... But I haven't figured out how to do any of this, you know. I, I'm trying, but uh, I've been lucky with my CRT so far. They've been pretty excellent. I haven't had much of a problem with them. Yeah, I gotta start dodging here. Gotta start dodging, man, because things are, things are fucked. Times are lean, you know. Times are lean here with the ammo. I'll dodge a lot of those fucks. I'm gonna dodge. I'll take a hit or two if I have to. Um, doesn't appear to have been used much. Nothing special. Oh, there you go. Good. They're starting to give me some ammo. It's been kind of thing, you know, kind of fucked around here. Ink ribbons here. Yeah, I like them. 
Now I'm gonna do it just so you can see it. Maybe don't. Maybe not everyone knows the, the game, you know, completely. So yeah, this this door here, and I like the the poster here. So this this door here is is a mind fuck. Um, I want to open just to show you what it looks like. Cause the first time it happened to me, I was like, what the fuck? I I was panicking, you know, when I was a teenager. I think I can still maybe get away. I hope I don't regret, but I even if I take a bite, I, I want to show it what it looks like because it's pretty cool. Watch. Yeah. <laughs> the first time I opened that door, I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> that was a good, that was a good, like a, almost like a practical joke. I hate dodging zombies, to be honest. Ah! Restrict. Come on. Come on, bitch. Come on! Fresh meat in here. There you go. Fuck this shit. I don't think I'm gonna need to come back here. So, obviously, we're going to use the valve here, and we'll be able to access that room. And I think that room will need to chew, if I recall it correctly, we'll need to chew uh, red jewels. A jewel. <laughs> Don't open that door. Very good animations. Well, I can call Veronica to get near the uh, helicopter and there's a zombie. So yeah, so this, this is weird. This valve here, I, I get to keep, but not the other one. Interesting. I think there's liable to be something in there. Ammo, hopefully. It's a complete rack. There we go. Oh, thank Christ. Ah, it's looking, looking better here. Yeah, but if you go around killing every zombie, it's like, yeah, you're not gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna be difficult. So now the fire's out, so it opens that uh, place for us just to go in there. But like I said, you're probably gonna need all oh, the fucking. Okay, here I don't, I don't fucking fuck around with this, those guys here. Just keep going. There you go. Uh, just wish any other game development group wasn't Bloober Team was remaking Silent Hill 2. Go look up any story on it. I already have. I'm aware of it all. Uh, on the medium, and they try to convince them that yourself how they could have made it passable, let alone faithful. Yeah, I think the developer is, you're right, it's, it's, it is a problem, man. It, it could always turn around, but you know, but you know, sometimes you have, look at, what, a Project CD Red or whatever, you know, they did a Witcher 3, which I haven't played, but I'm aware it's a very big and famous and beloved game, and then they kind of dropped the ball there, so maybe the opposite could happen as well. Oh! Sega fan 001 raids with 32 viewers. Oh, hi there. I'm going to give you a shout out here. How's welcome in to La Casa CRT Rex. Death Mark follows, and we got the sound. Let's see here. Sega fan. Sega fan. Oh, I'll give you all an introduction. 001. Is that it? Making sure I get it correctly. Sega fans are up there. We'll give you a shout out. House. Thank you very much for the raid. That's very kind of you. Oh, I fucked up as, as always. As always. Sorry about that. I suppose you have a, a little exclamation mark here. You fucking. I, I could swear I pressed it, but you know, apparently I didn't. There you go. Let that go through now. No, I'm right here. here. Here I am. I'm a real guy. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> I'm a real guy. <laughs> so, so yeah, uh, Raiders, a lot of new people here. Welcome in. I'm CRT Rex. I play games on CRT. So that's about it. Um, everything real. There's no overlays. I change consoles in CRTs as often as I can. My back allows me to. And, uh, yeah, uh, it's not an overlay. I do have a webcam. If the image take care of that, uh, the webcam likes to do that sometimes. But they'll get a screen link, 
and do this here and there we go so all uh it's all real equipment and there's, there's no theaters overlays and there's no, no no fake stuff here uh you know not that i have anything against people that use fake stuff but you know just saying uh scene one scene one and that's about it and i'm um, today i'm playing resident evil 2 on the ps1 this is the next station there's no disc spinning here mem card pro uh no dual shock is a dual shock version when i'm playing with a regular controller and this is a 1970s 1970s monitor pvm monitor uh yeah that's about it well welcome welcome in well, I think maybe there's a delay because it's a pretty cool overlay. I think I just showed it as not an overlay. I'm not, <laughs> not sure. Uh, so, yeah. Um, well, I don't know maybe if you mean the way it looks. Well, it's just not an overlay. It just has a, you know, it's not a picture. I'm not doing emulation or direct capture. And then if I had like a mask, you would see it as well. So I don't have it because I'm moving. I'm too close. I'm always moving around. So this is all real. The whole point of my... Um, my streams is to uh, keep everything uh, organic, even the, the camera is a camcorder, this is the, the webcam. Uh, so everything is the real McCoy here. It is a Memcard Pro, yeah, I love that product. Uh, I do regret not getting the blue one, uh, because I have a blue shell here, and by the time I wanted to get it, it was out of stock. And, uh, yeah, I think uh, Legion, if you got the, the webcam, I think it shows, right? Uh, so no, it's up. It's all is a real is a real CRT is movable everything here is real stuff and I take that as a huge compliment uh, to think as an overlay because it's not um, CRT 4k is here uh, he's right above you uh, he does the same thing uh, even better and uh, also not no overlays so yeah there's some not a lot of us here but uh, you know, we do, there's some folks that do CRT see I, I see this here I'm always imagining that there's a point that a liquor falls down here and it really scares the shit out of me uh, but I never know when okay we, we do I'm always I'm, I'm scared man I'm a, I'm a scared of cat when it comes to games and I'm always like the fucking guy is gonna fall in here it's gonna be a fucking disaster the hands are fake they are <laughs> is the auto directly captured from the TVs or does it come through your mic no uh, n n neither it comes from a SCART audio extractor. So we're doing RGB SCART, and I always tap into the console audio for you and for me. Uh, dude, why you have a low key Portuguese accent? I've never been to Portugal. That's the first I ever hear of it. I've heard things here. I live in Europe. I've been living in Europe for, well, I think it's going to go half my life now, but, uh, but yeah, that's that's an interesting observation. Um, I do happen to speak Spanish and Portuguese though, uh, but no, no, no Portuguese here. Um, Shoop is streaming in his BBM today. He said he's gonna make do more CRT streams. That's good. That's more folks, uh, more folks for the uh, you know joining the club here to CRT. So let me see if I. Uh, I have all three of their memory cards. Oh yeah, I want to get the, the second one, the PSU one, and because uh, I think it works on the PS1 anyways. Um, Spanish, that village, is that a village in Portugal? I never, I yeah, I've never been around those places. I have a friend of mine who moved to Spain. I learned the Spanish when I live in Florida, because pretty much you have to where I worked. It's a hotel business. And you sort of have to learn, and then Portuguese is pretty similar. So, I was just making sure I remember this here. So, police station, second floor. Yeah, I got, I got, I got, uh, I got comments like uh, that are w weirded me out for a bit because I never, I live in, I live in England, so I never get those, those comments here. Uh, I got Swedish, German, and then of course the South, uh, Michigan, one time. I don't know. I don't know. I just when you when you leave your home and you go you go you live elsewhere for decades, you're liable to, your accent is liable to change, especially if you don't keep in touch with your folks and never go back home to where you're from. And it's not important ultimately. I, I made peace with it. At first I was weirded out, but I'm like whatever. I sound whatever you want me to sound like. 
it's probably you're probably in there shiro uh hi there shiro how you doing um yeah i'll, I'll make sure i don't miss any uh any I do have a lot. Oh, do I do have Portuguese blood from my mom's side, uh, but mostly it's Dutch uh, and Scottish. Uh, but yeah, I would like to visit. There's some folks that come here that are Portuguese. Uh, good people, beautiful country, and good food. Uh, I think they eat a lot of seafood out there. Just making sure I uh, I'm caught up with all the raid here, and that's fine. Okay. Sounds Chinese. My wife is Chinese. There you go. It's a mix of everything. I really like this TV. I don't know why. I just like the old sets. Uh, me, same here. And Starfell's a lovely stream we got here, by the way. Kudos, brother. Or Enora Buena. Enora Buena, as they say in Portugal. Enora Buena? That sounds Spanish. Uh, how are doing? Doing fantastic, man. The, uh, the internet not giving me any trouble here has just been fantastic. So if y'all raiders, I've been uh, having a lot of trouble with the internet. So I basically haven't been able to stream at all most of the time. I have to kill my streams because the internet is just ass where I live. And it's just the way it is, you know. And I vape here and there. I usually... Foda, foda, see, I told that one. Yeah, in Arabuena, Espanol, and Portuguese, a pair of beans. So I, I think that's what they call, from what I learned, learning the language, what they call false friends. So I think uh, embarrassada is, um, so in, in Portuguese, is it will be a female embarrassed, right, which is pretty similar to English, but then embarrassada in Spanish would be you're pregnant. So two very different things. <laughs> That could cause a lot of trouble. Like eh? uh, Starfells follows. Thank you, Starfells. Uh, here's another thing too uh, that is kind of lewd but funny on the British and American English is that well, a fanny um, for us is uh, the butt, right? But in Britain, it's uh, apparently the vagina. So that could cause some trouble there. No? <laughs> Think about it. Go the wrong hole. So yeah. Uh, I need to go to an item box here and drop some of this shit. Is just too much? I'm just gonna go in this door here and see where it leads. Are you from Portugal, Starfells, or Spain, or any of those places? Thank God, there's a there's an item box right here, so that's good. Yeah, I lived in Europe for a very long time now in different places. So, okay, we'll leave the handle here with the key items. I do, uh, yeah, I do feel sad sometimes. I lost my accent pretty much most of it, uh, and I only know because I watched some old ass videos I had here, and like, I sounded a lot different. I think, I, I think I should be okay with a with a shotgun for now. Just, just bring it. Uh, it's too much. I'm carrying too much shit here. You can't, you can't go around like this. It's still pretty strong. Yeah, it's you it should be a lot more. You should be a lot. I, I watched an old video I had here because I was going through an SD card or something, and I was like, "Wow, I was uh, a lot more sudden back back when I moved here. I've been in this place here for in this country alone here 14 years, a long time." Yeah, here I never get those uh, those types of comments or It's Only when I started streaming, I, at first I was like, "What the hell?" It's not often, but Sometimes it, it takes me by surprise. Where do I keep the ammo here? Gotta, gotta keep things neat. Yeah, I'm thinking of just... I don't miss... It. It's over half the fucking... Yeah, I need to leave some stuff here, man. I can't... But every time... Every time I don't bring the shotgun... That's the inventory management, you know? It's pretty tricky. Let me think. I'm thinking debating if I bring the shotgun at all. You know what? I'll, I'll, I think I'll bring it. If I if I run into trouble, I'll just come back here and drop it. It's a long stretch of backtracking here, but so be it. 
And I'm gonna consider it a saving for now. I don't think there's... I don't... I, I have a healing item, so it should be okay. Yeah, so, uh... I know the raids is like, uh, I appreciate the raids, but I, I, I'm aware that most people just leave because sometimes the content is too different, but I appreciate everyone who watch here and if you, if you liked it, and even if you spend just a tiny bit here, didn't follow, none, none of that matters. None, none of it matters. Uh, I appreciate it, and I appreciate the raid, Sega fan. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Now, the, the Spanish party is, I'm, 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 I'm better, I gotta be... I'm gonna sneeze. Ah, <laughs> uh, I don't know. I'm a lot better understanding than I'm talking. Talking for me, I find it very hard to express myself. It's tough. I know there's gonna be a fucking liquor that falls here. Come off it. Hmm. I hate sneezing. I can't stand it. It's fucking annoying. Thank you. I'm just waiting on that fucking liquor. It's gonna come, isn't it? Little animation here now, I think. <laughs> yeah, that's why I, I tend to be very patient with my wife. Oh, English is not her her language, her main language. She speaks very well. <sighs> it didn't happen. It's, it's a fuck. It's such a mind fuck. I don't want to fucking linger here around here. Find out what did I even get? Oh, the bishop plug. I gotta go to the, uh... Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna call mood today. That's why I told you. I told y'all I don't... If you see me raging here... Let me just pause it. the fuck? I need to blow my nose. If you see me raging here, I'm really raging. I don't believe in raging for content. So there'll be times here that people, if you just in for the rage, or sometimes you're gonna be uh, disappointed because I'm in a good mood. I do say, though, a lot of times I start in a good mood and then I, uh, my mood sours depending on the game. But I think this game here, I don't know. I don't. Do I see myself losing my temper here? I don't know. If if I don't lose my temper, I don't lose my temper. You know, sometimes it's the way it goes. I'm not always a madman going around fuck and getting red and, and you know. And uh, I have an anger problem. I admit it, and I try to work at it. So it's not. I don't enjoy particularly raging. It's just something that happens, and I feel I don't feel good after it. But it happens, you know. At the end of the day. I try my best not to, but it's not like I'm holding back or anything. So sometimes I'll be calm and then you'll find out how much of a big bore I am. You know, my mom one time, I need to grow up with her, but I was uh, I was at home. She came over and I'm drinking whiskey, listening to Johnny Cash. And she said she was she's a hard person to deal with. She said, you're you know, what's the worst of it. Like what? You're a big alcoholic bore. I was like, touche. You know, and, <laughs> you know, what, what What do you want me to do about it? I start jingling keys and waving my arms around. Whoa! You know, I, I don't like fake enthusiasm. If I'm not, if I, I feel mellow, I just go be mellow. Because you know? some people, yeah, it's like, you have to get an, I, look, I can't act, but I, I don't want to be an, I don't want to do a persona thing. I don't want to. I don't want to have a persona, an online persona. I just want to be me. So it's pretty much it. I'm very happy with the connection. I think I'm so happy that I can come here and stream in peace. That I'll still rage. Look, when I play in the ass and stuff like that, you know, some games are fucking horrible. But I think, I think as it is now, yeah. Like I don't know. I don't see myself losing my temper, getting scared. I guess of having a jump scare with Resident Evil. <laughs> See how it goes, but I, I don't like to say that to you and then I go and lose my temper later and then what good is my word, you know? <laughs> Nobody cusses out things against better than I see. <laughs> Losing it. Actually, yeah. You guys untied? I love that word. Um, well, I gotta put this here away. That's, that's the first thing that needs to happen. Yeah, I don't know. I'm so calm today. I feel peaceful. You know. I do wish I had started earlier, to be honest. It's, I, couldn't, you know, I, I do want to work on my time, so I don't want to like not have the connection problems, and the problem is me not being consistent here, so I don't want that. So today, I was going to try to 
correct my time perfectly and start tomorrow, but I thought it was weird that it just had my internet working again, and then I'm, I'm deciding to not do it, not stream. Uh, I felt I I like streaming. I felt like playing games, you know, that's the reality here. I want to play games. I feel like playing games, I just play them. Uh, just thinking, what are the dangers if they're... So those are the places, right? I do have two rooms to go. There's a liquor in one of them, and that's the one here. So there's a mirror. You know the, how it goes. Well, some of y'all might not see it. You know, I might have seen it, not have seen it before. But it's pretty much you're just gonna burst out of the fucking, fucking mirror. I think I'm. Do I have? I have a healing item here, right? I don't think there's reason to save. I gotta. I gotta. Is up on the save saves, you know. I do plan to go overboard with the savings. Padoka says, you should have anger problems, but I calm down. Kishira says, if you're angry or calm, I'm fine with both. I like I like how y'all can convey things with emotes. Uh, I appreciate that, yeah. Because, uh, yeah, it's not for everyone. Some people like, if... I'll tell you right now, if you're here just for rage... Sometimes it's not, it's just not gonna happen, you know. I'm not gonna, I'm never gonna be like, I'm gonna get angry now because they expect it. That's, that's the deal. No, I, I can't do that. I'm not doing that. Just be me. I happen to be angry sometimes. Not a fucking thing that is done here is fake as far as the way I act uh, or my stories or whatever it is, you know. That's just, I think the point of the channel should be real on everything. So that everything here is real, I'm real. Everything's fucking real, you know? That's the, the whole intention here, my good sir. Alright. Just wanted to see her go shoot just that, right? Right here. That's locked. Yeah, I, I reckon I could go back and actually go this way. But wait, wait, wait. No, I can use the, the shortcut here, you doofus. Sometimes, man, I, I can swear I saw some blamer in here. Huh. Nothing, I guess. And has it been nearly three hours? That is crazy. Yeah, this here helps a lot. Just be able to come down here. Uh, let me see here. Uh, sh sorry, I'm catching up with uh, YouTube. Um, I'm 33. I played Resident Evil 2 a few months ago. First time in my life. I got the original console hooked up to RGB, SCAR, CRT TV. I love it so much. Greetings from Hungary. Uh, green greetings from, from here to Hungary, Laszlo. I knew a lot of Hungarians when I lived in Scotland for a long time up there. I know you should work up there, and uh, it's uh, you know, good folks. I love the food. I been to uh, they invited me to their place one time, and they cooked. I think it was goulash. They love paprika, y'all uh, Hungarians. Very interesting language. She was not related to any Indo-European language. In Saint Lord knows. Uh, Know somebody from Hungary? Yeah. Could you like the uh, Resident Evil too? <laughs> I'm married to a Romanian guy. Good neighbors. Hungarians almost everywhere. It's true. There's a lot of them. I've, I've came across a lot of them in Scotland. I, I don't know. Here, one, I think, once. Always expecting the liquor to come out. Good people. I've seen some good folks. See, it says no much hooting and hollering today. I hate that, the, you know, I might, that might change because the heart thing, I can't, you do put the heart thing, I can't, I can't read anything on you know, the corner, so dumb. Get a back rub or something today? Nah, just, just calm today. <laughs> I don't know, been in a good mood today. Just doing, doing well, you know. Uh, you be you, too many people are fake these days. You're the general, general in the article. Just like the hardware display. Yeah, I just want to be be genuine. I think it's more important than I'm aware you can do a lot of things to the numbers. Look, I'll be playing Fortnite here and wearing colorful clothes and go, yo, yo, I'm back, yo. That kind of shit. I'm not doing that goofy ass shit, man. Let him make the money. I've never made money anyways. Fuck it. 
We're doing it live. Yeah, I just feel extremely to calm today. I think if I, I don't, I won't do, I don't want to drink on stream anymore, but if I was to drink, I, I drank yesterday after the stream, but if I was to drink, a, I think a liquor now, I'll get, I'll get sleepy, I think, because I'm so calm. Okay, let's see where we're headed here. I want to, yeah, I want to do the liquor thing first. I could, no, get, get this room here out of the way, whatever this is. <laughs> I love that. So, so bad. You don't love me at my anger, you don't deserve me at my best. Yeah, they like that on Facebook, get you. She posts that. I've seen that message posted many times, you know. <laughs> People really enjoy that, the soccer moms out there. Yeah. Good shit, good shit. Ash on YouTube says, uh, last time I bought a CRT, it was very good. And I can't read the rest because YouTube covers with a stupid ass heart. Uh, very good. Can't read it. That, that part is most better. I wish YouTube would lay off of the bullshit with a heart here. I'm getting sick of it. I gotta fucking expand. Okay, last time I bought a CR, uh, CRT, it was a very good idea. It was mostly better. It is good. Yeah. It is very good. I love CRT. Some people get, uh, you know, into an argument like, oh, but I can do this. The refresh rate is 120 and I can do this and that. And dude, I just like CRTs. Leave me alone. I don't, I'm not looking for, don't, don't fuck with me. I'm not looking for approval, you know, for commendation. So I just like CRTs. I don't care if they come up with a new technology tomorrow that makes CRTs entirely obsolete. I'll be here streaming on CRT still. It's just the way it is. You know? One thing you can ever, it's the technology that came out at the time with the consoles. It just fits right in. Granted, how many had a PVM in the 70s? You know? so, in a way, it's not realistic or X stations. So it's not like, oh, I don't, I'm not a purist. I'm, I'm not a purist. I just, I just prefer it that way. I like it. Hey, it's Elementor doing well here let us thank our sponsor this is Mountain Dew I will take a Mountain Dew uh, sponsorship because I believe in the product so definitely my basement is flooded it is and it's a big trouble and I need those donations pronto the basement has become an, uh, has become a this card now still oh no no you yeah, need the other place yeah still uh, the basement here guys what the fuck are you doing? Yeah. What? Uh, oh, you fucking piece of shit is a half is a halfer. Damn it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We gotta wait just in time. We gotta wait just in time. Are you faking it? No. How the fuck is dad? Uh, there's one more here. Come. Yeah. You go you go running out there and you you in for a big surprise, you know? Is that my shotgun? No, no, it's not my regular handgun. Step right up. Step right up. Maybe I'm shooting from too far. Does that matter? Uh, oh, no, 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 no. Down, boy. Down. Oh. Fuck face. And stay down. You do eat through those fucking bullets, so though. What are you talking about? Oh, I can't just throw it here. Cool, love it. Dorito, yeah, I love Doritos. I would do a Doritos, but any any product that uh, product that I believe in, I'm not against sponsorship. I, I'm against like me personally, me doing sponsorships of bullshit products like Raid Shadow Legends and uh, Hello Fresh and that kind of shit. That I'm 
I don't think I, I, I don't have uh, the Raid Shadow Legends for sure. I'm not endorsing that fucking shit. I don't care how many. I don't care. How, I don't care about your millions of yens. I'm not doing it. No fucking way. I'm not selling out. Hold my feature to fire on that one. Oh, I got another one of those. Huh? I remember where that room is where you can develop a film. Uh, that, 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 that would be nice if we were able to somewhat mass produce CRTs. It won't happen. It's, it's over. It's, uh, the technology is gone. The expertise is gone. It's just the time is gone. There won't be CRTs again. I looked into it. I thought, why not? I, I had that same question, but it's like when you see the logistics of it, like Sony Factory, the level now, it's just fucking gone, man. You know. But uh, I, I'm here to tell you the CRTs will probably outlive you. Hmm. Is that it? Is that all I got out of this place? A film to develop. Huh. I wouldn't mind, provided on minus every five minutes like clockwork. I know, is that the other thing is excessive too. Like even if a product I I like. You know, it's the kind of thing you go go watch uh I don't watch but I came across this videos. I have watched a few. The line of stack tips. Everything is like a bottle and then it pops up. It's like it's making money, but I don't have to like it. I understand what it's doing. I understand that it is thriving. Is uh, don't wish him any harm, you know, or anything bad uh, towards him. I understand what he's doing, but I don't have I don't have to like it. I don't like it. I don't like. Hey, I I don't like being advertised to every fucking five minutes about everything. It's coming, and I don't want to, you know. I understand money. I understand the advertising is the way of the world. I understand how everything works, but. Hold on to your stocking, skids. Here it comes. There's a welcome, Leon, with you else. Oh, better help, yeah, I, 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 uh, I, I've seen a, there, there's a guy that broke down all those advertisements, and after I watched that video, I became, I became even more convinced, so he was here before, Marvin, uh, I became even more convinced that it's, they're very scummy, and it shouldn't, it shouldn't, he didn't even touch Shadow Legends, but let's unlock this, huh? there you go, um, it was HelloFresh and, and some other stuff, but the, the better help, wow, that, pretty fucked up stuff right there, you know. Grind the Doritos. <laughs> hey, that's Ellie. Alien, how you doing? Busy day at work, and I would have been here earlier. Oh, don't worry about it, I should have been here earlier myself. It took me, it took me a while, so let's go and rip the band-aid here. Where is he? Did I? I don't think I got a second combination. Is there a second safe in there? There he is. This part here. Awesome. You fuck. Let me help you, Marvin. Bitch. You know what happened? I was wrong, holding the wrong button. That's what that's what I'm talking about with the two shoulder buttons. I'm constantly fucking confused here. I'm Super Nintendo guy. It's just, that, I, I, I I rotate alternate between Remembering that is this one or this one. So I thought it was this one. Is this one? Gotta pay more. Not blaming the game or the controller. Just saying. I guess I gotta pay more attention. I suppose. Took a took a bite there. So, hmm. Not very impressive. We got a key. That's a very important item. So I think because we have all the keys. Um, I don't think I saved last time, did I? 
probably best to save. We can't, we can't exit here because of the next door is the safe area, right? Yeah, and then, yeah, do a save and go to the, the other side and that's it. What are you doing? Yeah, right here, we can exit here. Yeah, you missed a Marvin scene. He, he took a bite out of me. I, I mashed the wrong fucking shoulder button. And I blew his hat off with a shotgun. Do you have a favorite was wrestler? Yeah, not one of those Among Us. Um, I haven't watched wrestling in a long time. Big Boss Man. Liked him. If you ever take a trip down to Cobb County, Georgia, you better read a sign. Respect the law and order. Do some hard times. Or do some hard times. Anybody remember the Big Boss Man? Better follow it. Follow the law. So, okay, uh, let me check the map here. Cream of the crop. That's the super detail, man. This is awesome. It's a very good thing. Thanks you. I think the static stuff just makes all the difference. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So pretty much we're going to go here, get rid of that key, and then run actuate. There's another one. Okay, I got you. I got you, bitch. Uh, yeah, I might as well save. A lot of uh, adventures coming up. Uh, I'm going to bring this. So I'm going to reload a shot. Sorry. I'm going to reload a shotgun here and just bring the shotgun. Uh, a lot of herbs here, I suppose. Oh, there's a film, right? Uh, I want to... How far am I from the film place? Hmm. Okay. Not, let, let's do the film first so that's done. And there's a... Guess what? There's another room in there too. Safe. There's another safe room. Cobb County, Georgia. Good shit. I know the big boss man, but I never watched any match with him. Against nails. There's one on YouTube. He fights nails. Pretty cool one. I uh, I don't like any of the new ones. I'm not into John Cena. I don't like him. Just don't. And uh, don't hate him. Just don't. Not into it. You know. I don't know any of the new ones. They look. I don't know. I like the the old times. I just, I like the costumes, I like the way it should be. I don't like everybody's wearing underwear now, I don't, I'm not into it. I think the only one would announce a personality, as you'll see there, like of the old times of the Undertaker, I suppose. So, so I guess I would choose the Undertaker nowadays. But again, I haven't watched in a long time. Still, it's not, it's not sticking. Be that Virgil with it at SummerSlam. Yeah, so bad. A lot of them die of like heart attacks. You just died of a heart attack at home. Left kids, wife, kids is a shame. Source Snacks PC version of uh, RE2. Uh, yeah, no, I, I I check all those mods. Like uh, I watch I, I watch a lot of Resident Evil stuff to be honest. I think a lot more than I should. And uh, I've seen all of those. Uh, some really impressive stuff. There's also the, also the GameCube that you can um, drink some Coke here. Kind of <laughs> the GameCube one, you can uh, force shoot 240p. If you're playing on a CRT, it'll look amazing because those, the assets are high quality as well. Yeah, there's a lot of things that you should be at a lot of touch with. I sure like NASCAR a lot. I've been watching it years, many years. I'm talking like more than a decade. Um, I should be in a college football a lot, but I can't get it here, so I tuned out. Film A. Code G, Human Body Experiment. September 15th, 1524. Hours. Uh, I like to collect all this stuff. 
So let me see here. What am I, what am I actually going to bring? Yeah, the golden era is, uh, you know, a lot of them, uh, you should go to the, I don't know if any of y'all are old enough to remember the Super Mario Super Show, or if you've seen after you grow up, uh, but a lot of the wrestlers, you should go to that show, because Captain Lou Albano was a wrestler, who's also awesome, you know, <sighs> sorry, and, uh, alright, that's enough of the burps right now, huh? fuck me, drink a tiny bit of coke, bunch of burps, yeah, that area. Uh, I'm gonna save closer to the place where I'm going, so there's no sense in saving it here. It's too far away, just in case I'm, I'm do the Mario just like that. Ba -ba -ba -ba. It does a little trip. You ever notice that it trips a little? I've always thought it was funny since back in the days. It trips a tiny bit, you know? You're not a fan of the wrestler, the Shockmaster? And is that new? I can't remember. I can't remember that one, to be honest. Like, I don't know every rat like that. Not like 100% knowledgeable or everything. I watch a few matches here and there. Yeah, I think it's time to head on back, is it? Yeah, yeah. I'm always scared of those fucking hens coming out again. Did they only do one time? I wonder. Let's not risk it. Yeah, one take. <laughs> it's true. They're like, yep, that's that's all we need. <laughs> it tripped a bit, it don't matter. Yeah, and uh he had a very deep friendship with uh Cinder Lopper. And she has been on the show as well. And of course, he was in her Girls Just Want to Have Fun a mu music video. So I think. Did I make a mistake? There's a, there's a typewriter here, right? I think I fucked up. There's, there's no typewriter here. No, there's one outside. I guess I'll just do it outside. Yeah, yeah, there's one outside. Something to do this. Yeah, I like the Super Mario Super Show. I missed out on the third uh, Super Mario Bros. 3 show. There was a parent of Super Mario World show. And my kids like it too. Uh, they love that shit. Uh, I know the Kirby show, but not from back in the day. I looked it, uh, looked it up for my daughter because she loves Kirby. And uh, I put it all in VHS for her. And she loves it. I made the covers and everything. It's pretty cool. They call us coming from inside the house. I, I don't know why that never goes over well me. <laughs> I, I do use that that pun a lot. Okay, let's go. Uh, I'm gonna save by the uh, computer here. I think is good enough, you know. Uh, just in case of any bullshit, I, I can't fucking remember what comes up. But there's definitely gonna be a bunch of fucking zombies there, that's for sure. Come on, Leon. Get it straight. Let's get something straight. Scorpion. I'm a Link Way. Scorpion was an ninja. Yeah, save here. I'm in the save so far. Eh, reasonable. I'm hurting, Linda. Captain N. That's kind of weird. The Zelda cartoon I watched, because it was right after the, uh, the Mario stuff. Right? Excuse me, princess. It kept getting bigger and bigger with the excuse, excuse me. Very funny. Who here is a fan of the CDI and the Zelda game and the CDI? I, I know I'm not, but I love the cutscenes, though. They're comedy gold. I have CDIs here. I need to read your mod. They're pal, so I need to read your mod. Oscar the Grouch says, how's a spooky game? That's very spooky. It's as spooky as it gets. I still, even chatting here and all that, I still get suckered in the atmosphere. I think I do have more, like I get sucked in more into the game if I'm uh, playing alone. Right? Then I'm completely immersed. Yeah, right here. Right here, brother.
Yeah, uh, I'm sorry about the more pattern. And how are you watching this? If you if you have here's the thing, if you have more array on those sets and you are watching uh, windowed or even worse than a slow, uh, like lower resolution, the more array gets worse. You actually get more array that's not even there, like not even on the full picture. Uh, but I can see here at 10 full, 80, uh, full 1080p on my monitoring monitor. And it's, uh, yeah, I can see the more array. So basically, uh, here, there's some more array here, obviously I'm not in person. Uh, but I felt like I can't live with this because if I adjust the camera to get rid of it, going out of focus, it's, it's too out of focus for me. And this is a, what you're seeing here is almost as sharp as what I'm seeing, so I want to keep it that way. Unless somebody, unless a lot of people tell me that's ass and looks like trash. So basically, with the focus, when you move the focus here, because the way the CRTs are, you will get no more array here, but then you get a lot of more array here. So obviously, I want to prioritize the uh, game image. Uh, over my fucking ugly mug, you know? Okay. Right down here, my good sir. Right down here. Yeah, here I think there'll be a lot of times there'll be more array on this. Thank you for the feedback, everyone. Seen the trailer for the new Aliens movie? Uh, look, man, I love the uh, top favorite fucking movie alongside the Matrix, but who is directing it? I mean, I mean, I haven't seen the trailer. Not worry about it, just mention it. No, 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 thank you, don't, don't worry about it. I, I never get offended by anything here. Mansion away. If something here look like shit and you tell me it look like shit, I'll look into it. 100%, so I don't, don't, don't worry about it. You never have to save face here, my chat. You can say whatever you want with limitations. Uh, let me see here. Uh, catch up with your tube. Uh, anything there? Uh, eating tacos for dinner tonight. No, not Waluigi tacos. Too bad, Waluigi time. <laughs> I want to play that. I want to play the Waluigi taco game, Waluigi taco, but it's, uh, it's very unstable. It crashes a lot. Just have a smoke here real quick. Don't worry about the time. The time is counting, but it, you know, there's a smudge here. Where the fuck do those things keep coming from? Oh, now you've done it. The fuck? How come I never noticed this before? Is that a scratch? The thing is replaceable, though. It's not the actual screen. It looks like a piece of dust is inside. Well, that's gonna drive me fucking crazy now. Hmm. Prepare your ears. N look, I'll do do you a favor. Just give me a second. I wanna. I think it's a piece of dust or something, or some insect. Uh, let me mute this here for a minute, and you'll know why as soon as you see it. I got it, Chief. It's gone. It was a piece of dust I got in between the screen and the 
the glass here. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Piece of shit. Some Spanish guy thing. Huh, I'll look into it. Fed Alvarez. No, as long as it's not the, the, the main guy, because uh, uh, Cameron? Obsessed with the fucking AI shit. Uh, Black Patron, hi there. It's this beautiful set you got there. Oh, thank you. It's a vintage, this one. Good stuff. Obedetsu. How you doing? Doing alright? First time chat, good to see you. I'll check the Aliens trailer, new Aliens, but I don't know. I'm not too excited about Aliens, to be honest, anymore. The Prometheus and this and that, and it's, I don't know. Yeah, CGI galore, and it's, eh, I don't know. Getting tired of the fucking remakes and come up with new IPs already, by God. Creatively bankrupt, you know. Hollywood, Netflix, more nonsense. I don't know, I'm so skeptical of uh, movies and because there's so many good games. I'm more into games now, more than I'm pretty much it, you know. I think I've watched all the good movies already. I don't know. How do I say that? There's some, uh, I'll take a break away. There's some, uh, I'm going to get my nicotine here. It's kind of hurting my fucking lips. So. I, um... I watch It Follows. There was a new movie with a... Well, I say new from a few years ago with um, alligators in Florida. That was pretty interesting. You know, that was a, was a good movie, man. I liked it. Yeah. So it's not... Maverick with Mel Gibson. I watched that movie back in the day. That's the one. I'm not sure if that... Is a remake of Maverick? I know... The Maverick. I love the Danny Glover and uh, Mel Gibson Easter egg because they like because they work together, you know. Um, lethal weapon, so they kind of recognize. It doesn't make sense in a contest of the movie, but if you watch Lethal Weapon, you know ah, that's the Easter egg there, the reference. Have a quick smoke here, y'all. Directed by the same guy who made the Evil Dead reboot. Now, here's the thing. Which one? I watched one. There were two reboots. Because, again, they're rebooting the reboots, right? I watched one just now. It was the last movie I watched. The newest Evil Dead reboot. But before that, there was another one. Which I really like. I like more than the last one. So, which one did he direct? Because they're very different movies, actually. Maverick, Top Gun. Ah, okay. Well, there's a movie called The Maverick with uh, Mel is a Western with Mel Gibson. Yeah, the knobs are great. I love the knobs and the switches. You can turn off. You, you can turn everything off. You can turn individual colors for whatever reason you want to. There you go. It's pretty cool. A lot of fun, fun, functionality here. Gargon 100 raised with 11 viewers. If I have any mods here, can I give a shout out to him, please? If not, I'll do it. Uh, it's just a pain in the ass to get the keyboard here. I don't have a place to put the keyboard yet. I don't know how the fuck I'll do it. If not, I'll do it. Thank you very much, uh, Gargon. And we're just having a quick smoking break here. And I know this can't adds to my time. I could pause, but it's fucking dead silent. I want to hear the music, so fuck the time. What are you doing? Uh, hey there, Neo Venom. Venom, sorry. Oh, the stream has gone fantastic. Uh, thank you, Gargon. Wanted to raid for a while. Oh, thank you very much, and thank you, Shira. Um, so yeah, for the raiders, we're we're and thank you for that. I, I really appreciate it. It um, it's going fantastic. Uh, I just yesterday uh, the internet problem. I've been having internet problems, and it's gone. It's just like that. It's just gone. So for the raiders here, I'll do the shtick with a with a webcam. So um, can take a break. Over layoff, break is over. Uh, it's all real stuff, so there's no there's no mask overlay. It's just it's all real equipment here, all you know tangible all assets. Just because some people think it's an overlay, but uh, yeah, that was all all real. Just in case, maybe you'll know already. You know, just making sure. 
I'll, I'll make that a thing, so sort of like overlay talk. But it, I'm not a fan of somebody else who are really quite the opposite. I'm like, wow, I'm doing okay then, kind of with the equipment I have here. Are you kidding me? Uh, so yeah, be prepared for jump scare here. Is that the place? I want to make sure I'm in the right, the right place. I'm getting some buzz in here for some reason. Can you not do that, sir? Uh, Oscar the Grouch, a Starlink. Uh, no, uh, Oscar is gone. The problem is gone. The problem was a problem with the router picking up 5G and alternating between 5G and 4G. And every time it did so, because the 5G signal here is weak and it shouldn't be here even because it's not even on the map for 5G coverage. Every time we'll do that, the internet will drop, and that's what my problem was. So the solution, thanks you, Yeds, was to simply turn off 5G altogether. So I'm on 4G, and I'm enjoying 25 megabits per second upload speed, which is more than enough for 1080p60. So there, that's it. That was a problem. I don't need Starlink. I don't need the. Uh, I might not even an antenna, need an antenna, but I'll probably invest in one just to make sure I'm getting good signal. You know, stable. And uh, yeah, that was that. The problem is. Uh, has been vanquished so i'm i know it doesn't sound like it but i'm pretty happy about it yeah yeah it took one guy i called i never thought of that nobody here ever thought of that uh the customer service of the isp never thought of that so surprise surprise that's all there was to it uh it's been two days now and i'm uh, hovering around 24 20 to 30 megabits per second, or pretty much around the 24 or 25 area. So I'll let you, I'll let you enjoy this undisturbed. <sighs> Motherfucker. He gets me still. Goodbye. <laughs> We're not dealing with that shit. <laughs> uh, would you ever stream Where's Waldo? Wally? Where's Wally? I've seen uh, the Anger Video Game Nerd playing that. That looked like complete shit. I can't, I can't even make sense of it. It just, it just looks bad. It just looks... It's like a very bad game. I just... It's, I don't have a gameplay for it. I don't think so. I don't think I don't think I, I I don't mind bad games. Some bad games I even like, like Predator on the NES. I actually like that game a lot. I liked it. It was fun. But where's Waldo? It's mm, that's man. That's it's like shit, right? If it's the one I remember seeing, it's like yeah, you can't even see Waldo in there. What? Just a jumble a casserole of nonsense. Yeah, there's some games that are just repulsive to me. I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I can't imagine streaming that for a long period of time. It sounds actually painful. Uh, hmm. Where was the, uh, so this here is for the, the corridor with a, was it here? No, I don't make it, it's for here, right? But I think this other place here, let, let's just push on a tiny bit more here, see. Okay, sorry, I'm a bit confused here. It's no better than ET on Atari. I think, I think it's worse because ET on the Atari, there's at least some gameplay. You can, you can make, look, there's some games on the Atari you can make a lot of gameplay out of it by doing challenges. Like actually beating Pitfall, the original Pitfall is actually quite fucking hard. Don't believe me, go look it up or go try it yourself. Find it, go not, you barely have time. So, I played it once for a couple of hours, it was before I streamed, I was streaming. But where's Waldo, you're just staring at a bunch of nonsense, if I, if that's the correct game on the NES. And, and you're trying to find Waldo, and it's, it's weird, it's like, did you even find Waldo? Like, sometimes you find him, and it's like, was that, I don't even know. It, it didn't translate well, it just looks like a terrible thing, a very boring, horrible chore. Uh, E.T. wasn't that bad once you get the idea behind it, believe it or not. I think E.T., I played it and it's bad. <laughs> I think you can have fun with bad games, but you still have to be aware. Like, 
I think E.T. is bad. I disagree. I, I think E.T. is a terrible game that was rushed and it was is not fun. It's... I don't like it. Uh, but you could like it. I get it. You could like E.T. I can see somebody liking E.T. You could do the challenge. Maybe I could even like E.T. at some point. But, but you still have to acknowledge that for the most part it's a bad game, right? I mean, Predator, I just said I liked it, but it's it's a bad game. It's, it's, not, a, it's not a good game. It's, there's no good des game design in there. It's fun, but without being good. Yeah. I sure came across, just came across EVGN about a year ago. I've been to a ton of those. Yeah, I, I tend to, I, 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 the new shit, I don't, I don't want nothing to do with it. Uh, but the, the older stuff is still gold. I haven't watched it in a long time, but, but the old stuff is, is gold stuff. Just unfinished. Yeah, the problem with tie, you know, games that tie in with movies is that they're, they're, they're just, it's like all that LJN crap. They're just, uh, they're riding the, well, I thought I had, what the fuck is this here then? What? Oh, it's the red one. The red one. Right here. Okay, let's go get the red one then. My mistake. Break over lays off, yeah. Are people not liking this new material? Plenty of people. There's a whole gigantic Reddit about it. That people that don't like this new material. This new material, I'm sorry, this new material is atrocious. It is horrific. Uh, some real bad stinkers there, man. I, look, I'm like this, man. I love Family Guy. Loved Family Guy. And the new stuff, the minute stops being funny, I'm out. Uh, I mean, I'm... It, I don't have loyalty to shows or platforms or anything like that. So the minute you're you're doing shit and you're phoning it phoning it in, I'm I'm out. I'm, I don't want to watch it. So his old stuff is great, but his new stuff no. Nothing to do with him as a person. He's, he's a good guy from what I hear. So, but his new stuff, yeah. Is, uh, I don't obsess. By the way, I'm aware of Reddit, but I'm not part of it. I don't comment there. I don't want to be involved with it. I do enjoy reading it, and the memes are funny, right? But, uh, yeah. Mm, I think we're gonna go to a new place here. A brand new place. Fuck it, let's just go check. No, no, no. Uh, we got too much shit here, man. We gotta dump this crap. Sorry, this is fucked. We got too much crap in here. It's too much stuff. You're carrying too much shit, and this is not gonna. There's no point. I'll give it a go. Just let you know my opinion. I'm not sure what season I'm on. The problem with that, well, it, it might be better. I mean, the problem with it is if you watch the nerd for for a very for many years, right? And then you can see the steady decline. It's a lot harder to notice, but I did notice. Life, but I did stick with it more than I should have, in my opinion. I should have, because um, you, you like the guy, you like the show, right? But I tend to keep myself in check with uh, clinging on to something that is not good anymore. So I don't think Family Guy is good anymore. I don't watch it. It got preachy, it got not funny. It's just ultimately not funny. I'm in a business to watch your show. It should be funny. I don't want little messages. I don't want... Uh, I'm, look, if you have messages and you're funny, uh, be it. So be it. No, but uh, if it's just not funny and mean, and it's not, that is not funny. Comedy is supposed to be funny, you know? It's like what a guy say, say to you, I'm going to murder you tonight, and I'm going to kill you and your whole family. I'm going to drink the blood of your kids. And they're like, what the fuck, is, what's wrong with you? No, it was a joke. No, that is not a joke, but because, because jokes are funny. So, I, it's like... It's like The Simpsons. I don't understand why people watch it, to be honest. Uh, I, I can't just, I stopped like, goddamn, about 20 fucking years ago. You know, can I watch one episode with somebody who still thought it was funny and not even as Merc, nothing. It was like, that's not even the same show, dude. You know. I never... I will never not laugh at AVGN's B7. Oh, the old stuff is still as good now as it was then. The screw attack is cozy. I can watch the uh, Ghosts and Goblins episode, the Super Pitfall, any of that old shit, any time. 
yeah, they all it is a prank, bro. I was like, <laughs> no, no, it's fucked, right? Do you like Pat the NES Punk? Uh, it doesn't do much for me, to be honest. Uh, not really, not really, to be honest. Kind of neutral, but more towards no. No, I'll say no. Oh, why, why am I, you know, I don't, I don't. Came across his content, I don't. So he has some ideas that are good on the game preservation, but I, I don't know, as a, as content, no. You'll be surprised, to be honest, that I'm not into most content. Even though most of my time off screen, if I'm watching entertainment is on YouTube. Um, look, let me get a break here, since we've got a vibe going on. I can tell you straight, right, right off the bat, what I like. I like, I like, uh, for entertainment or information, this is what I watch on YouTube. I watch Resident Evil, Silent Hill Theory stuff from whoever comes, I don't care who. But if you're talking about channels, I like, uh, GameSack, Retro RGB, right? I like, uh, Sphere Hunter, yeah? Um, I like, and I only found her out recently, to be honest. Um, I like G Star 3 to 1, but it doesn't upload frequently, but it don't matter. His stuff is good. I like the old AVGN stuff. I don't like, yeah, I don't like a lot of stuff, to be honest. I'm a hateful old man. You go, the smoke's on here. I don't, I don't have Yuds, can't watch The Simpsons anymore, Futurama, probably, probably for, for the best. I don't, I don't do streamings. CRT is an alpha, he watches his mustache grow in the mirror after immediately shaving, <laughs> shaving it off. <laughs> Good one. I raised my own parents. I've, I've watched Red Letter Media, yeah, I enjoy what I've seen from them. I like, uh, I never finish, uh, I finish a video game, there's an unknown channel, I, li I, I watch a lot of unknown channels, like relatively unknown. 12 hours videos, you know. I watch Mike Matei streams, I like Mike Matei. Um, I, to be honest, I, I do watch his streams very rarely, it's more like his own YouTube, but lately I've been trying to catch him on Twitch, but... My internet is shit. Doesn't play well with Twitch. Uh, I watch Maximilian Dude. Uh, I watch the entire things. I like when it does uh, Resident Evil randomizers. Love that. Uh, and as a matter of fact, I watch his, both his uh, Hardcore and Nightmare, the whole thing in small doses uh, on Resident Evil 3 Remake. That game I don't care about spoiling. I'll play it, but spoiling for me don't matter. Resident Evil 2 Remake, I don't never spoil it. I like documentaries, uh, game historians, stuff like that. Yeah. I like dude, I don't like all this stuff. He is the kind of guy, like, I watch Mike Matei, he could be playing whatever, and I watch him because I'm more there because of him. I like Maximilian Dude, but he is the type for me, he is for me, the type that if he's playing the content that I like, that I'll be watching. If he's talking about fucking Final Fantasy, shit like that, I'm not, I'm not watching that. So my time on Earth is also limited. Mike Matea can watch him play whatever. It's, I think, plus, look, I hate to say it, but I think it might be the only streamer, like, of the big ones that I, I really watch. You know, that I like, that I enjoy. I'll be honest with you, I find most streams to be a bit boring to me, um, personally. Uh, but I like to watch unknown people, like just click on one and watch it and see, like even watch stuff in foreign languages, just why not? Somebody was playing Silent Hill one time, I think it was in Spanish, I understood about half of it and I watched, I watched the whole thing, I didn't comment. I'm going to risk writing in Spanish, I don't know how to write well. Bit Hat, uh, Bit Hat 1000, I watch him and we love him. See, I can't remember all of them, uh, <laughs> I love that guy, uh, yeah, I like Bit Hat 1000. He is genuine. He's a cool dude. I love his accent. He's like a, like a New York accent. Yeah. Uh, his frame is at sporadic times. That's what I love about Mike. He, he don't give a shit about anything. He was like playing Zelda. I, I click on one now. He recently plays Zelda. And I'm, I'm playing Zelda again because that's what I want to do. So if you don't like it, fuck it. Suck it. <laughs> you know? 
I like that attitude. That's kind of he reflects me a little bit. Although I will think about a schedule and all that. I think, but for me, it's because I have family. I think it works better with my family. To be honest, they they come first. If I'm awake all night and sleep, sleeping during the day all the time, um, you know, it makes it difficult. Uh, has CRT in 4K been streaming lately? Yeah, apparently. He, oh, there you go. He's, he's, he's there. I was going to answer for him at his stream today. Yeah, I like the vibes there because uh, he's different. He's more... Um, there's not a bunch of shit everywhere. Crap all over the place. Redeeming this, redeeming that. It's just... He's there playing fucking video games, you know? I like his... His takes, yeah, I, you know, I didn't issue when I when I used to watch AVG and I, I used to not like him very much. I thought it was intrusive. That's what I thought. But hey, uh, hey, you know, nowadays I I rather watch him than the the real actual AVG. And I haven't. I have. I have subbed a long time ago from AVG. And wish him well. Wish him the best. But the content is just not for me. At the end of the day, I'm there. If I'm watching content, it should be entertained. If I'm not enter entertained, I'm not watching it. Am I on one fucking ear? I am. Mm. Is anybody wearing headphones who is also on one ear? Yep, I am one ear now for, for absolutely no reason. I did nothing. I sat here and talked to y'all, and my headphone just decided that it's time to be one ear only. Is, it, is there a glitch? Am I in a glitchy room? Maybe if I, uh... This is very horrible. I hate when the headphones are one, one ear only. It's fucked. It pisses me off. Like, you want to see me in a bad mood is give me one ear headphones. That sours my mood very quickly. No, it's not a glitch. It's, uh... Let me see. Anybody wearing headphones here? Yeah, on speaker can hear only from one side. Don't know what the fuck is happening. We're gonna piss him off. Let me see here. Something disconnected maybe down here. No, everything connected. Everything is just fine. This thing is being a bitch. Let me see. Is it three and a half millimeter? And I don't know, it's weird. If it go the hell? If it goes uh, one sided here, I need to put the brake because I need to sort that out. Obviously, we're not playing this game with one ear. Real hardware with the problems. Do you have both ears now? Yeah, because the microphone is a different source. Are you on both ears now? Because I, I got two ears. See, it keeps going in and out. I was unplugging it, so that was it. So there's a bit of a delay. So right now, is it, is it uh, two ears? I mean, I'll, I'll wait here to make sure. I don't want to continue with the game in, in one ear on. It's fucked. I don't want to do that. Rake on earphones. Fucking charging the damn thing all the time. The biggest streamers I watch somebody who gets uh, close to a thousand views. Retro Island Gaming. Yeah, he's cool. I uh, I uh, I watched him the other day and it was very funny. His chat was spamming a bunch of shit. With la 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 la. Redeeming the boys. <laughs> somebody asked him and he was like. I don't know what the fuck they're doing. Sometimes I come here, have my own stream, and the chat has their own stream. I thought I, I burst out laughing because it was so funny. It's like, he's like, fuck it. <laughs> That's funny to me. I like that attitude. I think it's quiet and my ears are cloth. So am I Am I getting stereo now? I need to sort of know that if you all don't mind me. Give, give me the feedback. Um... Family Guy got too polite. That's true. It did. It did. Um, Pitfall and Atari was very hard. ET was impossible. Pitfalls are. Yeah. Seeth Large says, you solved your internet woos. Been a great stream so, so far. Thank you. And it's good to have you here today. 
Sorry it takes me a while to get you to YouTube sometimes. Once you announce your, with political side your own, you lose half of your audience. That's true. And there's also the side of just, uh, I've had enough and I, 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 I quit caring about it. And I, <laughs> uh, I've been really hooked, really hooked on Bob's Burgers. I love Bob's Burgers. I watch a lot of it. Can't tell right now. So Oscar says definitely both. Thank you. Thank you for doing that. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, so that's interesting. So if it goes uh, one year for me, goes one year for you, which is interesting because the way it works here, I have RCA coming out of this card. It gets split. One end goes to um, an RCA to USB, which stands goes to, goes to OBS. The other side goes to my headphones. So I don't understand how I lose stereo here. I lose it. Nothing to do with that. It still affects. So who, who the fuck knows by now? As Alien says, your stream setup is beautiful, and I don't see anyone doing it as well. Thank you. Um, it's different. We have CRT in 4K, Subtor, Alexander, but everyone has their own style, and I, I appreciate that compliment, and I'll take it. Yeah, everyone, that's the thing. We all unique, right? Everyone comes up with their own weight, even if we're doing similar things. Um, I don't think this will be a, a thing they'll catch on. I'm, I'm happy to see more people, but ultimately, I mean, let's face it, you get big and you do the thing. You just got to do what everything. Look, man, I got to play Fortnite and uh, jingle some keys. I don't, I don't fucking know. I'm not into it, but you know, it's, I, I, I want to do my own thing, and I'm sure CRT and for and 4K, he's already doing his own thing. He took the idea and expanded upon it, and. Uh, I don't want to expand upon it too much, and so everybody do, do different things, you know. So it's right here, and I like that. It's good to have a variety going on. Yeah, discard it. Oh, fucking break! God damn, I always forget the shit. You forget every time. Sorry about that. We got our herbs here, but let's see what's up here first, and then. I'm trying to think which one is the one to seal. That would be better. Sealing. I think I'm going to seal this one right here, right now. Yeah. Fuck it, I don't care. Whatever. Thank you, Oscar. I only have a shit pair of headphones. Yeah, for me, uh, because of the hat and because of the way things are, it's just, I like this here. It's a small footprint. Uh, sometimes the cables annoy the fuck out of me, but, you know. Mm. Club. What do you look like here then? So I'm still missing a key here. I, I reckon I'll get it downstairs or. Is that dogs down there now? Is it a, the basement? We're going to the basement. Yeah, and I, I'm like, uh, I'm not always consistent. Sometimes, like today, I'm in an easy mood and sometimes I'm raging here. Like a lot of, it depends on the game, I guess, I suppose. Soon enough here, I'm gonna take a break and have some snacks, you know. Oh shit, the dogs, they piss me off. Come on, you bastards. The dogs freak me out because they're so, they're aggressive. They're. Uh, it's a fucking zombie dog, you know. So and sword. Just follow. Thank you. Welcome in. I think this other guy looks like it. his claws, but it's not. Oh, it's the chew fucker. Oh, man. This part is ass. Okay, I'm gonna try something revolutionary here. Sometimes you gotta rage. Yeah, but not at, not at a cost of being fake, though. That's what I mean. If I'm not angry, I don't have any reason to rage. So go here. And fuck you. What the fuck? Yeah, I go up here then. Dogs can't climb stairs. We all know that. I pushed out, I know. I'll check it again. I wonder if they go back to the same position. You know I was going to take a hit there the minute I, I looked. 
don't know how close they are now. That's the thing with Resident Evil and the fixed camera angles. You know, you're always like, should I go forward? Fuck it. Yep, they returned. Bastards. Didn't notice me? Come on, you motherfucker. How you doing, sir? Well, that went well. I like it. Thank you, so and sorry. Is that a Korean? Eh? Are you from Korea? Making like a Leon here. He goes to a Spanish fucking house in the middle of nowhere, just speaking English <laughs> to the guy. Have you seen this girl? <coughs> Sorry to bother you. <laughs> Larga te cabron. <laughs> uh, very funny. Mm. I'm always uneasy when I come down here. I, feel, I always feel... Shit. Let's, uh... Let us move this way. I know what's in there. Master by self? How you doing? Okay, I'm still remember because uh, you know the the things are gone, so the the the, the, the there's trouble in there. Um, you motherfuckers! Y'all just a bunch of losers. I'm the only sane some bitch here. Just get the fuck out of my house now. So that's a Doyle redeem for now. See, I don't even feel even feel weird doing that because I, I, it's more natural if I'm actually angry, which I'm not. I was a club thing. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just a hundred percent calm today. Is there monsters here? Okay, I need a card. Okay, park is here. So what's in here then? Like it more than a clip. <laughs> I, I know the whole speech. Come on, Morris, you fucking genius. Get the fuck out. Go fucking practice, Randy. <laughs> What's in here? Oh, is that the all puzzle? There's a puzzle here that I just keep mashing things into it. Something happens, to be honest. I think this might be the one. Police, basement one. Yeah, let's take it. Anything else in here? I love the environments, they look so detailed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, my stomach is growling here, so after I make some progress here, I'm gonna go ahead and eat. Oh, shit, I left two fucking green herbs. Well, I was on the way back, right? I hope. Damn it. Yeah, I can't forget those when I get, yeah, head them back to the police station. Do I look like I know what a JPEG is? Hasta luego. Hasta la vista, baby. When he's trying to wheel a guy out of... Yeah, let's go. What about... Say, so just get the fuck out of my house now before I get you mad to turn back. And the guy's like, what, what about our instruments? He's like, come here, little prick. Come here, little fucking prick. <laughs> Willing... Wheeling him out of the house, it hits the door, kind of, it's very natural. Yeah, I think this is the one here. I just, I just do stuff until something happens. I go, a, a lot of times I'm lucky, sometimes I'm like, move it down, I guess. I don't want to think, I'm not a thinking man. And you think I know that. I, I really don't. I swear 
to God in heaven. I do not. I just it just works for me. I just I tune out. I, I go I go somewhere else in my brain, and I just click stuff until something happens. I don't know. It it worked. Well, I didn't expect that to be honest. I expected her to be here for a little while. Uh, well, there you go. Uh, I didn't use an ounce of my brain. Whatever's left of it, it just went somehow. Damn it, Bobby. Yeah, I like that show too. It's a good show. It's an old show by now. I'm right? still going. King of the Hill. So I think it opens this one, but I still need a card, right? I don't think... What did it open again? It opened something. Oh, the power is on, so now I need a card. So I think we're going to meet Ada right now, maybe. Is it? I don't know if you can, you can open a parking lot already. Did I check this here? Room? That is a card room? I tell... Oh, yeah. Wow, that is a card room, and that room is green, so you need a green key. I reckon we can go check the parking lot. Is that... But what's in here, then? I already forgot. I tend to forget things so quickly. Oh, okay. Well, we'll go here first. Sushi Bells, 1 a.m., so I'm going to catch some Z's. Uh, thank you for the stream. Did later, chat. I'll have a good night, buddy. Thank you for, for being here once again. And more fucking dogs. You stay out, out there with them dogs. Fuck. You're not fucking doing the camera shit, you fucks. What the fuck? You're fucking reloading now! A vault. Ooh, that's why I go on the. That's why I go on the. Where's my ammo? Where's my fucking ammo? I can't believe you decided to reload at that time. I don't know if I like this H gun shit. It looks like there's a bunch of wasted fucking ammo. I take two hits in there. Yeah, that part with the wheelchair is it's my favorite of the movie, the whole rant. Mm -hmm. it's, mm -hmm. Just keep going. Should I go? How far are we going here? I think we're going too far, far, far ahead of ourselves. I can't believe he decided to fucking reload. There and then. What the fuck? There's a save room here. I don't think, is, I, if I recall it correctly, it's only so far you can go here. I think this is a safe room. I tell you, I'm going to do some backtracking here because uh, there's two herbs up there. I'm going to go all the way back up and go get the herbs. I'm sorry. I don't want to leave <clears throat> herbs behind and go like, because you go, ah, get it later, get it later. Then later never comes. And I'm going to carry the shotgun. There we go. With with the shells? Yeah, with the shells. There we go. Uh, I'll save after. I think I kill a lot of the enemies. Let's see what's in here first. Carefully, carefully now. There we go. Too small for an adult to enter, so. Sherry. So let's head on back. Fucking dogs, I hate them. Uh, Synth Lord says they're getting a bit late here. Let's see, Let me catch up with the YouTube. Uh, <laughs> fucking rage. Uh, what really pisses me off from when a woman has a huge set of hooters and she's wearing a goddamn sweater. All right, I mean, makes no sense. It should be illegal. I right hear. 
synth lord says we're getting a bit later here here 8 p.m and post dinner gotta wake up at 5 a.m thank you for the good afternoon here see you next time thank you have a good night and thank you for being here i'm sorry if i'm a bit late with the replies here sometimes give me some motherfucking ammo man and there's a red herb right here man look at that shit and i think it was shoe herbs up there we're gonna get them my fucking dogs, man. And I reckon we uh we save here and go talk to Ada. He's so restless, you know, man. Yeah, he is. <laughs> and that uh, hits the door too, the weird way. Yeah, I'm gonna get get the herbs. I don't want to leave herbs behind here. To, uh, every little herb counts. Fucking more arrays here. Shit, scare me, motherfucker. I think it's here, right? Yeah. Then I reckon I'm gonna do a save, and I'm gonna go eat something because I'm I'm getting kind of I'm I'm, I'm kind of hungry. I'm not gonna eat a full supper. I'll do it after the. Uh, let me see. Yeah, after the stream, see how it goes. I mean, if I, if I eat snacks here and there's not enough, I'm just going to stop and eat. I'll see. Okay. And just making sure there's nothing right here right now. No. <clears throat> okay. So we get down there. Did I check this here room? Oh, you need the damn key here, too. What, was there anything here? Ah, there you go. Gotta check everywhere, you never know. What's going on now? Yeah, yeah, the club. Shiro, gonna go to bed. Have fun, everyone. And see you around. See you, Shiro. Thank you for being here. Yeah, a lot of folks have been signing off by now because I gotta sleep, you know. Mm hmm. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna save their. And I'll see if I can see Ada right now. I think I checked everything here. Oh yeah, that that opened a card, the card reader. That's all there was. I'm glad y'all uh, watched that uh, Sling Blade movie and liked it. It's a great movie. One of the top favorites for me. And see how it is. No CGI. No this, no that. No Prometheus. None of that crap. And it's, it works, you know. It's all about the plot on that one. There we go. So I'm going to save here. And um, I reckon I'm going to have some food, man. Okay. Okay, yeah, I'm kind of hurting with a... Am I shooting too much? Kind of hurting with the, uh... With the ammo here, a ton of bit. Let's do a save. I think it's about time to do a save. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm not gonna eat it here today. I'm just not in the mood for it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna leave you all with the music here. And I was a bit boring. I don't have commercials or anything like that right now. So feel free to turn out if you have to. I'm gonna save here, and I'm gonna. I'm gonna eat spaghetti. Uh, I need a meal. I don't like. Again, I don't mind streaming for a very long time, but I need to eat food. I don't think snacks are gonna cut it. Just gotta remember that I. And just leave on this here screen, I think, is, is good enough. I don't think there's any danger to burn out for, you know, maybe 20 minutes or something like that. All right, I need to eat. I need to fucking eat. I'm hungry. I, I thought of eating a snack with coffee, but that's not going to do. I'm just, uh, I'm a full-grown man, and I need man food. So, y'all okay with, uh, is the volume too low? Y'all okay with that? Do you want me to turn up the volume? Or you could do it too on your own devices, right? I'll leave you with this theme here. 
you want me to keep the CRT on or just turn it off? I'll be back in like probably about 20 minutes or something like that, give or take. You want the CRT on, y'all? Or just turn it off? You still get sound if the sound if the CRT is off. Cause yeah, I'm, I'm just hungry. Just hungry. And of course I'll be back and play a lot more. I feel rejuvenated after I eat, so you know. But if Fowler's gotta eat, I gotta eat, man. Life has spaghetti ready. I was gonna eat after a tenna, because you know, I don't wanna take a very long break and leave y'all hanging here. I'll leave it on. All right, I'll leave it on. So if anybody comes here, uh, just tell them I'm eating, if you don't mind. Uh, I'll be away from keyboards, because I leave the room. Okay. All right. Uh, well, if y'all, anybody lives here while I'm eating, um, thank you for being here, and I'll see you next time. But uh, I'll be back here, uh, I don't know, about 20 minutes, as long as it takes you to eat a, a big plate of spaghetti, quickly. All right? I'll see y'all in just a bit. Thank you. I just want to say that, yes, I'll be working on some uh, breaks, some stuff for breaks, so you're not just staring at a screen, you know? Uh, give me time. Um, my next day's off is my priority. Um, I don't know about commercials, I'll, I'll think about it, but uh, at least some um, bass moments, bass a crane, you know, kind of thing. All right, but for now, I'm sorry, is this, you know, it's a bit boring, you know? I'll be back.
All right, I'm back here. And I pulled this bucket. It wasn't too big. Well, filled me up a ton of bit. Enough to contain the streaming, huh? Yeah, if I'm very hungry, I can't eat fucking snacks, man. It's just, it doesn't do it for me, you know? You know when you're very hungry, like you want some fucking beef or something, <clears throat> and then you go on and eat some cookies, it just, it just hits wrong, you know? I need food. I'm not, not a big snack man. Jesus, it's hard to get comfortable here sometimes. Look at it. Fucking ludicrous. Hey, Chase, how you doing? Thank you. Yeah, it's a chill day here today. Literally, it's fucking cold. As soon as I open the door, it's fucking cold out there. CRTs, uh, yeah, they warm up the place. How you doing, Chase? You all right? It's enough. I get my smokeless here, and we get back. sure to back out of that so I don't save I've already been saved doing good doing good is a chill one I <clears throat> I'm over the moon about the internet man I think it it took took a lot of pressure out of me I feel feel better just feel better overall yeah didn't even raise today uh, just, uh, well, mildly when one of the dogs attacked me. But uh, I, I think that's my most chill stream ever. So far. I'm just in the zone, you know. Did you stream today? Thank you, Salamander. Just messing with streamer bot and ditching Streamlabs. Oh, what made you do, I made you do that? Problems with Streamlabs. I still don't know what the fuck I use. Stream elements. Yeah, I gotta gotta get a break thing going on here, so it's a bit more exciting than just. You know, with this one, the music at least is good, right? I like I can listen to this music here for a long time. <laughs> but uh, some like an NES game is not gonna work. Put my fleece jacket on. It's kind of cold here. I feel cold going out there. Chew me to the bone. I don't think time... Why am I worried about the time? Every time I play Resident Evil, I never, I'm never, i never in a hurry, but yet I'm worried about the fucking time and the rank and like it fucking matters. I get a low rank in anyways, because I, I, I don't know the game well enough. <clears throat> Not that I'm ashamed of. I mean, like I said, if I, I could come here and just stream this game for a week, I'm sure I'll get to know it very, very well. That's what the folks do. Can the way cooler things on my stream than stream labs and stream labs is just so bad after we refresh shit, shit constantly. I can't stand it. When you're on my stream next, I'll show you. Excellent. Well, I'm glad you're making the right move there. You know, you got to do what you got to do to improve it. Yeah, sometimes you get stuck with a product or a program or something, and then you, you go outside and step outside the box and you realize... Well, this other shit here is a lot better. Be missing out. All right, I'm see. Hopefully, I can. Yeah, I think I. All right. So we're about to meet Ada Wong, the iconic Ada Wong. I hope the Moray is not bothering you badly today. I look at it a tiny bit and it's, yeah, some scenes, you know, it depends on the scene. Some scenes that kind of goes away. I mean, it doesn't really goes away. It stays there, but it's masked. Uh, make sure we got, we got, yeah, let's just go meet Ada and see what's going on. Glitch Blob TV has big help. Has got the knowledge on streamer bot and helped me to do some cool things. Oh, there you go. Well, happy to see you excited about stuff. It's always good. I'm glad you enjoying the stream. And how's the CRT uh, treating you? 
enjoying it. You play it off stream as well. Use it. Utilize it. I mean, I suppose you're streaming using it. I gotta say, this, stream, this fleece jacket all of a sudden is a bit hot. I can see myself taking it off very soon. Uh, parking lot. That's where we need to go. The car park. Easy peasy all the way to the end of this. That's all. There we go. I think there's a couple of dogs here. Been watching shows on it. Oh, that's a whole lot of kind of shows you've been watching lately. Like old stuff, new stuff. Oh, I'll be quiet. up in the cell block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I'm trying to find another way inside. If we work together, we can move this thing. Give me a hand here, will you? Sorry about the hiccup with the sound there. I realize the volume of the, 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 the voices are a bit low. So is this fucking three and a half millimeter? I wish I could get away from three and a half millimeter. I don't like the format. There we go. It's actually talking again, so I had to adjust it a bit. I think it's a tiny bit better. Yeah. Sexy Jesus says, um, is that the. Uh, if the sun is trying to turn hard to find those days, a guy at work will sell me the desert, the Holy Grail. This one here now? Not this one. Well, the Trinitrons in general? Uh, Trinitrons in general, they're not hard to find. They, they went up in price, but they're still achievable. This one is, when it comes up, is not particularly uh, expensive, but it's hard to come by because this is from the 1970s. It's a professional video monitor from, from back then. So those will be hard to find. I got on the on, on bids. So it's so old, right? And to get it working correctly, to, to be working well. <clears throat> but if, if it's Trinitrons in, in general, no. You know, you go on eBay, you find a gazillion Trinitrons. I mean, people say eBay is bad. I, I bought a lot of cheap Trinitrons on eBay over the years. Shipping as well. Most of them arrive here, no problem. So we're going to meet Ben. Ben 10 from the hyper scan. <clears throat> I ran a scheme page, South Park. Ada, oh. wait! <laughs> That's a classic line. Ada, wait! South Park, the old one is good. Courage of Cowardly Dog, oh, that's awesome. Pokemon, I actually like, wouldn't you know, I actually like the cartoon, I enjoyed it. So I don't like Pokemon the game, but a cartoon was awesome. SpongeBob's awesome. It's all good stuff, man. You been watching some bangers out there. I've been playing PS2 and PS3. Looks like 720. Yep, it, it does. And now you're a believer. Now that you see it. If you see another one come up, I'll be waiting, I'll be waiting to buy and import it. All right, well, I'll keep an eye for you then. It's very heavy. And I, I, I cannot stress that hard enough. I really have to emphasize on how heavy this is for the size. Don't be deceived. It is, is 1970 is heavy. It is heavy, man. This is, I'm, I'm always surprised on how, and look, I moved five CRTs to, to get to this one here today. And I'm, I'm still surprised on how heavy this fucking thing is. It's, <laughs> it's otherworldly, unnaturally heavy. So the shipping, yeah. At least we get the packing, because uh, with me, I'm not going to fuck around with no packing. If I, was, if I pack a CRT, I pack a weld. This uh, probably works better on a crate. 
Oh, more fucking dogs. Uh, I think we're gonna use some of the shotgun here. I do the dogs make me nervous every time. Bastard, come out of there! Alright, it's not coming, I gotta... I think once I pick that up, yeah? Little shit. Fuck! What?! What? I told you, mother... Jump? What the fuck? What? Thank God, I just came out of a save. What a piece of shit! What the fuck was that? He just, just what? My health was full. What are you even about? He jumped on top of me in the that scene. What? I took one hit. The fuck was that? I don't, I don't, I don't think I ever had that happen. I, I don't recall that. Ever. I recall being beaten by dogs and losing my health. I don't recall a hunter type animation on which the dog hit me one time. Maybe it was two times. It don't fucking matter. I got no. Oh, you're getting lad. You are getting fucking lad heavy lad. I'm trying to look. I don't know if it's just a thing with the original. Let's make sure that the, the thing here is off, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, that was unexpected. One hundred fucking never expected to die on dogs like this. Maybe cheaping away my health. Maybe cheaping away my health. I never had a. I never had a dog kill me like that, and that that has never happened to me. Never, not one time, not one time. In all my years playing Resident Evil 2, I had a dog that jumped on me, and the animation is like instantaneous. It's like I, I, I haven't had that. Fiction, we made it up. It's fabricated. Wrong. No way. It was false. We made it up. Here's one you can't find on YouTube anymore. But is uh it's from us. And the guy is a uh, Governor Davlin. Because I made a reference here, a lot of people don't know, and that's fine. Uh and he tried to lie about tries to lie about the governor. He's a prisoner he's trying to lie about the governor. His name is Jiggy, Jiggy Walker. And it's it's trying to make the governor not um uh, saying that the governor was smoking crack or so somewhere with whores. And, uh, he wasn't, of course. And then the governor has all the receipts and it goes like, come on, G. Walker, come, come, Mr. Walker, come clean. And it's like, all right, I lie. I lied. <laughs> like, I have everybody. <gasps> All the present. So what, motherfucker? You've been lying your whole life. Shit. Still jiggy. <laughs> I love that shit. Where, where am I headed here? Oh. I can't believe that dog killed me. It's fucking insane. <laughs> what the fuck? That is news to me, man. I will not buy that for a dollar, my good sir. God, I'm gonna fucking massacre them. It's gonna be... I'm gonna... Oof. Okay, we gotta... Well, you know, at least I get you here to cut scene without hiccups this time, so I'll be quiet. Quiet during the cutscene before that. Um, I remember playing this game in the arcade. Resident Evil 1. Sorry, Resident Evil 2 in the arcade. I come from a broke ass family. I think this game came out on arcade? That's news to me. But yeah, I, I issue. Uh, yeah, I come from a broken family, which is. But spent a lot of time on the arcade. Is that a Mamcar Pro? Yep, sure he is. It's the first iteration of it. And Saxo Jesus says, 
By the way, this whole screen stream set up is badass. Well, thank you. Much appreciated. Pleasure to have you here. How about them boo dogs, huh? Good season this year. How about them fucking dogs here? I'll be quiet. up in the cell block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I've been trying to find another way inside. If we work together, we can move this thing. Give me a hand here, will you? Y'all feel the voices are a natural law here. I wonder if the three and a half millimeter is fucking up my channels. I remember the voices being that low. Got that herb. Motherfucking dogs. Oh, I think I got it. Yep, I got it. I got what happened. So, I was on caution. The dog hit me. I was on danger and then I died. That's it. It's your own fucking fault, you big dumb animal. You. You on the CRT here. You. You and your stupid ass mustache. You done it. It was you, man. Who, me? Fuck you. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Eat the fucking herb. Wow, that was a bunch of fucking nothing. What the f- Come on! That was money well spent. Uh, part of the world you're from, I wonder if somebody put this in arcade. You know that... Ada, wait! Always a classic. It's true, um... Sexy Jesus, I wonder where you're from, because I've been to some different countries, and they, uh, they did indeed put console... console and console games in the cabinets. You know, a long time ago, that was a long time ago. I remember going to a place and they had a Super Nintendo in the arcade cabinet. Sort of a makeshift arcade ca cabinet. So it is possible, you know. <laughs> yeah, the fleece jacket. This CRT is man. They hit up the place, you know. All right, I'll be more careful now. Uh, one hit and I'm healing. It's gonna, feel, it's gonna feel good killing. I can't believe I used that herb and it didn't even get me out of caution. Yeah, don't fuck around. One hit and I'm checking the health. All right, here we go again. I, I can't believe it. I, I hope I don't die again. Come on. Come on, you bastards. Huh? 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 Who let the dogs out? Not me, bitch. It's that simple. That bullshit, I know what fucked me up. That bullshit of trying to aim down. What I was saying is, I don't know if it comes from the first one, but on the first one, I feel like uh, at least your handgun shots seem to be more effective if you're waiting to go near you and you uh, point down and shoot them right in the fucking belly. It felt to me like those will have a good effect. And I realize I fucked up majorly here. I could have just... Hmm... 
I got to learn to leave with my mistakes, but I could have just saved the, the, so I got the green herb and here there's a red herb, full health instead of going from caution to fucking caution. That was a big dumb ass move. Uh, da, 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 da. When I was cool on YouTube, says this game looks and sounds great to this day. Yeah, this is a timeless classic. So this here, you need the um, crowbar. This is a crow yeah, but could have could have had a full heal here if I didn't fucking act like I did. <clears throat> hmm. Damn it. Captain Hindsight, hero of the modern age. This is Nathaniel Bard. Open the fucking door. Much needed bullet. Much needed. By God, I've been on, living on the edge here. We get to meet good old man. Van Cats. It's a sign of things yet to come. There it goes, not a loss. But it's a green nerve that I wasted. So we're gonna combine this here. Make some space. And this here. No, just keep it keep it keep it simple for now. I do remember House of the Dead in, in the arcades. That was uh, quite common. Let me guess. You must be Ben, right? Get up, now. What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Is this the guy? Ben? You told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? And who the heck are you? I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything, and even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. What was that? Like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But do you even know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. All right. Good night, my dear. Even though I already did tell you tonight, I'm in the up. All right. I well, we have sweet dreams, and I'll see you tomorrow. Yep. Don't forget your gloves and uh, drink a tiny bit of water, okay? Okay. Love you. Good night. All right. Yeah, we've been there. We need a crowbar, though. We ain't got it. That, that's going to be it, right? Canada, and it was a PS1 to display thing. Ah, there you go. Yeah, that's what the RTM 4K was right. I did see stuff like that, yeah. Uh, like a console and a cabinet. They make it work, you know. There's a kennel in the back of the building. 
Inside the kennel is a manhole. Okay, Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but I thought you have a different be easy. Different line of dialogue. Okay. There's gonna be a uh, There's gonna be spiders for sure. I can't believe I use that green herb for nothing. Okay, let's go down. Let's go down there. This is an OG pad or a PS1 Mini? Oh, the PS1 Mini? I have the PS1 Mini, but it would be complicated to use on the real hardware. This is an OG pad. It's, it's like the, the OG Mini is uh, some sort of USB, right? That would make... Uh, that would be, <laughs> be quite difficult to pull that off. And unnecessary. I mean, the, the controllers are cheap for the PlayStation. I have a boxes and boxes of PS1 controllers. So no, it's an OG. So an SCPH-1080-H. Okay, there. I, uh, yeah, I, I don't, I don't care for the, like, the dual shock here in this game. I, and this is how I play it to begin with. Mm -hmm -hmm. I'm just thinking I'm full here. Let's use this and will it be discarded? Yes, uh, I think we best head on back and drop some stuff off. You don't want to, you don't want to, you don't want to be, uh, make sure we're, you don't want to ever be carrying a bunch of shit all over the fucking place because it's, uh, it's going to fuck you up, man. You're going to, you're going to have to come back anyways. It's frustrating. You come across a new item, you can't pick it up. You just, it's not worth it. I'll make sure I'm going to the right place. I know I go to the map a lot. Uh, straight ahead. Yeah. Yeah. Too many fucking... <laughs> carrying too much shit here. Too many fucking herbs. Most PS1 games. Make sure there's no dogs here, is there? I could swear there was dogs here at some point. Huh. Most PS1 games don't even support... The sticks. Yeah, that's true. My PS1, I... Where do I get the fucking card here? Okay. Get that later, I guess. Down to the morgue. What is this fucking place here again? I think I'll need to go up the ladder, right? I can't remember this fucker. Sometimes I forget what the hell I was in there. Yeah, we are done this. This is a done deal. First Resident Evil game I play was called Veronica Dreamcast 2. And Undead Moves is two of my first. Well, my first was the first, because I'm old as fuck. <laughs> I did play Code Veronica, I didn't much care for it. Uh, a lot of problems there, but I think maybe I'll do a replay. Maybe, maybe the second time around, you know. I think I went the wrong way here, for sure. Yep, sorry about that. Sorry about that, babe. Play Stranger with the Sticks. Yeah, I can, it's a tank control game. Even if it doesn't have the tank control stuff, I, I'm not into it, you know. The fuck am I going here, dude? Oh, that's it. Yeah. Is it? Yeah, I kind of... No more dogs here, huh? They're all dead. It's fucking weird seeing the dogs up there. Yeah, it's here. Okay. <clears throat> Code of Veronica is really do good, though. Well, not for me. I didn't like it. Uh, don't think I ever beat it. I don't think it's good, personally. Again, many people do, and that was a beloved game. Maybe on a second playthrough, but I don't see there's a lot of problems there. For me. For me. I'm speaking for myself here. I can only speak for myself, so... I don't... I don't care much for Code Veronica. I don't hate it, but, uh, you know, I'll play it again, but... It doesn't do much for me, to be honest. Man... Kind of doing poorly here on a ammo and carrying. I'm, I'm gonna go go ahead and combine those two. Yeah, I don't know something about my ammo here. I'm not doing 
doing so well. I did beat it. I, I think it dragged it dragged on for way too long for me. Probably because I, I wasn't enjoying as much. I'm not the only one. Maximilian did play the game. He didn't even upload his own stream because it, he thought that people that like Code Veronica would get offended by it. Because he lambasted the game quite a bit. He didn't care for it. Oh, Steve. Okay, put it here. Look, I need to carry less stuff, you know. That's the way it is. Is there a good budget CRT for someone who's just getting into retro stuff? I don't want to... Any. A, wor a, a working CRT is a good CRT. You know, you don't need a Trinitron. You don't need a PVM. You don't need any of that. I have some non-Trinitron here. Uh, sats here, they're great. <clears throat> uh, my opinion, any CRT is a good CRT. If you, and if you don't want to upscale, that's CRTs are for you then. Gets better in replays. I, I deduce that. I, I think it, it would. It looks to me like, you know. But depend on, depends on how long, too, you've been. It's, it's been since your last game, you know, playthrough. For me, it's going to be a year, so it's going to feel pretty much not that different. I wonder if this opened a door here that I didn't fucking notice. Right? No. Okay. It's kind of paranoid here. I know you got the card, but. I can't remember how, to be honest. I like the cars here, the renders. Pretty good. Oh, that crack on the wall was. <sighs> All right, let's go down there and see what the fuzz is all about. I was here again. Oh boy. Shit. Don't fuck with those. And God, I need ammo here, so I don't want to be fucking around with those those things. Well, that was a wasted fucking bunch of backtracking, huh? Had I known. It was right here. <laughs> Shit, you bitch. Okay, at least we got a blue herb out of it. And then ink ribbons here? Yes. I hate that, you know, I backtrack a whole lot, prepare myself, and then the next fucking scene is the damn, the damn stuff. I tell you, that dog put me over the edge, you know, because now I, I realize I'm not, you know, I can die in a time here. Oh, out of my own stupidity, but still. Oh, the remake of one, I think, is, um, it should be like the gold standard for how remakes should be handled. I think the remake of the first Resident Evil, I think it might be the greatest remake ever made for my my own taste. I still need to play remakes of 2, 3, and 4. Uh, same here, I, I, I haven't played none of them and I look forward to them as well. I have the second one here, my wife played it, she absolutely loved it. And she's not, you know, she didn't grow up with Resident Evil and none of that, there's no nostalgia here. She absolutely loved the game. She, I think she, I think she might have played it twice. Really liked it. Yeah, there's gonna be some backtracking here because uh, I think that's where you put all them plugs we've been uh, collecting. So that's where they'll go. Oh. myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. It's a dead end. You think you can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. I'll go and check.
Players later a little bit. Uh, a little bit. Uh, I love that part. He's like, I don't think I introduced myself properly. I'm uh, Leon S. Cannon. And she's like, <laughs> I don't give two shits about that. <laughs> Ada Wong. We can check this. Cool. Carries the picture. First Resident Evil I played was the OG Resident Evil 1 on PC. The dogs. Not giving you a chance. Fuck you! God, I hate dogs. I hate them. Not in real life. I like dogs. I'm a dog man. I mean zombie dogs. Die, you fuck. Jesus. No, no, no. Fuck me. Fucking dogs. I didn't have a PS1 on N64 and PC at the time, but I beat the OG PS1 trilogy since, and I have them physical awesome. But a PC1 is actually quite unusual for you that, that you have that. It's quite unique. Most people had a PS1. My introduction to it was on a PS1. So to hear somebody who uh, had on a piece on the PC, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Kujo Pujo follows. Thank you very much. Kujo Pujo, welcome, welcome in. I think there's a map. We got Ada here. Okay, uh, fuck it. I gotta go down there and arrange the boxes and shit. So, yeah, you gotta drain it. And very big brain puzzle time here. Not everyone solves this puzzle. It's a roadblock for many. Unfortunately, many people just give up and quit at this stage here. But I'll show you where the treasure is hidden. So, let's go here. Wait, is this all the way? It is. Resident Evil 2 wasn't on PC, but it said N64 were fun enough. Yeah, it was on N64, but I could never find it in a store. Yeah, I, uh, a few days ago, I don't know, weeks now, I don't know, I came here and I play about an hour, and then my PS, uh, sorry, my, uh, my N64 crapped out, both of them are crapped out, so, I can, uh, I couldn't play it, it was my intention to play the N64 one, which in my, my opinion is the greatest port ever, like, they did the impossible there, they really did it. Works very well. Uh, once my N64s are up and running again, I'll definitely play it. I think the third one also came out on PC. Hey, hey, this is very important here. There's some uh, shotgun ammo here somewhere. I'm trying to remember if there's always dogs with her here or if there's sometimes zombies. I, I was expecting the zombies, the goddamn dogs were in there. Check down here. I hated the N64 controller, I always have. Yeah, we had many debates about it here. I'm on the camp on, it's fine, I don't. I, I like the controller. The only thing I don't like is how uh, the thumbstick is not durable. It doesn't. It's not made for the ages, so it, it goes bad relatively quickly. So yeah, you literally come down here to get the uh, shotgun shells, which is a great help for Leon. But yeah, many, it's not a controversial topic. I mean, many people hate the N64 controller. I just don't happen to be one of them. I'm not trying to be a contrarian. Not even alone on this, but I thought it was great. 
We didn't have any problems with it back in the day. But I totally understand people that don't like it. I just understand the three hands argument that's kind of dumb. Leon, can you hear me? Ada, did you find anything? Right here. Think fast. Here's one more. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! I love the Ada waits stuff. Even StarCraft was on N64, the time of weird ports, just like Command and Conquer. It is a weird port that I'm going to play here eventually, but it's, it works well, relatively speaking. Uh, Quake on the Saturn, we need you to play that. I did play and beat it here. Uh, loved the N64 games and controller at the time, but I went back to it two years ago and realized I hated it. Yeah, fair enough, it's been spoiled, spoiled these days. I, uh... First and foremost, collect the controllers. So I have a, a gazillion of them here. I uh, I still like the pad um, as long as it's in good condition. I um, as a matter of fact, uh, when I play in Super Mario 64 Golden Eye, some of the games, specifically the ones I grew up with, I tend to not want to use my brawler, not want to use my tribute, just use horror pad, and I just use the actual controller. Anything else just feels weird to me. So this here is where you put all this stuff. Anything here? No. So right here. Pan off, you release the lock. Scraping for the plugs. King plug insertion. King rook, bishop knight. So that's it. I know Wheelan Birkin is gonna be here at some point. Warminator still loves the N64 controller. Yeah, you have both camps. Love my N64 as a kid. I played it to death. I never died, actually. Never died, actually. Still works. Yeah, mine, I don't know. They're supposed to be resilient. I've been having problems with them. They've been called a tank. And and guess what? I never had a problem with them back in the day. My N64 has just worked just fine. And it's been having bad luck with it, you know, lately. I wonder what challenges will play ahead. See, if I hadn't saved with that before that dog, I would have been fucked. What are you talking about? I can't change maps here? Really? Oh, I gotta be on the place? Some spiders, right? Yeah, save it. How many ribbons I have? Let's see, it depends on eight. Now I'll get you to the station. You can do it. Unless I really fuck up with the uh, spiders, huh? I think I'll carry a blue herb. Who knows? It could be a pain in the ass, though. Let's see. Well, there's a lot of storage out there, so I'll carry a blue herb here just in case. And let's roll the dice. I want to save some ink ribbons. I don't want to be spending them all, all over the place. I'm going to chew and make some steaks. Hey, hey. Speaking my language here. I'll be here, but just listen and take it easy. Thank you. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. And enjoy your steak. I love steaks, my favorite thing ever. Half of the week I'm eating steaks. Okay, I gotta... Oh my god. Fucking pig. No! Yes. Okay, I gotta check that, uh... The brawler controllers you use were, were cool. Yeah, they're cool. They're cool controllers. I'm still on caution, it's fine. How do I get the fucking card? 
Yeah, I like the brawler. It's a good controller. I have all the collars, all except for the smoke gray one, the smoke black they come up with later. I didn't get that one. But they're very cool. I supported Retro Fighter since they, they had the NES Jab, their first controller. I have two of them here. Yeah, it's pretty cool stuff. Okay, I can I? Oh, that's the fucking morgue. Huh? Okay, I think shotgun time. I could eat burgers almost ever. Same here. And a burger, steak, pizza, spaghetti for me. I can't. I can't get it out of my mind of dogs being here somehow. I'm afraid of coming here every time, and there'll be dogs in here. I could eat burgers every day, and to be honest, I eat a lot of burgers. I made a big mistake not saving. I think I made a fucked up mistake not saving. I better save very soon. I didn't expect Lakers here. Fuck me, Lakers, man. Tinek, oh, playing a dangerous game here, Hoff. All the fucking Lakers here. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. No. Stop. Stop. This is the fucking all room. Mm -hmm. I have the cube and the PS2 ones. I uh, I passed on those. Uh, I think I have one of their cube ones, actually. Is that, is that one the blade, the one that has uh, the D-pad on the top left, just like a PlayStation controller? Because they have two of them. Is that Retro Brawlers? It's not, is it? The PS2 I passed because I think the PS2 controller is already perfect to me, so I don't, I don't, for me particularly, I don't see the point for me as a collector. And the money, if I had the money, I'd probably buy it. Is this a fucking morgue? Oh god, okay. <sighs> kind of risking here. I, I feel like I should have saved, but I have a, an herb here, so... Hmm. God, this fucking room makes me nervous. Okay. It's a fucking autopsy room. Fuck me. Let's go around looking for stuff. I mean, I could walk out of here, backtrack, and save. Right? But... Where am I? It's not be a pussy. Oh, it's just... Fucking go. Listen. Fuck. There's the card. Bulldoze him. Get him out. Get off me! Get out of the door! There we go. Save your ammo. Fuck that. God, that was risky. Am I on danger? No, but fucking, fucking. <sighs> okay, um, card, card room is here. But I'm doing, I'm, I'm fucked for, for stuff. Too, too much shit, man, too much shit. Mm-hmm, let me see. Thinking, thinking, thank you. I just wanted to push. I took the bite, but I, I think I think I have a lot of green herbs. So I think it was the right move to just take a bite, but uh, save some of your ammo. I just usually I kill them all there, but uh, yeah, the OG pads are all fine, just like you have on the wireless pad. I do have some uh, third-party, unbranded. Um, PSU wireless controllers. I went nuts with them. When I was collecting controllers, I was collecting controllers because they're not that expensive, especially at the time. I started before COVID and all that. And uh, I bought a shit ton of them, man. A gazillion of them. Uh, and every collar, collar. One day I'll make a stream of controllers, but there's so many of them, they wouldn't fit in this room. They literally won't fit here. Not with the space I have. So at some point I want to do a stream of just showing some hardware, just for fun. Just, you know, just because. Uh... 
when I was school on YouTube says, what's your opinion of GameCube controllers? Uh, I love them. It's, uh, um, they're, they're very comfortable. And uh, the analog is very precise. I love them. It's awesome controllers. I don't see anything wrong. The placement, the D-pad is very tiny. That's a thing, right? That's how to put in a flaw. And I, maybe the C, the C nub thing, C stick is a bit, but you know, the control is very, I'll be using here to, I want to play Resident Evil 4 on the GameCube again. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't have space. So we need to, we need to go to a, a save room. That's just the reality of things. Past the parking lot, there's a, that's a cell, so is there a save room here? Did I, didn't I just, no, I was before the spiders. It was before the spiders. Okay, let's just get out of here and we, we'll find our way. Uh, I can do the card room right now because uh, I just don't have space, so it's worthless going out there. Now, modern controllers are a prize of a fucking new game. It's true. They have gone up in price. But, you know, if you play Devil's Advocate a tiny bit, they have... Um... Um... Wait. Oh, I think there's a save room right here, right? Is it? Pretty sure there is. Please don't send them to the fucking spiders. Just scared of Lakers. Thank God I'm here. I'm saving. Oh my God. They're very expensive. But sometimes, yeah. They're, they're... Yeah, dude. You know, coming to think, it's kind of fucked, right? I learned about the Hall effect. So it's basically this technology that you... There, there'll be no drift. There'll be none of that. But none of the first party current uh, companies make their controllers with that. So you have all the drift with the PS5, which is disappointing because you already knew that happened on the Switch. It came way before it. And... Uh, yeah, and the Nintendo Switch Pro controller, which I paid a lot of money for at the time when the Switch came out. The Switch, I bought it at the in the same year. I stayed up to date with that one. And to have the D-pad being absolute dog shit, that really burned me. Because it's like, and considering they invented a fucking technology, you know, and yeah, man, that was, uh, that was not good, you know. I think I'm gonna give that may sound crazy, but I think I'm gonna give the handgun a, a break here because there's Lakers and other shit. I, I keep the handgun here for now. A healing item, the card. That that should do it. But save here, forgot. Yeah, modern controllers ain't cheap, man. They sure as fuck. Even broken. I was looking for broken PS5 controllers so I could make a do my arcade board. And even that was fucking expensive. It was not cheap, as you would think it would be, would be, right? Things are going up. Consoles are going up too. That surprised me. It should be the games. The games were very expensive, but the consoles were left alone. And I loved it because everybody was like collecting games. And I'm like, ha, ha, ha. Uh, happy with my flashcards and, and ODs and shit. And just focus on the consoles. And uh, fuck me, they went up. <laughs> Looking at the PS3 prices the other day. Oh, my own. Benny Vivi, Chew Stream, Rex Knight. Thank you, uh, Benny Vivi, and thank you for being here, and hope you hope to see you next time. Thank you for stopping by. <laughs> Sorry. They come so suddenly sometimes. I think while I'm here, I just say it, right? And I put that back. Uh, let's go get the, the card thing and open that room. God, do I remember, remember, remember where to go here? Those Lakers, man, they made me shit breaks because I, I didn't have the save. That would have fucking demoralized me completely. Demotivated me to hell. Right, should die, and I, I don't even know where I was before when I saved. Guys on tight, thank you. Thank you very much. Bit soon. Yeah, the card room is here, right? This is... There it is.
So this here is, is very, very, very interesting. You'll see in a bit, for those who don't know. Thank you, Salamander. So lots of good stuff here. Dudes and the dads. Some ammo here. Awesome, we'll combine that with the one way. The one we already have. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Godsend. Uh, yeah, no, we're gonna open that. Uh, check the side, check everything. I don't wanna leave a fucking thing behind. Making sure I got everything. Isn't that amazing the CRT has been working since the 1970s? Do they make stuff like that nowadays? It's kind of pathetic, right? If you look at the state of things now, the state of play. I'm always amazed I don't take it for granted at all. A fucking thing from the 1970s. The fucking thing is older than I am. The CV, this CRT here. And uh, I find it mesmerizing. So this here. So you open this and you have two choices. Machine gun and a side pack. Side pack, I can carry more items. Thank God, that's what I'm picking, by the way. Will you equip it? Will it... Uh, side pack. Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. So, it's a machine gun. I should probably, probably save it for player. Uh, no. So what happens here is when you play Claire B, most people are aware of it, some people are not. So when you play, play Claire B, you come here with Claire, and that's gonna be here. Leon left it for her. I find that amazing. It's pretty cool. You can be an idiot and pick both of them, I guess. I'll leave Claire with nothing. Be a, a hog, a big old hog. The big old hog that you are, you heartless fuck. Okay, let's go ahead and, um, what is it that we got? So we got some ammo here. And we got more space, so we can go ahead and, and get more, more stuff. Come to think, I should have saved after that, but I was afraid of Lakers. Uh, Strinitron, the best CRTs, I heard a lot of, about them when I got into watching CRT gaming on YouTube. The thing with the, yes and no, uh, some people will, is subjective, right? Some people prefer other, other stuff. Some people don't like Trinitrons. Um, Cause you'll see me here playing nothing but Trinitrons, you'll see them all, obviously he, he agrees. No, uh, I tend to step outside the bias thing and I prefer Trinitrons. Now the reason why some people prefer Trinitrons uh, is the whole way the aperture grill and why they're successful to begin with. Those are facts, those are undeniable facts. They had more brightness uh, because of the, the way the tech. The downside is having the wires, which they're visible. I personally can see it here, but most of the sets you can if you look look hard enough. So, so yeah, again, some people will tell you they're the best and some people say they prefer other sets, you know? Okay, let me, I, I don't like the way things are here. Let me first combine this. So we're taking a handgun. It was the right thing to do to leave it there. I wanna, I don't like the way things are here. I'm a very peculiar man. I like the handgun here, the bullets here, and then here, shotgun, shotgun shells here. Now here we carry a healing item and that's it. I'm not saving again, I just saved, so unfortunately if I die, I have to do this shit again. A sharp, shadow mask monitor is sharper for tax. And here's another thing too, uh, I'm not equipped. Uh, LCDs even, flat panels are better for tax. That's a fact in CRTs. Um, it's just the way it works, you know. Yeah, pros and cons for both sides. I prefer Trinitrons, uh, but I have Shadow Mads TVs here, my Daewoo. De I find them amazing. Uh, so, I I don't know why, why I'm drawn to Trinitrons. Uh, I like the way they look. And yeah, there's some, a small amount of brand loyalty, I suppose, because I look at, I, I bought one, I bought two, and they're good. And I, I'm like that. If I buy something and, and is working out, I tend to stick with it for the most part. So I think that's what happened. I heard a lot of good things. I bought them. I was happy with it, and then I stuck with it for the most part. 
you know, I have a thing for them, for Trinitrons. But uh, I don't have any other CRT here, apart for one pal on my set that, I have, that I'm unhappy with. Um, so when people ask me, are Trinitrons, do I need a Trinitron? No, absolutely not. Absolutely fucking not. If you'll ask me when anything my, but my day will here, for example, I'll be happy. Happy as I can be, man. Well, I wouldn't be happy I lost, you know what I mean, right? So now we have those few rooms, and they will... So how do I... Where do I go? Up? Okay, up, 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 here. Uh, there's gonna be Lakers and all kinds of shit, right? There we go, back to the precinct. Uh, not to completely shit on modern stuff, because some stuff is made decent, but nothing beats the durability of older made stuff. No, that's a fact. Like, that's, you can't possibly, as much as, you could hate CRTs and hate this and hate old shit, but that they are made, they were made better. There's a, there's a, there's a lot of explanations on wh why that is that we get into here, but it could be misconstrued, believe it or not, as even racist, so I, I, I rather not get into it, but... It's all about where and how things are made now. And you can't blame the people either. How much the people are paid and how miserable they are in the country, countries of origin where those things are made. Uh, things are just not made the same. Uh, and who's to blame is us. Because uh, at the end of the day, people want cheaper and cheaper and cheaper. That's about it. We have traded cheapness for quality, unfortunately. Because, yeah, even people that say that they care, they don't. They'll tell you, oh, you can go to Aliexpress and get this and that. It's the way it is, man. You know? Unfortunate quality is gone. Japan don't make stuff anymore. Barely anything. We don't make stuff anymore. Europe doesn't make stuff anymore. Uh, you know. And by that, I mean, like, oh, yeah, this company makes this. I mean, in general, right? Mass production of stuff. It's all shaped overseas now, so. Yeah, you're not. I've seen people that had broken tubes. Here's the worst I've seen. I've seen a guy breaking a Panasonic that I have here, an EDTV. It's a 480p CRT. It's a Euro European thing. And I saw this video, which is hard for me to watch because I really like CRTs, and he's breaking it with a mallet because he said it was fucked. And it took him a while. He was not, he was surprised on how resilient it was. And by the way, I saw in the comments, it was a little chip, a little part that was completely replaceable, but by then he broke the tube. Ha ha. I, why would you break it? I, I won't break tubes. I'm sure he had his reasons, but it was premature. So basically the CRT that he broke could have been fixed in a heartbeat, and uh, he didn't. He broke it instead, so now that's too far gone, obviously. I don't think this guy wakes up. So this is similar to the Ichi Tasty thing, but the Resident Evil 2 version. Just checking everywhere. Fuck yeah, we are. Pretty damn dangerous to be smashing tubes. Yeah, to anything related to tubes is dangerous. But I, I don't think they explode, they implode, right? But I've seen people put towels. But I, I'm always scared because of a vacuum. So a vacuum implodes. I mean, because a lot of people say explode, that, that doesn't make any sense. Uh, it's, it's implosion. So how dangerous would the implosion actually be to you, reasonably speaking? Because one thing I notice about CRTs, shoot, there's certainly you should be careful with them and all that, but some people make it like you open a CRT, you're going to die, even though nobody has ever died. You get an acid shock, you get zapped. I feel like it was a disclaimer thing. Uh, absolutely should be careful with the crt but i think some people go too far and make it so big that i i feel like a lot of crts could have been even fixed by somebody with even a superficial small amount of knowledge about crts of course uh but some people are so scared to even open i know i was and and then you could do even cleaning you know they make it like if you open a shit you're gonna die and say, ah, that, that's not true that's objectively not true but I wonder about the implosion, because I've seen they put, they put towels. I've never seen, like, shards going everywhere, because it's a vacuum tube, so it should... Yeah, there's toxic stuff. That's true. There's that, that's, there's that too. I have a tube amp. Uh, should I be... I have a tube amp. Should I be worried? I'm... I... Oh. Always, always should be worried. 
I'll be a bloody liar if I, if I said I'm not looking for a deal when it comes to most things, unless that's true. No, everyone is. That's a, the point. We. It's like people saying Jeff Bezos is a monster. Leave him out of space. Jeff Bezos is the worst person ever. Jeff Bezos. Jeff Bezos is is, is, is this is that. But you buy it on Amazon all the fucking time. You know, it's kind of weird. It's like sometimes I see people. I hate America. 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 This America. Shit. And America. Everything. America. You're wearing jeans. You're listening to rap. You you're going to watch Hollywood movies. You're watching American shows. You're eating the McDonald's. That's, you know, smoking marble reds. At some point, you gotta, you know, gotta look at yourself a little bit. And do I really believe those things? Or I'm just trying to be edgy, or I'm trying, or somebody, I heard somebody saying it. It's like, we all want quality, but, you know, let's face it, those CRTs were not cheap back in the day, when they were new. None of them were. It was a big thing, right? So they were made with their magical device, they made of quality, like stuff like this. Now, how much would that cost back in the day, back in the actual 70s? You know, a professional video professional video monitor in the 70s that like can do RGB and all kinds of shit. I don't think it would have been cheap, yeah? <coughs> so yeah, Watchman's Diary. I finally had a chance to see blue skies for the first time in ages, but I did. it did a little to leave my spirits. I was reprimanded by the chief for neglecting my duties while I was up on the clock tower. There's only one thing I still don't understand. The chief seemed to be more concerned about the fact that I was up on the tower rather than that I was neglecting my duties. Why was access to the tower prohibited in the first place anyway? I recently talked to the old man who works in the scrapyard out back. His name is Thomas. He's a quiet man and really seems to enjoy chess. He even went so far as to design a special key and lock and lock engraved with chess pieces on them. So that explains the bishop and queen and all that. For one of the doors in the disposal yard. We made plans to play chess tomorrow night. I can't help but wonder how good he is. One thing that's been bothering me about him is the way he's always scratching himself. Does does he have some sort of skin disease, or is he just rude? How's it rude? He might have a dry skin. Thomas was a much better player than I had imagined. I used to think of myself as a fairly decent player, but he did a pretty good job of humbling me about the only thing I imagined that could match his skills and chess is his appetite. All the guy did was talk about food throughout the entire game. He sounded fairly healthy, but he didn't look quite right. I wonder if he's okay. I was supposed to play another game of chess with Thomas, but we had to cancel it because he hasn't been feeling so feeling too well. He stopped by to see me, but I told him to go back and rest since he literally looked like the walking dead. I forgot the theme song. He insisted that he was just fine, but I could tell he was really having problems. Come to think of it, I haven't been feeling too good myself lately. Uh oh. I feel this one, The Watchman's Diary, is similar to the. Um, Ichi Tasty Diary, the first one. I find them the most interesting pieces because it's, instead of all the, you know, the Lego mambo jambo, it's like, and that's that's got to be him. His throat and abdomen have been torn out, so that's probably Thomas wasn't happy with the chess results. We got a magnum. That's going to be very important. I think we got everything here. There's nothing in locker, nothing here, nothing. Oh, look. That's why you gotta really be careful with the look. And I've been here like fucking two times already looking around. That's why I'm extra careful. That helps a lot, you know. I like to go around and clicking on everything. I don't care how long it takes. I'm doing it. There's a CRT up there. Blanket. Hey, Dad, that's true. Uh, can hold some electrical charge for a bit when unplugged. No, yeah, it can. It can. It actually builds up. No joke, I saw, but it was not enough to kill you, like people say. They, they literally say they're gonna, you're going to die. I mean, that's not the way it works. Even on official documents by Apple on CRT maintenance. It's, it's just you're going to get a nasty. It's not going to be pleasant if you should be careful. I personally work with one hand behind my back. Uh, I, I, I do respect. I am terrified of electrical shocks. I had some nasty ones when I was a kid. So it traumatized me tremendously. I don't want an electrical shock. So I'm shit and brace when I'm, I'm doing CRT stuff. But it, it, you, you have to do it. Like I get no CRTs here. They're dirty, man. The caps is a, a fucking thick ass blanket of dirt. I got to open that shit and clean that up. You know, it is a minimum I can do. Anybody can do that. 
Well, actually, no joke. I sold prices. I saw prices back on VCR and some of the VCRs and some of those devices that came out back, and they were expensive as new devices. Now they are. It's it's crazy. I've been wanting to get one from back home, a uh, progressive DVD slash VHS player, a particular one by Sony, and they are not cheap anymore. And tapes themselves are now getting hyped up, just like retro games were. I shit you not, there's a guy uh, making a lot of money, a fortune, as he claims. Uh, I think it was a former actor on uh, seal VHS tapes. And now they got, they're going to have the same seal shit. So just wait in, until water gets a, uh, you know, gets a hold of VHS tapes and it's going to be, become a reality. You know, the games I can sort of understand, not anymore because I have flashcards, but I get it. You get the physical thing, but at least you can play and do a lot with it. And the quality is just as good as it was, right? You can't get this PS1 game and make too much out of it. And sorry, the enhancements sometimes are not, not good good for PS1. PS2, like, yeah, I've seen, like, an increasing internal resolution. PS1, it's kind of just stuck there. And, uh, but VHS tapes, man, I like VHS tapes, but I ain't, I ain't paying a lot of money for it. That's, that's crazy talk, you know? I watch them for nostalgia. They look okay on a CRT, but it'll never look like a DVD, even, you know? We all know that. It's not like vinyl. You can make a case for vinyl, but VHS, they are lower quality. That's just a fact of life. They're never going to be higher quality than the, the, the DVD. Uh, maybe they'll surpass the VCD, right? But uh, but still, people now want to charge a lot of money for it. Everything, like, we can't have nothing now. It feels like we can't have nothing. Anything that is fun, some fucking uh, speculators come around and ruin the whole thing. I'm gonna, we're gonna go ahead and add the shotgun because I don't know what, what lies in store here. We still got a shitload of VHS in storage. I got literally 1,000, more than 1,000 of them. I bought a pallet of VHS, so it, we don't like it. Most of them are fine. A couple of them mold, got moldy. I have to look, uh, do uh, an inventory check this summer, see how they're holding up. There's gonna be Lakers here, isn't it? It's gonna be shit all over the place. Mm, it's not that far. It's not that far. This place is creepy. I always found this place creepy. I don't know why. This this year, maybe the fan. Yeah, I bought a, I had a, about a, a couple of hundred tapes and then I bought a pallet of 890 tapes mixed, mix and match, you know, assorted. A lot of fucking crap, but a lot of good stuff too. I'm glad I bought it, it wasn't that expensive. Uh, but yeah, but no no horror. See, the horror had already shipped. The, the, the prices had, had gone sky high already. Um, so there was barely any horror, which, to be honest, I was hoping for is my favorite genre. But, uh, nope, they uh, have gone expensive. Go buy a fucking Texas Chainsaw Master for like 20 something bucks. I'm just afraid of Lakers here, dude. So I got spooked by the last time they put the Lakers in there. I like my VHS tape <laughs> seal and moldy. That's right, because you're not safe from mold, huh? I got luck on the lucky on the mold. I mean, they are in the shed. Lakers here. Oh my God. I like the fear to save. I I hate it, but I like it at the same time because it gives you that. If I die here, the consequences will never be the same. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, CRT 4K has a lot of something that was very interesting. Everything. So, like I was saying. Um, what is it? Uh, laser dish, which I, I, I find them so fucking interesting. And I was thinking about buying them. The devices to play them are very expensive. And and then Linus made a video about it. That really put me off. I was like, no, this is going to be hyped. I was the same shit. This card. Thank you. But it's good if you have it before all the bullshit, you know. I'm worried about consoles. Uh, I'm worried about consoles because I... I, you know, I don't know. They're getting expensive. They're kind of somewhat disappearing. I, I couldn't find a Fairchild Channel F. Couldn't fucking find one, dude. Just... 
Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. So, okay, um, lie the queen, the king, and the jack. Queen, king, and jack. Yeah, I admire your, your uh, laser disc collection. I think they're beautiful. It's so big on the artwork, the, the covers. Who's streaming around here? Those are some fucking reflective tubes. I'll never forget the surprise you're on scenario B. Holy shit. Okay. That fucking spooked the hell out of me. Number 12 has been used. Number 11. 13. Do I get a punishment if I get incorrectly? I can light a fire here. No, I, I, is there more information? I like this stall it. Oh, gotta look around, man. You gotta look around. You gotta press everything everywhere. Almost overlooked that. Would have, would have missed out. I can't remember. So, can I see the? So he looks like. Are they all the same? Hmm. And please, I'll figure it out. More. I've bought a and a laser disc for a while now. I don't know where the prices are these days. I wonder. This should be a fun silly thing if we want to watch an old movie like Commando. We got the laser disc for a few bucks. It's. I wish I had got gotten into it earlier. I, I find them the most interesting of all, to be honest. Nostalgia's VHS. I like VCDs for a reason. I don't have many of them, to be honest. They're, car they're kind of hard to get because they were big. They were the VHS version of uh, in, in Asia, so they had VCDs instead of VHS. I feel like this is a duck. Okay, I, I I don't know, dude. I'm gonna start lighting them up here. Just do stuff, doing stuff on things. Okay, I don't know. Oh, fuck. Fucking hell. Okay. Looks like I'm gonna get hurt or something. Like the a gas comes and hits me in the face or some shit. Let's try every combination. And don't keep track of the combinations that you've been doing. <laughs> With the, with the fucking numbers, dude. Come on! There you go. Do stuff on things until stuff happens and you get things. Well, I know where to go with this. I know the wheel is missing. It's right there, Bozo. Doom 64. <laughs> See, that's the thing you're always thinking here. That's the difference. In Doom 64, you're looking around. There's no clues. There's no thing. Just looking around. With this here, like, I just got this cogwheel, and I'm like, I know where to go with this. And I, lo I love that about Resident Evil. You can memorize things, and like, I need this, I need that. I got this, now I can open that. And I Doom is just... Walking around. Doom 64. Let's not stain Doom here. I haven't played. I haven't played a Doom more than just fucking around the first level. So I found out when I played the actual Doom 64. Not 64 was not for me at that point. Audio and laser disc is really good. I like to play them on stream. So I, I look forward to it. I heard also. I think I remember uh, Tacmon, uh, and they they were HD a long fucking time ago. Right before, way way before HD was a thing in Japan. Is that correct? Little brother had a top loader VCR. I love those top loaders. I'll actually have one of them. I have a few VCRs here, but not the top loader ones. They're beautiful. Uh, I didn't get a chance to check the Blade Runner, but guess what? The tab is open, so I took it seriously. I didn't have time, sorry, but it, it's open. I, I uh, What I'm doing now, I've made a folder on, um, on my computer, so 
When y'all tell me movies and things and games, and I drag and drop a link from a Google search. You're not gonna get away with it, Mr. Google Search. So okay, I'm I'm just very afraid of Lakers. Speaking of one, there's one here. If you wanna see a Laker, he's right here. You op you open this fucking door. Don't open this door because there's Lakers in there. So this is gonna be full of zombies. I know there's a way to go to the library and don't have to come back. Look, I'm not looking for the best strats here. I'm just playing. You know, whatever happens, happens. There's a lot of ads, a lot of manipulation. Think about the power that Google search has. Uh, if they want to bury you, when was... It's really careful with Lakers here, man. I think I know where they might be. Yeah, okay, I gotta really be careful. I think I might be like uh, here. I think they put Lakers here, if I recall it correctly. I know AB guy, I watch him a lot. And Tech Moan as well. Yeah. Talking a bit hyperbole here, but sure, it has changed. A lot of things changed. YouTube search, I know it's beyond fucked. There was a guy that made a video on it, how fucked up it is. Like, it's telling how I, I research deeply about guys looking for guys doing something like this. So look and CRT gameplay. Uh, all kinds of search words. And, and I, I still find guys that I could never find it before. It pop up on a recommend and not on the search. Like Subtor, I found it only a day after I made my channel and already, so I had only seen that Alexander. Some real fucked up shit, man. Yeah, I like the AP guy. AP guy. Okay, let's. Uh, Get organized here. Yeah, but uh, what I was gonna say about Google search, when was the last time you go to page shoot? Think about it. Same with the the power, the power of the media, you know, it's incredible. It's a force you'd be reckoned with. Uh, I wanna see the film, I wanna see all films. But I'm sincerely hoping there's no liquors. Maybe, mm, playing with fire, did a lot of stuff here. That's a long fucking way. That's a long motherfucking way. No, no, no way they're gonna put, put no enemies in there. I'll tell you what, if I see an enemy, I run like a bitch. That's what I would do. Just take off and get the hell out of there. Cause I don't know. I don't feel like reloading my save at this point. This, ooh, that'll be fucked. I, I feel very nervous when I don't save for a while, but I, I do wanna. This fucking music is not helping. I'm just scared of the Lakers, man. Fucking terrified at this point. The fuck? If I see a Laker, I think I'm out. I don't want to risk it. How far am I? And what the fuck I'm even trying to do? Okay, go to that area, okay. There's no Lakers, no Lakers, no Lakers, no Lakers, no Lakers, no Lakers, no Lakers. No Lakers. Come on. Come on, come on, don't fuck with me, man. Thank God, okay. My knowledge is limited on technology, the technology details, but I love watching feet and listening to people who do have it. It's pretty cool. I also like that uh, cathode ray dude. It's a funny story, when I was doing this, this uh, channel here, coming up with a name, that's the name I wanted. I thought I was being clever, and then I went to look it up, and he already existed. <laughs> so, of course, I didn't do it. I hope it's the one with the monster, yeah. The zombie. Picture in front of a, a Rukas Taylor, progressing to a zombie within two hours. Subject repeatedly complained about severe agitation of the epidermis, in addition to feelings of nausea. Uh, this happened up to the moment he lost consciousness. I always found this terrifying, like... When I was a kid, that scared me. It, it did. Okay, we checked all the films, I think. Yeah, I think it's getting the time to save here. Fucking around too much. 
Yeah, there's gonna be Lakers, so uh, I'm gonna save the Mag, and I don't know fucking way I'm gonna be using that now. I'm off it. Where am I going here? I remember VHS tapes looking like shit as a kid. No nostalgia for them. Spazbot need a lighter. No, I know. No back seating. Thank you. Yeah. I think you're talking about the statues at the ship of sale. Because, see, by the time I see things, they already figure it out. Uh, another excellent game. I love life throws curveballs at the least expected times. It's been impossible to sit down and enjoy some gaming and also watching your streams. Be back soon to watch. Giants are orbiting. I feel for you, man. Life gets hectic sometimes and it's pretty fucked. You realize sometimes I've been blessed with not having that at the moment, but I've been there. Uh, you're working like a dog. You can buy this, you can buy that, and you have time for nothing. And then that's when you realize you're becoming fucking miserable. Not saying you, you should feel miserable, but I'm saying I've, I've been, I've been like that before, you know. I, I'm, you go like, what's the point of all this shit? You know? uh, Rex, have you ever watched Shango Zero uh, Six? Yes, uh, that's him I mentioned earlier, but I uh, I always forget the number, so I just say Shango. I don't know if he's enough for people to know, but I watch him. I think he's awesome. He's a very very knowledgeable man. I, I like people like that. Um, I like that guy a lot. I think it's, it's not only the knowledge, he's, I find him very genuine and entertaining. I like the way he talks. I find it funny that he's actually not interested in games whatsoever. <laughs> I've seen a video of him playing games and he's like, I, I don't get none of it. But the knowledge that guy has, you know, it's, it's a sight to behold. Yeah, he's a very cool dude. I haven't seen, I haven't watched his stuff in a while, but yeah, I, I like his style. I, I, he's the kind of guy that I, I could sit down somewhere in the fucking desert. I, I think he's in California, and, and then you you can talk to that guy and have a ball, have a beer, and, um, and learn a lot at the same time. Just the kind of person I would like to be around, to, to have around, you know. It's a cool dude. I met people like him before. It reminds me of people I, I met in my life. Yeah, cool dude, cool. There's a lot of special people out there. You know? Definitely. Uh, I think we're gonna go up here, uh, and there's gonna, where Where am I going again? You know, sometimes I space out, like I, I'm, okay, the cogwheel. <laughs> just space out, just completely fucking forget. I think it'd be wise if you go, is it possible to go this way up here? I think there's going to be Lakers here, and I think I need to be here. Is that correct? Or no? No, it's actually here. So, either way, I have... Yeah, I knew they'll put Lakers. I, I think there's Lakers in there now, instead of zombies. So, if you don't kill those zombies, but it's a bit tough, right? As the Lakers can be dangerous, but so are the dogs, right? One killed me. But it was my mistake, definitely. Same here. He's got good vibes. Yeah, he's got a... He's, you know, just a pleasant person to be around. A, a person, you know, it means... is it. A person that means well, and you know he's not going to be causing shenanigans and shit, you know. I don't know, something special, something special about him. It's not just the CRTs, like I came for the CRTs, but but then I hear him talk. I, I can't, even when I'm not actively trying to learn, because not every time, I, he's he's good enough to for inter, entertainment, he's entertaining. I, I can't watch him, not, not really taking notes, not paying attention, not thinking about recording CRTs, I can put him on a... Put him in there and watch him and have a good time. Is there more stuff here? Positive vibes only, guys. <laughs> At least you still have the clips and use them sometimes. I remember one time a fax was in here. You're good to see us still here, Chase. Same here's got good vibes. Oh, yeah, no. It's impressive how much those TVs go through before he gets them, right? Is, um, he gets some stuff that's beyond fucked, right? Really impressive. I I, uh, I told you, I'm not an envious person um, as far as being jealous of what people have, but I, I envy his knowledge. I wish I was as knowledgeable as he is, you know? But that's not the way it works. Like, he worked very hard to get there and acquire the knowledge, being hunger for the knowledge, right? But sometimes I wish I could just 
snap my fingers and, and just get the knowledge that he has in my own head. I think my head will probably explode. It wouldn't be able to contain my primitive brain. Case will just shatter in a thousand bits of reality. So, yeah, especially the one who blows up. This, this, the TV is just debating itself. I gotta watch that one. I haven't seen that one. The pre I gotta see that one. Do you have a link to that? Black Pattern, please tell me you have a link. <laughs> That's, uh, I haven't seen that one. That sounds fucking, that sounds like a, a happy coincidence right there. <laughs> the presidential debate. And then the fucking thing blows. <laughs> I'm laughing just thinking about it. <laughs> I wonder what he said. I'm a, see the thing, I'm always looking forward to hear what he has to say next, you know. That's how cool he is. Some people are just go, cool, you know. Because some people can be knowledgeable and then bore you to tears. I mean, you can still... Lickers. You can still get the knowledge, but it's not... You get the knowledge and entertainment at the same time, you know? That's... That's good. Yeah, there's gonna be Lickers in there. Wait a minute, how the fuck... Okay, I think... I wonder if I have to deal with those fucking Lickers at all. Like I tell, there's nothing more you can really fuck. There's the one with a good music. There they are. Bastards. And all my luck and my idiocy, my own stupidity, I probably close the one that I that I probably have to go. I, op I left the one open that I probably have to go back to. There's gonna be Lakers here, watch. Yeah, if you could find that, it'll make my day, Black Patron. Let me... I think they're down here, the Lakers. Don't mean to put you in the spot, but yeah, that'll be awesome. I need some Shango. It's been a while. It's been a few months. So watch, watch some Shango here. My day's off, you know. I, I still think it's so weird that I put the... Uh, come on, dude. I put the crank here and it's fucking disappeared. I was afraid it'd be a glitch. Oh, I have something to say. Who here... I want to know who here played and know a bit about Resident Evil 2 Remake. I got, I, got a, I got a little jam, a little weird one that happened here. Not with me, but with my wife playing the game. But if nobody here is laughing, it's familiar. Because some people were talking about it earlier. Who here has played that game and know a tiny bit about it? Or know about it, in any way. Very interesting thing happened to my wife. And I went to look it up and I was impressed. Wow, how the fuck? Just admire the, the work. Come on. Yeah, this is. I remember using the expansion pack here with the N64. This part is very weird. It's like it's 480i and it's a bit. The frame rate is lower. It's just weird. Man, that's awesome. No one else I know has ever seen Shango. Oh, now, yeah. I, <laughs> I like that guy. Watch him a lot. Many hours of him. I wish. Yeah, for many CRTs, fixture sure has blown up a lot of them. Yeah, the reality is that we, you, win, <laughs> you win some, you, you lose some. Hey, cat. Admire these nuts, bitch. Okay, we're moving on up. Well, down, really. Oh, I thought I was going to jump down here. Well, what? Oh, yeah. Oh, there you go. Whoa. I like this bit. Okay, so a bit of a shit. Get away!
a hole in the wall where the man can see it all. <laughs> Cat Crasher says, we're going to get this one. Pick a boot, black mat. Oh, that looks pretty cool. It's a combination of colors. I've never seen a GameCube like that. Price is about right of how it is now. And it's got, well, the price is actually good. It comes with a pick of boots, as, as, yeah, everything. Tanuki B console. Yeah. Yeah. That looks good. That looks pretty damn good. Oh, you got it, Black Patrick. Yes. Save that for later. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you, Black Patron. I appreciate that very much. You're taking your time to do that. I definitely will watch that later. I want to save the tab here. Right here. Sure, sure to drag it. There we go. Right here. There we go. <laughs> that's going to be good. That's going to be... That's going to be damn good. Yes. Yep. Love, Shango. Yeah, I usually don't like mixed colors, but I think that one works fine. That GameCube it looks it looks pretty presentable. It looks pretty badass, actually. Let's see where I didn't see. Where is that uh, located? I wonder where you get it from. Where is that? In France? I don't care, don't care. I'm from France. Yeah. And the GameCube, the... Um, uh, the PAL one. It's uh, I usually don't like PAL consoles at all. Wouldn't, don't don't usually want them for free even. Well, now nowadays I do. I want to get them for the exclusives. Now I want to play. It'd be interesting. Uh, but the GameCube, there's no downside. There's an upside that does RGB. You know, it's a few things in there. So I I have you play NTSC games. I kept crash on my uh sorry uh CRT and 4K. I have. Uh, both of my GameCubes, I have a PAL and an NTSC modded to, even that, the contents of the SD card are the same. They're the same. Uh, it plays NTSC, no problem, 60 hertz. And, uh, in addition, it supports RGB. Uh, which, to be honest, for me, is not that big of a deal, but it, it's good to have RGB. Why not? You know, it does something that it doesn't. Why take it away? Play with a G spot. <laughs> the inflation pop. Save that one. Thank you, Black Patrick. But here, I got some material here. I might take off to to relax you. Huh? The inflation are you? And I said the CRT, <laughs> CRT on fire. Here. Uh, good old Shango, man. Okay, there we go. Says it's region free, and I won't be using this on the ROMs. Yeah, if you're using the ROMs, it's fine. Uh, you'll be fine. <coughs> I I never had. I've only ran NTSC on my uh, PAL GameCube, and I never had a problem with the Swiss. Is it gonna come with Swiss? You can do whatever you want. There's none of that. There's none of that PAL stuff. You don't have to worry about it. And if you wanna play PALs there. Okay, so uh, what what happened here? Oh yeah, I gotta check the sales. That's gonna be cool. It's a gruesome scene. I am. This is Nathaniel Bard. Open that door. Damn you! What would Nathaniel Bard do? Ben, can you still hear me? Come on, answer! Damn! I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <coughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co-conspirator. Get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Oh, my chest! It's burning! What's 
God, what was that? Alien. <laughs> they just need somewhere else. Ain't nothing but a flash wound. <laughs> oh, man. G spot lines. I'm going to wait after this weekend and make a decision because I don't know how much I'll spend at the Vinyl Convention. i got to say it's a good price uh, for what it's coming with. Usually it's they ask more for it. Come on, Ben. Quit the act. Wake up. We have lost the Mansion Lab facility due to the actions of the renegade operative, Albert Wesker. Fortunately, his interferences will have no lasting effects upon our continued virus research. Our only present concern is that the pre is the presence of the remaining stars members Redfield, Valentine, Burton, Chambers, and uh, Vickers. Is Vickers or Vickers? No, oh, Vickers. Uh, if it comes to light that the stars uh, have any evidence as to the activities of our research, dispose of them in such a manner that it would appear to be purely accidental. Continue to monitor their progress and make certain their knowledge does not go public. Annette will continue to be your contact throughout this affair. William Birkin. Oh, there's more. Brad, Vic, well, Salamander, if you spell it the same way it's written there, it's not going to help me to pronounce it. <laughs> it's the same thing that is written here. <laughs> <laughs> it's like me reading water and say, I don't know how to pronounce this the water I, and then you write it's pronounced water and it just write <laughs> write the same <laughs> okay that one got me <laughs> I have deposited the amount of ten thousand dollars to the account of your service to the account for your services this term as per our agreement the development of the G virus schedule to replace the T virus is near near completion once complete, completed, I'm certain that I will be appointed to be a member of the executive board of, for Umbrella Incorporated. It is imperative that we proceed with extreme caution. Redfield and the remaining star members, stars members, are still attempting to recover the information on the project, continue to monitor their activities, and block all attempts to investigate the underground research facilities. Uh, <laughs> it was funny. I don't know how to pronounce Vickers. Vickers goes on and types the same thing I read. There you go. You're welcome. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Texas foosballer follows. Howdy there, Tex. Oh, well, thank you for following. Good shit. We have a problem. I have received information. I have received information informing me that Umbrella HQ has sent spies to recover my research on the G virus. There are unknown numbers. There are no known numbers. But there are an unknown, unknown numbers of agents involved. You can see I'm, I suck at reading. They must not be allowed to take this project away from me as it represents my entire life's work. Search the city thoroughly for any suspicious persons, detain any such individuals by whatever means deemed necessary, and contact me immediately through an ad. With, with these precautions, any possible threat should be eliminated. I will not allow anyone to steal my work on the G-Virus, not even Umbrella. Hey, Tax, how you doing? Welcome in. Good to see you. Water spell H-U-O. Well, that's what that's like. I want to play those Mario and Luigi games. Oh, I heard a lot of good things about Wireland 4. Good one. Mario Kart Super Circuit. That one I have physical action for some reason. I, I don't actually remember where the fuck I got that. Uh, 
Sorry, man, I got lost from lost in the songs. Nail to the chief. Where are you going, Ada? Ada, wait. To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada, wait. <laughs> hey. Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. A miserable death. Yeah, that was pretty gruesome. I like what they did here with the, the way... They could have gone just tore, like tore him in half, right? And uh, no, it was a very... <laughs> More brutal than the alien, even. It was just like not a hole, just tore him in a weird half. It's pretty fucked up shit, man. Some fucked up stuff right here, brother. Ben! Ben! Stand up, Ben! Arise! Quit pretending with your little flesh wound. It's a paper cut at best. mess on my phone and I didn't hear Rex clearly. Yeah, what? I actually never seen... I don't think I ever heard somebody pronouncing that name. It's the kind of, kind of thing. I just never heard of When names, it can be tricky. Okay. Back at the parking lot. The back of the parking lot. I kind of lost track. Where the fuck am I heading now? Right? Because I got the sewers. I know the sewers is where I need to go. Do I need to go down the manhole here? Or... Kind of. Usually I got the keys and stuff. I don't want to go through the heart of being lost here in this game. Not this game, dude. Is that it? Oh, oh, okay, yeah, 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 um, hmm, would there be a, yeah, I think after the spiders, there's a safe room, yeah, there's the bishop things and all that, yep. Yeah. Fuck you! No, oh, you fuck. That's, that's it, if we, see if we don't fucking look. Bitch, you bitch. So Pac says, don't live in a, <laughs> in a cruel, cold, cruel CRT, CRT Rex Muslim world. Uh, yeah, that's the name of it. This is Nathaniel Bard. Open that door, please. <laughs> open it. Open it at once. <laughs> Did you play that game, Soapbox? Apparently, I'm about to play the Resident Evil 2 remake. Did you play Soapbox? I was asking you earlier, and I got ignored like the drunk chick at the party. You motherfuckers. This is Nathaniel Bard, and I demand you to tell me if you have played Resident Evil 2 Remake. I have some exciting news to share with you, and I want to confirm. I want to, I want validation. Uh, there's a William Birkin fight. I know, I just fucking save. I'm a piece of shit. Uh, no, healing item. Healing fucking item. Look, if you didn't have a healing item right there in the end, when those fucking things showed up, I would have been dead. Absolutely. How the fuck would I run away from the spiders on, on danger? It's not happening. It's not fucking happening. I hated to save here again, but it's just... Mm, I think there's a Wielenberg in fight. I, I, I want to save. I'm saving. Cold, cruel, CRT, miraculous. 
world. <laughs> I like Carlos. I like Carlos. I give I give I give him that. Uh, the new Resident Evil 3. I really like Carlos. He's pretty cool. The guy that does the voice I've seen him on um, as I was watching um, Sphere Hunter and uh, she got the guy that does the voice there on the 25th anniversary and uh, yeah he's got a mustache. It's a cool looking dude. That was safe so. Muffin Killer. Man I haven't I haven't seen Muffin Killer in his stream forever. Is he doing all right? And a nice friend of you. He's a he's a good he's another one. You can tell he's a good person. Good 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 guy. You know. It's Birkin time. Yeah. You bitch. Can I? All right. There we go. You mutant. Oh shit. Get off me, fucks. Fucking little aliens. The fuck? You still here? Check that health. Step on this fucks. Damn it, you're annoying. Come on! Oh, you little fuck. Stop it! Annoying fucking little shits. Get the fuck out of here, man. You know what? I'm tired of this. Just fucking hell. I'm fucking staying here, those little shits. Fuck that shit. I'm out of here. <laughs> Fuck that. I missed a related message. Yeah, sorry. Happened. I already have. Is that on top here? Is that the one? I, I already have the GBA Everdrive cartridge sitting here. I'm just waiting to play. Shout out to Muffin Killer who sold it to me for like 60% of the cost. Oh, sorry, I missed that. It was right, it was right here. It's too visible. That's pretty cool. Uh, you know, when people sell you. that all about running off like that was reckless and stupid those zombies are everywhere not to mention that thing that got Ben I was there Leon I know look Ada as an officer it's my job to look out for you but we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together okay all right we'll do this your way for now Have it your way. Yeah, it's pretty cool, Cat. So I got a GBA Everdrive. Good shit, good shit, good shit, good shit. God, there's gonna be fucking spiders here, isn't it? How's your health? Oh, for your health, Dr. Steve Brew. Reload everything. Fucking piece of shit took a lot of my fucking. I work hard for that fucking the shells, you asshole. That mutant. Anything here? I love the sound of the water here. I don't like. It. 
I just wanted to say in good faith and whenever I remind you that you missed a match, there's never went in mazda or whatsoever, just find that out. I fully understand the situation, just want to make sure and say that. It's always feel like an asshole at that point. Oh no, don't worry about that. I welcome that. <laughs> because I don't want to, I personally feel disappointed when I miss a match. It's going to be a challenge for me here, to be honest. I'm not, not the kind of person that likes to ignore stuff. I don't know how this channel is going to go, Cat, but if he, if he was, you know, the chat gets bigger, it's it does break my heart a tiny bit because it would be it's not possible to read everything, right? So when I see big streamers, I oh, know, look, I'm not, I know I'm never going to get that big or even big, probably not. This is a very niche thing. I've, I'm very aware of it. And if it's, if it's this year, what we're doing now, I'm, I'm happy with it. It's 100% fine. And in fact, that's what I'm prepared to be, right? I'm not going to be streaming here consistently because, uh, oh, and I got to schedule because I'm thinking the numbers are going to, no, dude, it's, it's a very niche shit, you know, and I'm not for everyone, but if I was to get uh, big to the point it becomes impossible to read chat, I do have a plan that will keep you, Shiro, CRT, and 4K, the folks covered, it'll be different. Um, I'll mention it. If, if we ever get to that, there's no point in discussing it now. So, so yeah, uh, that's where I'm at. So, no, I never take offense to that. But I, I like to point out, to be, to be honest, and say that, uh, look, I, I'm liable to, to, to miss. Yeah, the Discord chat. I think it's a good, I think it worked. I don't, I'm not sure why not. I, I, I don't want to, if I ever get there, I don't want to ditch the, the folks that got me there. You know what I mean? And I, I, I will do my best not to. Um, but this is very hypothetical. It's like talking about winning the lottery, you know, because it's, it, look, nothing's going to come out of this. Let's face it. It's fine, you know. Um, but I'm saying, yeah, when you, you tell me that, that's 100% fine. But I do have to say, I like to say, because for other people, because like you go and this is the reason why I say, and again, I also don't mean any animosity of any kind, uh, but I understand what, is, um, what you're saying. Because it's like, uh, if I don't say that, I, th I, I have the fear that some other people will think the same than everybody's telling me. Go back, you didn't read it, you didn't read it, <laughs> you know? Uh, but I'm not saying you're doing that. I'm saying that it's good as, to let people know that I'm trying my best, but my best is not good enough sometimes. Tonight it is. I, I don't know why I missed that message. It was right literally on top of it. <coughs> in CRT, in 4K, I have the chat monitor. I used to have the tiny one here. This is working well. I think the new chair made a difference. I think uh, the bed was way, way lower. So I had to really go like this. And for me to read chat is this. Look, this is me. I don't know how to look at a camera. I feel stupid. So when I'm, when I'm talking to you, I'm looking here at this monitor. I don't, I can't wrap my head around looking here when I'm talking to you. And when I look at here, it doesn't look like I'm facing you. I think this is as close as it gets, right? So when I'm looking here, I'm looking at the monitor. Uh, this is me looking at CRT. Obviously, you see me playing. And chat is just like this. So it's, it's been great. It's, it's barely any effort, I think, because the chair is higher and it's been, it's been great. Uh... Yeah, I, I do the same thing, CRT 4K. I see a lot of masters. Some of them are bangers, like funny, funny stuff, right? And I feel sorry. Let's take a shower here. Ada, join me. Come. Come. Come, my dear. So I... Yeah. But it's not possible. Yeah, when you have a lot of chat and you're playing the game, you will miss some. But, like, when Cat... What Cat did there is, is beyond appropriate because uh, he was talking about something that I read, but I missed the first part. So, yeah, of course. And there was no reason I missed the first part. It was right there, like I said. Hey, this spells out. You know what this spells out? Spider. Fucking spiders. I don't I don't think there's going to be... Hmm, it's going to be spiders like here, where I've just been. Uh, and absolutely, uh, feel free to repost. Uh, not spam, repost. If you post your message two or three times and nothing came out of it, I don't, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I'm sorry. You know, but uh, if something, something is important to you, repost, it's fine. I don't, I never got annoyed with repost unless like somebody was like reposting. Welcome to the chat room. Welcome to the chat room. Welcome to the chat room. That would be annoying, right? And I, I mean, in any case, I'll just tell the person, hey, could you stop it? That's all. I'm pretty direct. Like it. I never go like off the side of my mouth when I want to offend you or I'm angry or annoyed at something you did. I would tell you directly. Um, 
or try my best here. Yeah. Never like repeating a question more than a couple of times, usually because I feel like an ass, or usually I figure out it's a stupid question. If I see your question, I will answer. If I didn't answer your question, it's because I didn't see it. There's no way that I will look at a question and read it, because I already did, I already put the effort, I saw it, put the effort of reading, and then I'm gonna choose to say nothing. If it's bad, I'm gonna say, that's, I'll reply to it in one way or another, or I will at least acknowledge it. If it's a, a question, not a statement, right? I don't need a save here, because we, we already save before barking. I'm not saving all the fucking time, you jackass. Forget that ink ribbon. Yes. So if I, yeah, if you post a question or anything, I, I generally did not see it. That's pretty much what, what, what we're, we're at. Shit blends in, yeah. So Box says, uh, this is the right size for a stream audience. Yeah, that's hard though, because I can't control like the numbers of the chat. Let me drink some coke, I'm getting thirsty in this bitch. So yeah, if you get bigger, look, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. But yeah, when it's a thousand plus, I don't know. That, when, when I think when it reaches a point that's a thousand plus, then you reply to pretty much nothing. You just pick and choose a message here and there. I mean, I've seen, I seen Max. He has ten thousand people. He barely talks, so people get used to it. I think if it was that was the case, I'll just concentrate on talking. I think if you're small and you're ignoring chat, that's bad, right? That's if you have ten thousand viewers, that's you'd be mad if you're answering chat, you know. So you know he he like looks at a master random. I don't even know how he does it. You still think subscribers? You know I. Uh, I don't know how he does it. It's a lot of hard work. I don't know how I would do it. Of course, I'm never gonna have that many viewers. And I'm just saying, if I was in his shoes, I don't, I don't know. I don't know how he does it. Uh, but I think at some point, when you get a lot of views, uh, you might as well just play the game and talk, and just every now and then look at the chat. And the chat would talk among, amongst themselves. You know, that's how I, I think I see it. I, because I know for a fact you. You cannot be replying to 10,000 people. Granted, not all of them are chatting, but a good portion <laughs> enough that it, it just goes do 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 do. I don't, I'll be very lost, to be honest, but I'll manage, you know, if, if, I, if I was in his shoes, I'll make it, you gotta make it work. Just pretend it's the same. I don't, I already don't look at views, so I don't, I have no idea if my channel is growing on views or, I only know it's because of the VODs, but I, that's only live views, so I, I don't know the, I keep him, I keep myself in the dark from the views. I know this low mode is a thing, but I know it is not is not is physically impossible for a big streamer to be talking to their chat all the time. It's just not possible. It's physically impossible. That son of a bitch! It took a lot of my fucking ammo, man. A prick. Fucking weirdo. Sewer manager facts. Connecting facility. <clears throat> On the first and third Wednesdays of the month, Angelica Margaret, chief of maintenance, will make use of the facilities. Be sure to reduce the moisture levels in the facility by activating the fan, as the equipment she will be using is susceptible to the effects of water vapors. On the 28th of every month, the chemical transporter Don Weller will use the facility. The chemicals he will be transporting are extremely uh, volatile. Extreme caution should be observed throughout their transport. On the 6th and 16th of every month, Police Chief Brian Irons will visit the facility to attend the regular meetings and take uh, the meetings that take place in the lab. On the fourth Friday of every other month, William Birkin we we'll use the facility to conduct a training seminar for the Chicago branch of the Umbrella Incorporated. 
As the probability of an attack upon Dr. Bergen will be high, take every measure conceivable to guard his life. You will be informed of all other potential visitors and the times that will arrive as needed. Guide these individuals to their destination safely. We expect nothing but the best from you, Charles Coleman. Secretary Chief of Umbrella Headquarters. Can't wait to become big so I can pretend I'm Mr. Master just. <laughs> Good shot. It's liable to happen. Uh, and Loyola, sorry, I mean, when I'm at any personal live streams, no complaints towards you personally. I'm just trying to see if there was anything. Look, uh, y'all, uh, when you're here, it, please don't need to walk on eggshells. And I'm not a monster. I'm not gonna rage on you and get red here. Uh, I, I'm very rarely offended. So I don't even know what you're referring to, Salamander, to be honest. Repeating a question, yeah. Uh, no complaints. If you had complaints, it'd be fine. You know, complaints are fine. You can complain. I'll ignore you, but <laughs> I'm kidding, all right, I have to listen to some complaints. If they're bullshit, like, you're in the wrong category, you should be on that, all oh, that shit, just get out of here, like, right? you know, but, uh, yeah, complaints are fine, you know, there's constructive criticism sometimes, it can be helpful, but, you know, sometimes a person's not looking for notes, I know you can't open this here. Uh-huh. Chase made a... So yeah, Salamander, you're okay. All y'all are okay here. Hey, Narto of Fox is here. Uh, Narto of Nine Fox. I'm sorry, I keep ignoring the numbers. Hello, my Rex. Are you scared yet? This has just been a few moments. Resident Evil 3 is my favorite. Rex and Jill is my favorite character. Character Leon is my favorite and Jill. I, I, I would say they're... I like both of them. I think Leon a tiny bit better. It's pretty cool, Hoss. Get overlay here. So what do you what do you aim on doing with that? What are you trying to accomplish here? Overlays can be good. I've seen some streams that have overlays and I think they look neat. Uh, for me as Resident Evil 2, this one here is my favorite. Uh, the third one I'm I'm not as familiar with it. I think there'll be some I think it's a secret bonus. Bonus? Boner level. God damn it. Something about the light here. Oh, she was the light again. Oh, that's a, that was a no-brainer. I was expecting some... I, I, I thought for some reason it was some bullshit over here. Yeah. Magnum ball is excellent. Benissimo. Another one here. Light them up. Good to see you on Arto 9 Fox. Bling, 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 bling. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Just commercials for when you want to leave for eight hours. Oh, I got you. Oh, yeah, and you don't want to leave. No, that's 100% behind that. You don't want to leave. Uh, um, your CRT on for commercials the whole time. I wouldn't sacrifice my CRTs, especially you. your CRT is so good for that. So good, good capital idea. Capital idea, Shays. And I mean it. That's a capital idea. Because, yeah, that'll be... Because I forgot how you do the commercials. So, yeah, you don't want to leave your fucking CRT on the whole time. Man. That'll be fucked. I don't even watch movies. I'm so paranoid. I don't even watch movies on my Trinitrons. There is a very rare occasion. It's a very special moment. Moment when I uh, when I watch when I watch movies. Every now and then, very rarely go on the third or four and say, "Want to watch a movie in this?" Fuck it. Let's do it. It's a special prime time. Hey, hey, calm down. So yeah, I don't blame you. That that's the right thing to do. Yeah, and there's always also the screen burn it could happen 
you're trying to suck on a yellow game kid she is taking the nipple. <laughs> good stuff, good stuff. Magnum, that's good, that's good. I want to save the Magnum here. I don't really fucking around with it. Uh, there's no reason to save here. That's what I usually do. It's like, ah, oh, what if I save now because it's inconvenient? No, dude, it's, it's like, oh, sorry, I didn't wait for either. She'll come, she'll come, she'll catch up. Leon, that woman was... I have to talk to her. <laughs> I just got, took a shot for her and was like, I gotta talk to her, sorry. So it says, he has lost consciousness due to the shock from the bullet wound. The wound does not seem to be mortal. I think the last part is more about not making it look like a jackass. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you can imagine. You took a bullet from me. Now it says, I gotta talk to her. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Okay, let's see on that. We can come back here, I suppose. Uh, I mean, uh, the game kind of wants me to go here now. I know I'm aware of the ladders and stuff, so... Let's just follow the script. Oh, the zombies here. My sack of shit. Really? Oh, it's just a regular dead body. It was a zombie, zombie apocalypse. What weapon? Choice? Shotgun. Take a shotgun for close quarters. I saw a shotgun. I would... I think it's holding something. I don't need this right now. Oh, this is gonna be for Leon. That's what's going on. Oh! You're fucking joking. Where the fuck did that... What? Where did you come from? Where the fuck did you come from? Where the fuck did you come from? There was nothing here. I hate the spiders. I hate I hate the spider because it's a poison shit. Now I gotta fucking rush here to see if I find fucking... Son of a bitch, son of a fucking bitch, son of a fucking goddamn bitch. Blue orbs, I need blue orbs immediately. Because it'll suck your, I, I think it'll suck your health all the way down to danger. I need blue orbs, I need blue orbs, I need blue orbs. I, is that? Fuck all this shit, I need blue orbs. I need blue orbs now. Don't move. You're the one who's with that cop, if I'm not mistaken. Identify yourself. Ada? Ada Wong. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John, I believe. How did you know? Who are you? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus. William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this, you will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? It's capable of creating the ultimate bioweapon. Its potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is... Precisely... My husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. This way. It's sheer perfection. My precious G-Virus. No one will ever take you away from me. Mm -hmm. 
There he is. So you finally come. Doctor, we're here to collect the G-Virus sample. Sorry, but I won't just hand over my life's work. Stop. You might hit the sample. That's it, all right. Okay, let's move out. William. Oh, my. Hold on, darling. I'm taking care of that bullet wound first. Stay here. Alpha team, have you retrieved the sample yet? Affirmative. We'll be at the rendezvous point in one minute. Roger. <gasps> Are you telling me that he injected the G-Virus into his own body? The G-Virus has the ability to revitalize cellular functions. What, what, what was that? Something's wrong. Let's check it out. Over there! Shoot! Eat this, you freak! I'm, I'm stopping it! What is this thing? What, what is this thing? Fire! Fire! You son of a... So those rats were the carriers of the virus. As a result of his virus-induced transmutation, William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human by now. Even worse, every G-Virus bioweapon, including William, has the ability to implant embryos into other creatures. And create offspring. No. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> Too bad, what a weird time. Ah, uh, good shit. Uh, I'm still poisoned. Oh fuck, I gotta hurry here. No danger already, fuck, it's over. The whole cutscene, I'm poisoned. Listen to all that garbage. No healing, I oh, I have a first aid spray. Come on, bitch. Give me fucking... Dragging my feet here to hold. I can't believe a fucking spider pooped on me. Son of a bitch. <sighs> Look like what now? Oh my god, how the fuck am I gonna get past the fucking spiders, dude? It's not possible. I'm gonna die now. You realize that? Let me see here. Shot is on the katana. Yeah, this lap was funny. Yeah, katana's good. It worked well, well for Michonne. Michonne. Shot it beyond. Yeah, uh, four to five leave, leave uh, fewer entrances. And anything that goes through there comes near you. Just blast it. Done. I'm gonna die here. There's no way. I can't believe the fucking spider, spider fucking poop poison on me. Fucking cocksucker. There was no sound. Come on. There was no sound. I get there, the whole fucking place is empty. And then all of a sudden, a poop. And where's the fucking... Okay, I guess it don't matter. Oh, right? well, you're already poison. There we go. Ada. Yeah, I, I think it didn't. It didn't matter here at the end. Uh, I'll check here first. What's the uh, what's what's the hubba bubba? 
Can we, can we go up here? What are you on about? Okay, how about the other side? Let's see, where are we at? Okay, let me... Okay, did I, did I come from here? Right? Came from here, apparently. Uh, alright, and... God, I'm gonna blast this fucking... Yeah, uh, learn my lesson. Let's go ahead and get a blue herb here, just in case. I know it takes inventory space, but hey. Giant flyback. <laughs> Micro penis. <laughs> every I feel like every stream does a, some some reference to micro penises. It's good. Good for the family. I'm not saving here. Come on. I right, just get get a blue herb here. I could swear there was like a uh, perennial blue herb in there. You know, this was nothing but cutscene. I know I'm deviating here. Going to the problem with the spiders are. I don't think they're usually a big threat if you run away. I just didn't expect them to, to be there. You know, all of a sudden pooping on my fucking face there, pooping poison and shit. That was fucking annoying. It's okay. Now I know, assholes. So, move quickly. Great haste. Come on! Pick it up. Yes. Yes. That's it. Get out. Get out. Because they, they like... They poop from above. Come on, come on, come on. No, no, the, the body, dude. Boo, boo, boo. Check everything. God, I didn't check that dead body there. <clears throat> oh, I missed that chat from our... There's a spider here. Uh, someone in my little town was looking for a CRT. I was being lazy with putting up the CRT as I wanted for sale, so it was a good time and contacted the guy, so I'll see what happens. We'll have to get seven bucks for my Phillips. Oh, you're selling your Phillips. Shit, spike. No, 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 no. No. Bitch. Wasted it. Wasted it. Uh, we'll have to return here eventually. That's what I was remembering. Wasted a shotgun shell here for nothing, bitch. Damn. Fuck. Yeah, thank. This has been a complete waste of time. I did get some, uh, so valve. Okay, that's a pain in the ass later. Uh, you don't have much of fear here for the poison, I guess, because there's a, there's a thing there. Jugs is damn... Oh no, I've been poisoned. What will I ever do? You're dead, you're dead. I want those fucking spiders that one of them got, has got to die. No, I just did. Okay. She did cause. Okay, no, that's it. I'm killing that one. Chew, chew. Son of a bitch. Get out. Out! Get out. That's enough. Can't wait. Come on, come on, come on. Bitch, you fucking bitch. Had enough of your shit. You use the door alone, you fuck. All right, come on. Come on! Come on, you fuck. Fuck out of here. Fucking pastor me. Let me do my fucking thing here, bitch. Sick of your shit. Put that in. Save yourself some inventory space. Now we're gonna go up. 
I don't have there. You like it? Fuck with me, you fuck. That's the limit for my fucking patient. It's four shots of uh, shotgun, but fuck me, you know? Pass for me. No, 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 not you. Not the hose here. That's, that's too much. You gotta save some of the shells here. Crap, did I go here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> the fuck? How? In here. God damn it, I didn't expect the fucking fan to be on. What am I to do now? Is this where I came from? No. Hmm. Let's get this thing up. Gotta do some thinking here, huh? do some fucking thing so how I can can use a fan is there a switch in there perhaps hmm maybe there's a switch in there Chuck says damn fine fine CRT no I see I've seen that already no blue herb all the sun is I saw that incredible I only sold one CRT in my life it was actually a Panasonic 21 inch would you know he was, uh, I was irritated, it, he wouldn't accept NTSC composite, so I sold it. Guy came to pick up in person. I do have a blue orb. Is there a switch by that fucking, probably the fucking spiders that won't fuck off in there. Yeah, but how the fuck, man? Okay, check the map. But I came from there. No, wait, here. Here we go. I, I know that it's just bad. Ah, uh, to the... Shut up. Check, check this guy quick. There's nothing. Shit. I killed the ones here. I did. I, yeah, they're done. God damn it, I can't get in there. How the fuck? Wait. Right here. But I can't. The fucking... Oh, bitch. I got it, bitch. I got it. I got it. I fucking got it. God, I'm a dumb animal sometimes. Fucking... Where the fuck is my head? I gotta get the fucking valve, dude. Fucking valve. Okay, we got it. What I like about Resident Evil is that a little bit, just a tiny bit of microscopic thinking and you, you get back on. You get your groove back on, huh? Go away. I'm reading Super Fudge. Come on, dude. Fuck around here. Yeah, I gotta get the fucking uh, valve. That's it. God damn, all this bullshit walking here for nothing. That's what I need to do. Not sure if I'm gonna fight Bergen. I think it's I think it's time to save. You know, you're getting hurt here, you're getting lost. Fuck me, I wanna do that shit again, so <clears throat> do a save here. A lot of cutscenes. Uh don't need this here, there's one right there, so it ain't ribbon seven, this is still okay. Let's go. Yeah. Eh, let me see, make sure I have everything I need here, so I'm safe. So, bullets, shells, uh, heal an item. Don't need a blow herb right now. So, yeah, that's good. That would do. Got a 
need to spawn. It's too short. Showing that eight legged prick in his own weapon. <laughs> Good shit. Keep the sunny. So, Cat, you're officially a sunny. Sunny. Sunny fan now. Sunny fanboy. Heal yourself. No, uh, I tell you why not. Because uh, I'm on caution. So, using a, a full herb here, it's, it wouldn't make sense. And the, the green herb by itself is shit. So, the best thing to do is just be aware that if you take one more hit, you're endangered and you're safe and you, it recovers your whole health and you got a, a free hit in there. So I, I, I fucked up earlier and I healed one time. I was on caution. I put, uh, I used a green herb and uh, it did, it went from caution, orange to caution yellow, so it doesn't do much. You could combine two, two, combine two green herbs, that's a waste. You wanna always try your best, you combine a green and a red herb and use it when if you recover your full health. That's what you wanna do around here. Well, that's what I always done. So you save as much resources as possible. See, modern game and you can heal a gazillion times. Hell, some, most modern games you just stand around and you're, you're healing, but not not here, man. You gotta you gotta really watch out as a survivor or you gotta watch out your inventory. A few times here I've been very low on bullets. You can be shooting every zombie, you can be blasting everything. You just gotta manage your inventory and be conservative with your spending here. Yeah, so but I'll show you in a bit. Let me, let me go ahead and save you. I did mess up one time. It was my fault with the dog. I thought the dog did a super fucking crazy jump, but turns out what happened is I, I was on caution already, so I took a hit on danger and it was too fast and I didn't pay attention. It was my fault. So basically, see here, I'm on uh, now. When you're on danger, obviously you gotta heal. So this here will heal your full health. So if I take one more hit, so if I heal now, I'll go to fine. I go one step above, but then I could have taken one hit. I could have saved this for one more hit if I get hit because I got hit and I'm still walking normally. So you want to you wanna go in danger and just heal quickly. Yeah, I got the valve, okay. So that's what we needed. And the blue herb, I don't need it because it's right there. Th those blue herbs don't go away. That's why in an apocalypse, I'm, I'm going with you. I think I would fare okay in an apocalypse. I lived off the grid before. I lived like a mountain man in the desert before. I think I could manage. You never know, you know, one mistake and you're fucked. You can't always stay confident on it, that you're, you're gonna make everything, you know? But at the same time, you gotta have some confidence, yeah? <laughs> Extract ball says, I'm liking the patriotism. To protect and serve. That's what we do, sir. Okay. Uh, God bless America and zombie killing. Excellent. And Cat Ray says, I'm against other brands. And thank you, uh, Extract Ball. That's the spirit. That's the American spirit. I'm not against any other brand of CRTs, but all the Sonny's just happen to be. Yeah, I like Sonny's. I'm not unhappy with any other CRT brand I have here. In fact, I'm very impressed. But I just I just like Sonny's. Sometimes it... I don't know, sometimes there's no rhyme or reason for something, right? Just like something. A lot of people do, so we're not alone on that. All right, let's go. I don't know. Yeah, they're alive here. Yeah, fucks. Don't touch me. Don't actually touch me. Don't ever touch me. Imagine the giant generator. Yeah, I, uh, I live with generators and, uh, Two stroke, that was fucking hell. I bought a four stroke later on. Uh, it's tough, living off the grid is not easy. I live completely off the grid, get my water, uh, do everything, and it's, it's, not, it's not easy. It's, it's, it's a lot of fucking work. The trash, the water, uh, the power is, is the hardest. If you have no solar panels, none of that, you know, you have to do with the generator. <laughs> Uh, and you have to be very, it's like survival horror, but with electricity. Uh, no, no TV. They do have 12 volt TVs, but still, at the time they're highly inefficient. Lights, you gotta preserve them. It's just a bare fucking minimum. A fridge running on, off propane, right? It's actually have to light the fridge. It's a little trailer. Um, yeah, a shower propane. 
Uh, heat and propane. So I try to stay on propane as much as possible because, you know, it's a finite resource, but you, you can buy more. And electricity, it's, it was I'll come home from work and I work very hard and turn on the generator. And my wife was with me. My wife lived off the, lived off the grid with me. So, yeah, it's tough. Uh, batteries take forever and the fucking thing is loud and it got a lot of problems. You know, the spark plugs and shit. And I got a four stroke. I still have them. They're under the trailer here right now. I just haven't had. Actually, I did use them first time. See, when you, you learn to be self sufficient, first time when I moved here, the guy said, You can move in any time. <clears throat> and we did. We brought the trailer here. It was paid to, to bring it here in our big truck. And we got here. Guess what? They didn't have the fucking electric done. And I had to work next morning. I had to ask for a day off. That was awkward because the place was very strict. And uh, but I had the four stroke. I took the four stroke out that I hadn't used for a while. Um, because just before that we had left living living off the grid to live on a farm with the electric and everything. But I didn't get soft as you remember, so I took out the four stroke, which sounds a lot better. Um, and hooked up the propane to it, and we have power for twenty four hours. While you have the generator on. The one time I would play uh, games, I actually had a flat panel and I, an Xbox 360. That's what I had. It was the only console I had. Uh, yes, uh, we could play while this, the generator was on. The generator off now. So. I knew a cousin. A cousin of mine had a PS4. Uh, sorry, PS4. You <laughs> can imagine back then having a PS4. PS1. And that's the first time I saw Trinitron. Uh, his pretty sure it was a fucking 100 percent sure it was a, it was a trinitron it was a sony so it was a silver one with composite it's the first time i saw composite i thought it was fancy i only did rf down yeah hank here with a propane a propane is great i do like propane we still use it we have propane here some big tanks and we use it for cooking only uh i was using for in shower but the shower is that there's a problem with it now I want to do electric because electric here is included. So, but for cooking, it lasts forever, man. It just lasts forever. I think that's like a cutscene for render. Mm, maybe not. No, it's in game. So that's what we needed to do. Beautiful. Beautiful bastard. So what do you want to do here? Because I think you're going to... Every time you get past this, because I fucked up here before, you want to do it again. So, because you go up yonder, and you're going to have that bridge. And if you don't, you have to come back here. It's kind of a pain in the ass. So I'm going to go ahead and, and put that up. We just saved anyways. You prepare yourself for up, upstairs. <laughs> Cooking we gas for me is wild unless... is on a grill outside. Yeah, the the gas is is outside. We don't use the heater for gas because it's too expensive. And the other trailer actually was okay, but I and again with it we're not hooked up to electric. So now here we are. So we use electric all heaters and stuff. So the propane has been relegated just to to uh, cooking and only because it's so cheap that it, it lasts forever. So it lasts a long time. But yeah, <laughs> the propane accessories. That's uh, I can't live without. I can't live without TV. I would read it. That's what I did when I lived in the desert. There was no TV. There was no TV at all. Uh, I read a lot of books. Just a lot of books. A lot of them. And it was good. You forget all about the shit soon enough. You know. Let me tell you. Uh, you do. You don't think you would be able to, but you do. Uh, about three days, I forgot everything else existed when I was there. It was a very unique situation. Mm, could have saved here, ha ha ha. Fucking Navarro. I like when they had the, oh, fucking shotgun here. I'm not sure what my friends had. I never paid attention when I was a kid. I, I just knew about the sun because it was a hand-me-down one of my parents. Let me keep the Trinitron in my room. And about my childhood TV, a 14 inch that I, I threw out all the way from the Atari all the way to the N64 when I stopped using 
and I really, really wish I had that set still. It bitters my heart that I don't have it. It was a Philco RF on the set. Yeah, it's a good set. That was okay. Served me well. Man. Oh, shit. Well, don't fuck up. I just saved. It's okay. It's not that bad. I mean, it's annoying to go through the, uh, through that shit again, but. Yeah, I just use this. Okay. Yeah, here we go. You ready? <clears throat> Goodbye, sir. No. It was not as stylish as I wanted it to be. I want to say goodbye, sir, but <laughs> yeah, I was too eager there. There you go. My 29 inch has gotten some users for sure. It's not as bright as my 21 inch, but nothing to worry about, right? It takes a few seconds for the black to come in. When it comes in, those are just asking because you're the boss. Very fine. Speaking 15 to 20 seconds to kick in proper. Nah, that's fine. I wouldn't worry much about it. Um, that when it comes in, though, does it look good? Does it look bright, vivid, and colorful? Or does it look tired and dim and dull and washed out? What does it look like when it comes in after it warms up? Bad time to lose your head, feller. You got it, Chief. That's it. What the fuck is this? I'm going to hurt him. Beat you. Are you intimidated by any games? that you know you would enjoy but it's still void because you get whipped. I have some games that I avoid because I get scared to be honest. F Fatal Frame is one of them. Alien Isolation is one of them. We don't want a pink ribbon here. I suppose. It looks like all the city stress has been done here. Uh, fighting games. Uh, Dead by Daylight would be another one. That one adds because it's hard and you get your ass whooped, you get tea bag, you get flashlight to the face. I enjoy more watching than I don't think I want to play it. I did play it. Maybe with friends. And again, I, th I think most fighting games are a bit like that. You go online and just get your ass whooped. So it's not that I'm afraid. I'm not ashamed of getting whooped in a video game because it's a fucking video game. Leon. Oh. This bullet wound isn't making things any easier. Quiet, Leon. I'll patch you up. That's two I owe you. Don't mention it. I just found out. John's dead. What? Never mind. Let's just get out of here. The sooner the better. I was just listening to that tune the other day. The extended version is so nice. It's so nice. Ada's thing. Can't remember everyone I was talking about getting chased by the alligator. Yeah, the alligator first time freaked me out. I don't think I died on it though, ever, to be honest. If I did, I don't remember. Um, can't remember if I. You can kill it with bullets, you don't have to do that thing. I did. Well, most people do it though. 
Why wouldn't you? Excuse me. See, if you, if you didn't do that shit I did downstairs, that's what I'm talking about. I have to go all the way back. It's so fucking annoying. Why? Okay, let, let's take a look where we at here. My dear Ada. There's two, two places to go. What's in here? Oh, there's gonna be there's gonna be stuff here. You okay, Ada? I'm a bit stuck there. <laughs> I think fighting games are great, but uh, I have not been good at them since the Soul Calibur days. Well, fighting games, uh, when it comes to my content with them here, Alone in the Dark is scary. Yeah, that is. I play Alone in the Dark with my cousin. We were sharing. We're playing on emulation, and he's overseas, and I share in save files, and but he, I, I think after a while he tuned out. Uh, yeah, it was, it was, it was scary. I'm actually happy I still get scared of games, video games, because it's good. I still retain that childlike wonder of games. Uh, it never sort of went away from me. Fatal Frame damn near kills me. <laughs> I'm fucking, I'm sweating the whole game, I'm like literally sweating. The Japanese horror. Just disturbing. I was looking for a reply yet. I can't fucking see. Verifying it. Like, we're, spe we're speaking 15 to 20 seconds for it to kick in proper. We got as good without. I'm being mindful of not cranking it as it not to suck more life out of it for no reason. It looks decent, but I'm, I think I'm very used to the 21 inch that is extremely bright. It was sitting in a summer cabin before I bought it, so it, it probably wasn't used much. When it comes out, when a, a tube is tired, yeah, so it looks like the tube is a bit tired. It was used. I do have, of all my CRTs, I do have one that the tube is actually tired. My wife still thinks it looks great, but I, I can see it. It kind of, and I, and it was a most mystery, is a most mystery the one I had here. The badges missing, the people, they, it looks like it was well used. It's still usable, but yeah, it's a bit underwhelming when you use a tire tube. All my other CRTs are fine. I think that the Hitachi one I used was the most, the one that impressed me the most. And also the Sony Trinitron that I used on my very first, I think my very first video on YouTube, because the guy had two of them. And he used one, and the other one, and it was an old man. He wasn't fucking around or bullshitting. So the other one, he, he had sitting in an attic, and that's the one he sold me. And when he got here, I couldn't believe how bright and beautiful the tube was. I think that's the best tube I have here as far as brightness. Um, yeah, I would say so. I hope that was a reply I got. Uh, you should be fine just... Just bear in mind that it's a little, it's not going to be as sharp as the other or bright as the other one. The startup is, it's fine. There's plenty of people have tubes like that, that take a while to, to start up. It's been a while, but I saw Don today and we talked about completing our work. He told me he had been sick in bed until yesterday. It really doesn't come as much as a, of a surprise given how long he's been working here. He was sweating like a horse and kept scratching his body while we were talking. I asked if he was uh, if he was hot, but he just looked at me funny. What's wrong with him anyway? Chief Irons has been visiting the lab quite often lately. I don't know what's uh, what he's doing over over there, but he always looks grim. The expression on his face has been um, even more unsettling than usual. My guess is that's because the, of Dr. Birkin's impossible requests. Uh, the chief has my sympathies, though. After all, after all he's done for, for the town, he doesn't deserve this. I rarely drink because I'm a, I'm a graveyard shift, but I don't suppose I have much to complain about since this is how I make my living. Chief Irons come in late today. Came in late today looking grimmer than his, his usual self. I tried to joke with him to cheer him up, but he, he wasn't amused. He pulled out his gun and threatened to shoot me. I was able to calm him down, but that guy must have some serious problems. He knows he can't enter the lab without my help and my medal. This is why this is what it means for the chief to serve and protect. To protect and serve. That's what we do. Yes, sir, you you did just that. <laughs> 
William informed, William informed me that the police and media have begun the investigation of Umbrella's affairs. He said that the investigation will be citywide and that there is a possibility that they will even search through the sewers. He asked me to suspend all Umbrella sewer facility operations until the investigation has concluded. The sewer will still be used for passage, but he stressed that I have to be extremely cautious and that I'll lose my job if anyone finds out about this operation. It's the real deal, Ada. It's the guy here. That's That ought to be him. You're blocking the guy. You're being disrespectful. There we go. Was there a... Excuse me, madam? Love you still. Just slightly dimmer. Yeah, I'll be fine. Just want to... Yeah, okay. Forgot Turok 2 was another M-rated video game that was being hyped. Uh, Resident Evil 2 was probably the first video game I remember being highlight talked about. GTA 3, it was an axe. Everyone was going bananas. Turok 2. I, I only heard Turok 1 back in the day, to be honest. Every, everybody in my class was talking about it all the time. Guess what? I didn't like Turok. I don't like Turok that much. How do you do? Is it here? It came from the other side. Ada, you're on the wrong way. And regulator. So can we do it then? Okay. Yeah, what the fuck is happening? It says I can't stop it briefly here. What's the other uh, ladder here? There's another one, right? Yeah, Ada's theme is awesome. We came from there. Did we? I'm trying to fight back his knees. <laughs> and I failed. Do not question me, Serena. No, I got fucking up. It's it's toilet paper. What the f it's toilet paper from my nose. I'm sorry, it's like a bit gross. Because <laughs> I do uh, when I do it, sort of like nicotine pouch, but is what is loose. It's pretty much unsanded toilet paper, which is salad laws and I add flavoring and stuff. I know it sounds insane, but it basically, if you buy nicotine patches, that's what's happening. I think I ran out. Thank you. All right, well, so it's good to have a camera, see if I have crap hanging from my mustache and stuff. You can always spot it. It's like a mirror. Yeah, I need nicotine here. Los Los, yeah, pretty much. I've been asking, uh, I think uh, Ping is going to send me some Los News. I, uh, I used to, but they stopped. They stopped. They forbade. Uh, it's forbidden now. You can't, you can't, sh you can ship it here. Uh, you can buy it from here. It's very annoying. You should could. I uh, should buy uh, Los News uh, Thunder, and it was awesome. Uh, yeah, the world is getting more and more closed. I feel like it's more less freedoms. I should be able, as an adult, to just buy news here, and now I can't. It's done. Soapboxes. Full Rock was my religion for a few years. Yeah, sorry, I didn't feel with that game. Maybe the second or first. I did 100% of them. I persevered. I don't know why, but I didn't like it. I felt like it. Again, it's the thing I don't like. Running around uh, endlessly looking for shit. I don't know. It's just not for me. Y'all okay? Gucci? I heard a sound out there from the kid's bedroom. Scary movie is fun. Thank you for the blasphemy here. It's popular out there, uh, cat snooze. I know Ping does it. I'm not understanding about the, the fan here. So I can't stop it. So what's the problem here? Do I need a crank? Is that it? Yeah, no, it's saying I can't stop it, but how? I can't remember. Do I need to go down here somehow? Mm -hmm. 
Is this TV a uh, 14 inch? This one? Chat? Uh, yes. Yes, it is a 14. I play GTA games at friends' houses until my brother bought GTA 4 for his 360. I never played a fourth one. I played a lot of back in the day. God damn it, I came from here. Uh, I'm not understanding the fan thing. Sure, that's something I gotta do. I played, um... Everything okay? Huh. I played GTA... I didn't play GTA 3, uh, but I played Vice City on computers. Paid for computers. You pay to use a computer for a while. And I would play Vice City. That's all I would do. Mm. No, I hear you loud and clear, Leon, but uh, it's... You can stop... To, okay, you can stop with what? Is that the valve? Is that it? You fuck. I thought the valve... The problem is, I'm kind of dumb sometimes. I thought the valve was stuck at the end of that shit. Okay, let's go. Ada. Run. I never dare to do it, but I wonder if you're here long enough if the fan will turn on with you here and you die. Did they did they go to the trouble of animating that? Animating that the death on that? Ada, we gotta run. I think that's fine. <laughs> ah, crap. Ada, help me. Save me bullets. I'm a coward. Yeah, you can just wanna throw up on her. Come on, Ada. They're coming, Ada. <laughs> Ada! I'll hide behind you. I, I'm a sissy here. I, oh, I was gonna do it. What we got here? Hey, Pastor Plunger. How are you doing? Thank you for the raid and thank you for the shout out there for him, uh, Cat Crasher. How you doing, Pastor Plunger? Doing all right? I'm just Ada is pulling all the way here. <laughs> you save you save bullets, you know. Why would you want to spend bullets here? She can do it. By the way, little trick. I know it makes you look like a, an asshole, but hey, let's take a shower here. Take a shower with me here, Pastor Plunger. Beautiful. It's been a long night of. Roaming around Rackham City, we need to refresh with a, a sewer shower here. We're the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Maybe I'll have to bring some pizza in here. There we go. Ada, would you care to partake? I always love doing that. <laughs> Sue would y'all over his fucking face. <laughs> uh, hey, Pastor Farn, say, hey, loving the PBM. Oh, thank you. Yeah, Nar Narco and Nine Fox, because it's just, you know, it's... The AI is giving you bullets here. You might as well, you know. Where was the, uh... Yeah, this here's a 1970s set, Pastor Plunger. I believe a, a something from, what is it now, 50 years ago. Still still kicking here. It looks bright, it looks nice, it looks beautiful. It, it works perfectly. RGB as well. Yeah, yeah it's right here. Let's go, Ada. Rockman X6. Kick my ass. Is there more zombies here? I I, I killed the spider. See, that was a wise move. I never understood that much the water argument, right? It's I know it's a game. It's a gamey thing to do, but it's like... Even if the water was very strong, you, you could just jump through it. Oh, come on. It's, 
Nonsense here. I think I play Wipeout. Is there a Wipeout on the PS Vita? Because if so, then yes. Uh, no. I play a Future Research. It looked like F Zero. Let's see if it uncovered anything here. Maybe, uh, you know. Did it empty here? I wonder. Everything? Or just that be it? I'm a cure. I got a cure as mine here. Fed apart by some sort of edge, too. Is that the, the bodies of the hunk? The soldiers? The fuck is this? I find those sewers here actually interesting for a change. Yeah, it is the hunk. So that's all them. We can bark and fuck them all up. 1970 is that? 1970 is here. This thing weighs a ton. Yeah, super here weighs a ton. It's incredible how much it weighs. I'm, I'm surprised every time I pick it up. I, I tend to, f I'm so, I, I forget in how heavy it is until I pick it up again. It has a handle though. It, metal, all metal. Because they had to see the 80s they went. I love the style of the PVMs from the 80s, but they were very fragile over the plastic. Waterfall and my kids. Are you playing my kids? That game is not actually that bad, is it? It's, it's an okay game. I uh, never played a series, but I goofed around a bit here and there with that game, I remember. It's on the NES, right? Passive Plunger's gonna have to lurk. Yeah, no problem. Have some sleep. Take care and thank you, thank you very much for the raid. The podcast says it's been ported to the PS4. What as? I miss something. We actually watch TV sometimes, and they're not live TV. I, I watch YouTube to be honest. I'm mostly on YouTube. When I'm watching TV, basically I'm watching YouTube. That's all the TV I watch. Uh, I do watch shows like all pre-recorded stuff, like you know VHS tapes, DVDs, mm, Blu-ray. I don't have a lot of Blu-ray to be honest. I think I have like three or two discs. And thank you, Get Crash, for always polite to the guests here. I appreciate it. I didn't save, did I? I don't think I saved for a while. Go fucking around here. Once again, if you see zombies with with Ada, just just let her do her thing, man. I know it looks cowardly, and it's not something I would do in real life, but this is a video game. Right? You want to save your? Well, it's not now though. I uh, I don't think I like if there's no save here. I think I should have saved. I wonder if I every time I do that. Cause this is, is this a fight with fucking William Barkin? Because this is, it's a high chance of dying here. How, I mean a dog killed me. I mean, it was my only death, but still, it was a fucking dog. I'm a great bow shitter, the best actor there is. <laughs> no, I know you. <laughs> I know what you mean, it's funny. <laughs> Fucking thinking it was a save here. Oh man, I don't wanna I don't wanna repeat a lot of stuff. Because we're gonna get into that card and he's gonna come and Is is this a fight already? I'm very uneasy here. I, I'm sorry, I d I don't Hmm. I don't wanna get in this fucking card because I, I have memory of fighting with him barking. The Polecats follow. Thank you, the Polecats. I'm sorry, I'm thinking of backtracking here. And uh, saving. Did I save? I don't I don't think I saved for a while. Started to get a bit concerned here. Will it be on for another hour or two? Yeah, I'll be on. I'll be on for another hour or two. Definitely. Have you played Medieval? No, but I'm deeply aware of it. Uh, PS1 game, right? And uh, remade for the whatever modern console. Uh, it looks attractive for me. Definitely something that will be, it's on my watch list to play on the, uh, look, I'm gonna go around to see, go around here to see if I find any saves. I'm a bit, I'm, I'm a bit spooked by the size of that, uh, card. 
uh, because uh, I remember we didn't bark and so I, I don't know, man. Ada? Oh shit. Yeah. PSP and PS4. See, hey, it's funny, Ada just, she says, fuck you, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> Come back, you pussy. <laughs> no, come off it. I want to save. This is fucked. There's got to be a save around here, man. Get inventory. I need to unload some of this crap. No, this is... Right? Yeah, no. Fucking herbs and shit all over the place. Mm, the spiders, they they disappear. I just got to fucking remember where, where, where I'm headed here. It's, it's, it's actually, you'd it's, be surprised how much I can get lost. So it's, it's here, right? Is that, just... I don't know, man. Wait, 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 remember. Yeah. Is there a save here? Please just give me a fucking save. God damn you. I'm spooked now. I think I'm gonna, yeah. Hypno... Hypno TXC. Hi right there. There should be a save around here, right? This is right here. There you go. Yeah, I think there's the there's some funny monkey business there in that car. I don't wanna fuck with it. Awesome. I have to go admire my Wii on the CRT. That sounds good with a deflaker. I might I might pick your brain on that one because I maybe if you show me. If you don't mind getting on a phone call one day, not phone call, Discord call, if you ever have time on the day that you're off or something and guide me through it, I'll do the setup here with the Wii so you can see what I'm doing, you know, on a private uh, uh, call. Because uh, I uh, I look at the video, I don't know, I'm usually okay. I, I'm better hardware than, than software stuff. So... Something, something to think about. I'm, I'm more of a visual man. I would like to do the Wii stuff. Hey, got another rate. Holy dog shit. Six or five beavers. Oh, by gum. Christine, Tales of Matt follows. Welcome in, y'all. Hey there. Well, thank you very much. Thank you for the shout out there, cat. Uh, well, thank you. That's uh, might be one of the biggest raids I. Arcus? The Arcus? The other guy with the hat and mustache? Who happens to be good at video games? No fucking way. <laughs> uh, if it is, a big fan. And if it's not, then you're a fan. Then you're a friend of mine, too. Songbirder. Following? Well, thank you, right? We got some follow. It is Arcus. No fucking way. I got Arcus here. <laughs> that's, that's crazy, Christine. And she brought... Ark is here. No fucking way, man. Yeah, he's got the verified stuff and everything. Ark is, I'm a big fan of yours. I think, I think you're a very talented feller. And, uh, yeah, I don't even know what to say. I don't know to say the famous folks. But, uh, big fan of yours. I don't know how you play those games and, and hum the whole time and you're calm because I'm the fucking opposite. Don't, don't be mistaken by the mustache and the, and the hats. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, this is crazy. Well, welcome in. Let me tell you all a bit about myself. Uh, I'm a guy who plays on CRT is the end. Uh, the, the setup is, is all real. So it's all like tangible assets. Uh, sorry about the webcam and the shaking. Uh, what am I doing? There, there we go. I'm a big, a big doofus here. I'm new on the platform a bit. I had a touch sometimes on how things work, but uh, uh, pretty much I play games on, on different CRTs and I had this idea to record a thing like this for, for style. And I just play games. I'm not good at it. I'm, I'm, not, I'm no Arcus, <laughs> not even at 0.01%. I usually tend to be bad at games, uh, but it don't matter because I have fun. So this is usually what I, uh, what I do here pretty much. And today happens to be a Resident Evil 2 sort of day. Uh, it's all real hardware, but we got an ODE here, X station, so there's no disc spin, it's just an SD card, so it's been modernized a tiny bit. We're doing RGB on a 1970s uh, professional video monitor. It's been working for 15 years and still going strong. And uh, yeah, and I, uh, 
and I appreciate y'all. Uh, we all sucker for mustache cowboys. <laughs> Rex, uh, might, might be the brother separated a bird that was chained up in the attic. <laughs> like in the movies. I don't know if Arcus is here, but people say you should you should change your name to Darkus because they like Arcus, but on the dark side, <laughs> the dark side, no patience, no no talent in the games, and it could just just like Arcus, but the opposite with the darker mustache. <laughs> Crimson Ranger, swallow. Him. Thank you. Uh, I appreciate you all here. Thank you very much. Um, this is incredible. I really appreciate the uh, the raid. Thank you. And yeah, uh, so right now here I'm just uh, adjusting my inventory. And look, I'll say sometimes I'm, it's a calm day for me. But sometimes I'm, I'm a bit of a potty mouth. I have a temper. Not today. Today I'm calm. Not with the people in the chat, just with the games. I do rage a bit. Kind of an idiot sometimes. And often it's my fault. Like a talent. Tarentu. And, but yeah, but I, I do try my best, you know. But today has been chill. It's been it's been okay today for the most part. <laughs> well, it's funny because I got the name Arcus from an old monitor. You don't say. You know, I never stopped to question where you got the name for. I just assumed dumbly that your name was just Arcus. I can't believe I'm talking to Arcus here. I watch your streams and I I, I don't tend to chat on, on people's streams, especially the bigger ones. I just kind of watch and take it all in. My, my daughter, my 70 year old daughter, she knows you. She watches you playing the game. She loves it. And she's a big fan of yours. So my, my 70 year old. Yeah. It's it's fun. I never I never thought I, I'd see the day to, to have Arcus here. Thank you, Christine, for, for the raid and for bringing Arcus here. It's just surreal to me. <laughs> I appreciate it. Yeah, it was a friend of ours who said that. He said it made that joke. So also, you you like Darkus? <laughs> and I said, yeah, no, I watch I watch Darkus. I'm I'm all, I I don't know how anybody can have the patience to be like that calm. And uh, yeah, and you have a lot of talent. So I'm sorry if I'm we all my starstruck, but yeah, it's not every day I you know. I don't know a lot of content creators, believe me, I don't watch a lot of different content creators. Time is a limit limitation sometimes to save here. So, yeah, the few that I know to, to, to talk to them, you know, it's, it's amazing. Yeah, check Arcus, definitely. He's a, he's a, I mean, if you don't know Arcus, I think most people know Arcus. If, if, if you don't know Arcus, yeah, it's... You know what I uh, I gotta say I know I'm giving a lot of compliments here but they're well deserved they're well deserved uh, Arcus uh, I think one thing I appreciate about you and your speed runs when I watch I'm not a speed run guy I never tried it's not really for me but I like watching but I like you try a different variety of games and you have a lot of records on on different games and I, I find it remarkable because yeah you, there's some people that have records and not to take it away from them but they're just like one or two games and pretty much just focus on that they dedicate their life to that which is you know cool too. But it's cool to see somebody just picking, it's like, it looks like somebody, those people that pick an instrument, a musical instrument, just start playing, you know, time, you know. Uh, I'm the same, but in the opposite <laughs> way. I, I got the Midas touch in the opposite, everything I touch here turns to poop. But this game, fortunately, I'm somewhat familiar with it, you know. I'm familiar with it, so, but speed running and all that, that's not, not here. <laughs> if you come, if you come from, from work, expect, expect me to speed run now. It's the opposite of speed run, but uh, but we do have fun here, you know, and that counts too. But I'm I'm a big fan of you know seeing somebody with a lot of talent doing doing crazy stuff and <laughs> humming to the tunes. And meanwhile, I I'm here and I, I go like, what? What the fuck happened? <laughs> and it's usually my fault. Like I I got killed one time here by a, a dog. And I went on about the dog that never happened. All the years I played a Resident Evil, I never seen the dog going like this. And it was my own bullshit. What happened is I was on caution. The dog hit me one time. I was on danger. Didn't notice. The dog jumped on me, and the death animation uh, proceeded to, to play. And I was dead. And I was like flabbergasted. But <laughs> a little something I like to call reality. And Arca says I play uh, a lot of games over the years. Oh yeah, and I've seen you playing a lot of different, a, a huge variety of games, man. It's, it's remarkable, it really is.
This is like the angry video game nerd meeting with the irate gamer. <laughs> I get that. I get the uh, the reference through. <laughs> Good one. Good one. Scon was here. I think. Yeah, I, I like Scon. I tend to rate him quite a bit. He's, he's got the mustache. He's got. He's got the looks. He's got the touch. You know. A lot of good folks here. I've been enjoying the experience of streaming. I can't mean not knowing really what you expect from it. I, I've never, dude. If you ask me a few months, if you know, I fucking talk to Art, because I'd be like you crazy. I expect to come here and be watched by two to zero people for like a couple of years. And just I said, you know, I might as well. I'm playing games I like. I like to show the Syracuse. I might as well do this thing. And it's been great. You know, it's been it's been a lot of fun. I was having a lot of problems with the internet, and I'm happy it's gone. A friend of mine helped, helped me fix everything, and it's just been fantastic, you know. A pleasure having you all here, I really got to say, and this this really made my day. Uh, I'll tell my wife tomorrow, uh, guess who was uh, Christine raided, and guess who came with a raid? Arcus. And she, <laughs> it's a hood and a holler, let me tell you. I'm bragging about. It. I'm gonna brag to the school kids in a during a recess. Yeah, well, ooh, yeah, you got a PS5. Well, I met I met Ark is mm. <laughs> can't, can't type that. <laughs> you go on to I'm a personal friend of his. No, you're not. Okay, no, I'm not. That's bullshit. But but I did I did talk to him. <laughs> he did show up. <laughs> CRT Kim is brilliant. I might say. Well, thank you. It's, uh, yeah, all real stuff, pretty much. I got a, a Lumix here. It's shooting everything right here. And, uh, yeah, I'll show you here. I'm showing a tiny bit of... So, pretty much, there's a there's a camera right here. That's what's still not at work. And, yeah, I'm... <laughs> I don't have... I don't have an arm. I had it, but it's crap, so... I need to buy a better one. So, I just bought a shelf here. This, the shirt is here because it reflects on the CRT. I have a couple of lights. Uh, it's a very tiny room in a trailer actually uh and as a setup and i have the monitors i'll, I'll read you all's chat and yeah the monitor here and all the connections here and you know, not much to see and i just sit here with my gloves and mm, some water interesting stuff <laughs> Anonymous Gifter, Gifter Argus, uh, a sub. Well, thank you, Anonymous Gifter. I appreciate that. Some birder love, loves the CRT. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Y'all being fantastic. And uh, welcome in. I don't expect y'all to be here all the time, but I, I really appreciated uh, the moment you're here. You know? Black Squall follows. So thank you very much, Black Squall. I appreciate it. Welcome, everybody. And that's fantastic. I. Uh, Again, my internet was uh, kind of dog shit, uh, and I, I was kind of struggling here to keep up the stream, and it was, oh shit, scared a fucking bejesus out of me, Ada. So we, we're saved here, so we're a bit more prepared. So yeah, I, uh, and I'm so happy today because uh, since yesterday, my internet has been working fine. So it's, it's been great. I finally have the chance to, uh, to stream, you know, because I, I, I do enjoy it. I was a bit burned out, but not not because of, I was streaming too much, because I wanted to stream and I couldn't. So it's it's great to come here and look at this. I'm here tonight uh, and I got a good raid. I appreciate it and I meet a lot of new people. And some folks become some folks become regulars, and it's it's a great fun little hobby, you know. Fantastic. And again, Marcus. Ah, forgot I had to control this shit. Do I need to shoot this? I reckon I gotta shoot him. Well, do oh, it is doing it. I'll shoot you. Don't don't make him spend don't make me spend the bullets here. Ada, Ada, I'm my my weapon is malfunctioning. <laughs>
I, I would have helped, but I took an error to the knee. <laughs> Look, I want to, it's a survival of horror. I want to save my resources here. You know, Ada's got the gun, the unlimited magic AI gun, so let her <laughs> She's looking at me, judging me. You didn't do shit, coward. I did. I was, it, it jammed. The pistol stove piped. I couldn't, I couldn't really, <laughs> I couldn't really do it. <laughs> well, important thing is that nobody got hurt. So, so once again, uh, thank you very much, Arcus. Pleasure, immense pleasure to meet you. Um, and Christine, thank you so much. Um, definitely going to check you out. Arcus, I already know. Uh, thank you. Thank you for being here. And Arthur Fox, Rex, your amazing job. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, I think we uh, arrived at our, our destination. Should be good to go. Them two fellers in the mule are good to go. Yeah, I knew. See, I was afraid of dying there, which was nonsense, to be honest. But it's, I bet it'll be a save here immediately, right? Flare gun. Do I do that, or is that dumb? Fuck it. Oh, there it is. That's how it reveals itself. Heavy box key. Good stuff. Alright. Good fiddle. I remember, I don't remember much in Spartan Leon, but I do remember with Claire doing that, because I think the last time I played was on the N64, and I played with Claire. So that's what I, my last memory of this was. I remember Mr. Axe, yeah, he's scared the shit out of me. So, again, my gun seemed, appears to be malfunctioning here. Ada. <laughs> it's for the best, trust me. I know it looks silly, but... The amount of bullets you save here. Ada, there's a there's a mean guy here. He's, he's being he's been saying mean things <laughs> about me on Twitter. Ada's that kind of person. You dead for sure. <laughs> oh god. Uh, watch out, sometimes they come in for you dead. But there's another one. Ada, there's some guys in here. You mess with the wrong bull, young man. She, she's tough. Kind of, no, wait, it is just. It's come here. What's? <laughs> she's, she's catching on to it. Now, uh, I will go here. Latest first. <laughs> Leon is just sitting there. He's a common. Hey, saves you a lot of bullets, you know. <laughs> Later on <don't> the work. <laughs> I would my my weapon is it's locked. It's it's on caution. The uh appears to be a problem here. <laughs> He's fooling you, Ada. Don't let Ada, stop. <laughs> stop. Stop it. I'm bl Nope. Nope. No, no. Turn around. <laughs> Just trying to get out of it. They, uh, she knows. She, she doesn't run out of bullets. I'm, I'm sure she'll be fine. There you go. I... And now a guy shows up. Hey, what happened? Yeah, I had to kill all the zombies. She saved this lady. <laughs> you, you lying scumbag. All right, let's see what the map is here. <laughs> hey, a lot of errors. Let's see. Um, you ever seen a map and then forget about it immediately? Is there more mean guys here for Ada to kick their ass? <laughs> Uh, I kind of want to check the other area here. 
did, right? Or, or did I come from here? I didn't come from, did I? Good doofus. I'm sure they had. And it, and a Fowler's here. Ah, his line, Ada. Okay, that one I think I need to, I need to wake him up. Do I have the weapon here? Okay. You son of a bitch. Shotgun parts. I think we can upgrade our shotgun. I don't know what the hell it will do, but I'm in. So now we got what? The C shotgun. Thank you, sir. Ada. As as always, I'll, I'll be leaving. <laughs> Leave it to me. Good shit. Yeah, so that's a bit of a trick, obviously. Ada has... I don't think they'll let her run out of bullets. You mess with me, you mess with my partner. You understand? No, stop. We're not. It's a hell of a way of saving some ammo, you know? And I, uh, I've been sort of struggling a bit. Ada, face your fears. It's okay. I'm right behind you if you need me. You know he can count on me. Have a smoke and uh, celebrate. Are you coming, sir? I bet the minute I go in there, I knew it. I fucking knew it. No, this one is mine. It's personal. Fuck him up. I'm in. I'm in now. But not this time. This time, now the coast is clear here. That one was a bit per personal. <laughs> I'll block it. He's fooling you. Yeah, so all they do, I think, when they get near her is they, they throw up. <laughs> That's it. So make sure where I'm headed here. Is where I think I'm liable to have something here. All right, herbs. I like me some herbs. It's good, good stuff. Ended up with a lot of herbs. Been doing okay on the house stuff. TV Gazi, follow. Thank you, TV God. You're welcome in. And I love that. I'm glad I changed it. The, the, the PS1 boot sequence. A lot of times I forget to do that damn thing. Okay. Uh, where are we at? Head on upstairs. Is there a map to here? I hope I didn't miss a map somewhere. Sometimes I put them maps on the walls and it's easy to miss. Kind of blends in, you know, with the environment. Save, I love it. What do you got here? First aid spray. We got a lot of healing items here. And thanks to Ada, now we got a an endless supply of, of bullets. <laughs> I love it. Hmm. Thought it was sent. Magnum? Magnum rounds. Magnum, pick him up. Mess around with a Magnum, dude. Magnum is for the, the big boss. That's where I like to keep for the big guy. The shotgun, shotgun here. That's the thing, when you, when you play with a higher resolution stuff and emulation sometimes and other stuff, uh, even consoles, some other consoles, it, um, especially on the first one, um, the static image, I think they lost the, the they lost some of the originals, so they're all tiny. What you see in game is that that's it. So what happens is, uh, the 3D objects they are they stand out too much. It doesn't quite fit in, you know. You know, you know what I'm saying? Sound like mambo jambo to you a little bit? <laughs> yeah, we got we got the sprays. I haven't used one once. Uh, got Magnum here, out the ass, somewhere around here, there we go. Uh, we're keeping that key, we got a healing item. 
do a save, why not? I think we're doing okay on engravings. Maybe there's even more engravings here. There you go. boy. I love they reuse the spider theme for this game from the original Resident Evil. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, yeah, it's always nice when they, it's always nice when they do a little uh, throwback. Your spirit, uh, you know, to a previous time. I didn't, I didn't spoil anything in the Resident Evil 2 remake, because again, I'm excited to playing that game at some point. You know, I have been seen, I'm a patient gamer. It takes, takes me time to get a game, but it doesn't mean I'm not interested. But on Resident Evil 3, I don't think I'll be that in. I am interested in playing, but I, uh, I don't care much about spoiling because I know the game is a bit, it's a bit rush, right? They cut a lot of shit, a lot of content. Not a bad game, per se, but it did irritate me what they, you know, what they kind of did there. So I watched a lot of playthroughs of it. Well, Max, I saw Maximilian did playing it, to be honest, that was it. Uh, twice, uh, hardcore nightmare mode. Uh, those are my favorite streams of his. It was one of the few guys I, I, I really watch. And uh, yeah, they use a uh, when she goes to the safe room and you hear the the thing, right? And apparently they use the uh, Ada's theme, which is here on the. Is it Mercenaries or even the Resident Evil 4 remake? Which again, I avoided any video should not as should not spoil everything because I do want to play that game. It looks amazing. Let me go ahead and check for for stuff here. As, as, as always, Ada, that's what we do. There we go. Can possibly see that. So I I just what I always did in Resident Evil since I was a, a kid is shoot just click on everything. I think that's a map that looks like. Factory map is good. I love uh, one of my favorite. I gotta say, one of my favorite scenes uh, as far as those static images. I downloaded them all. Uh, Big folder was on archive.org, and I would I would go through all of them because sometimes when you're playing, you're not really paying attention and admiring all the work that was put into those things. And th this one is my favorite. I think the train, the moon, the skyline, uh, the skybox, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's not really a skybox, it's the sky, goddammit. Overcomplicated here in the sort of a rusty structure. I really like this here. It's one of my favorite scenes. It's simple, but I, I just really like it. It's so, it's so different than what, what you use your scene when you're playing this game. You don't get to see the sky very much, I think. It's always constrained, so this one here feels it's like a painting to me. I would have this as a painting hanging on my wall. As a matter of fact, let's make that happen. I'm gonna print this shit out. I'm gonna put it on a frame, and I want it here. Why the fuck not? I got a print. I got an A3 printer here. Super Mario Galaxy. Uh, definitely. I. Um, uh, you see, you play around. I, I play that game actually. I um, cat. Um, I don't think 100% of a close to it. The 100% is actually a bit harder. But I want to play Sunshine first. I'm having a little bit of a problem with a memory card on my, my memory cards. Or well, my, uh, I have one that works, but my Resident Evil 4 saves are in there. I don't, I don't want, I don't want to part ways with them. I would really like to have the Mem Card Pro. Uh, I have the Mem Card Pro right here for the PS1, but I, w I would really like the, the GameCube one. I feel very confident. My daughter was playing Super Mario uh, Sunshine. And she, sorry, hit the microphone. She lost all her saves uh, on an original N Nintendo official, official, 100% official uh, memory card, and and that happened to me one another time. And I kind of lost confidence in playing games. I mean, I mean, imagine I come here for a stream, I play like 70% of Super Mario Sunshine, and then it's just gone. It kind of ruins everything, right? So forever, I'm gonna have this half-assed stream that was archived. Uh, Super Monkey Ball, it's been played on the channel here, Spirit. You can go on YouTube and type Super Monkey Ball and you're gonna and you're gonna see it there. I played it on a Dell monitor that I played that I used yesterday on a red Dreamcast. I think it might be my only Dreamcast video, video so far or stream, whatever you want to call it. Uh, but there'll be definitely uh, more. I do have an OD for it called USB GD ROM, so I can potentially play any game on it. Uh, so looking forward to that. Uh, we'll definitely have Dreamcast here sooner rather than later. It is so good in the RE4 remake. Ada's, she, she's amazing. I like Ada as a character. She's pretty cool. I don't know much about the remake. Just the, I, I kept myself in the dark for the most part. 
I <laughs> I thought it was a first aid spray. Pardon me. Did I stream? I streamed it. I streamed Super Monkey Ball. Uh, Super Monkey Ball is on. It's in there. I also have in case uh, if you ever want to look consoles, but it's because I'm kind of new, right? Um, still, right? Uh, let me drink some Coke here if y'all don't mind. I'm kind of new, so there's a lot of console. I have playlists, is what I'm trying to say on YouTube. Oh, YouTube, I think YouTube is very important to me for archiving because the, the VODs disappear here, and I'm kind of an archivist kind of guy. I like to archive everything, and, and my streams are important to me, and I like to have them archived. <clears throat> um, so, fuck was that voice I did? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so they're archived on YouTube, and you can go by console. And there's a there's a Dreamcast release in there. I think it'd be the only video, as a matter of fact, happen to be Super Monkey Ball. If it's the Dream, the, sorry, not the Dreamcast. What am I I'm talking Dreamcast? I'm talking shit. Sorry about that. Uh, GameCube, GameCube, GameCube. Give me. Let me take a look. No, uh, Dreamcast is crazy taxi. What the hell am I on about? Don't get old, huh? Let me see here. Uh, just a minute. Um, I think it'd be under the video tab because uh, if you go under the live tab on YouTube, because before I could multi uh stream, simulcast, whatever, uh, YouTube wouldn't wouldn't let it happen. Okay, so it's just the way it is. Uh, I'll give you the link here. You can open on a tab if you want. Just give me a second. I might as well drink my coke here. Go back to the game. I did stream it. Sorry, GameCube. I meant GameCube. I'm not talking about about uh, but a GameCube same deal. I can play any any game on it. Ah, very thirsty. Sorry. Monkey ball, monkey ball. Where the fuck are you? Oh. And uh, next page. I was thinking of Crazy Taxi when I mentioned that. Um, there we go. There you go, your spirit. You can save that on that. On the tab there. There's a monkey ball for you, my good sir, if you're interested. It was a lot of fun. It was a hood and a holler that game. I enjoyed it. Had never played it before and had a ball. A monkey ball. One may say. There we go. Okay then. So I think somebody's gonna get hurt here. At some point. This is a dangerous game they're playing here. Oh. Look at it. I don't I can't even see anything here and I got something. I got Ada, not helping me. Work with me, not against me. There we go. Was that in the can? It was. What's this here? The C panel key. I'm disappointed I had to review the game for the anniversary collection, Banana Mania. I heard a lot of uh, over the years uh, Joe from GameSack talking about that game, and he's uh, he's not happy with the controls. He still considers the GameCube one to be the, the the one that controls the best, and I trust him on it. He seems to be very enthusiastic about that game. Do I use a key here? What do you want, fool? In this the panel, what are you on about? I gotta go outside, the panel outside, is that it? I think that's it. So he swears by the GameCube original because of the controls. Was there, uh, there's two panels, right? There's this one, is there another one on the other side? Is that, is that it? I, I love this. This is nice. I think there's, oh shit. No, there's just one panel. Tripping balls here. Okay, so it's right here. That's not it, the, the other one. There you go. I like that sound. I like this part. The 
PS1 control controller is too comfortable. It's my favorite controller. This here is my favorite uh oh cutscene. Favorite controller of all time. This one right here. It's great. It's super cool. I think I may have goofed. I, I think I done goofed. I think I should have brought a magnum here. Okay, well, maybe the shotgun will be, be, be good enough. So this is it. We're gonna come out. She's unconscious. We're gonna come out and gonna fight that that guy. Yeah. Well, prepare to die. I, I could possibly die here. What do you think of the PS2 controllers? They're good. The PS3, I don't know. I'm not too big on it, uh, but it's not that much difference. But I don't know. I don't. I'm not amazed by it. Calm down, man. Your head is now your nipple. I. I think I'm fucked for healing items. I think I'm gonna die here. Okay, uh, yeah, I don't have healing items, just one. No auto aim, yeah. Don't let him get near ya! Fuck. I'm getting ready. Here comes the punishment. Go, uh, go, 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 go. Oh my god. Jesus. He's gonna get me. Oh shit. My god, okay. I'm not prepared for this. I didn't, uh, for some reason, I, I didn't think of the swipe that was coming. Is he jumping? Suck it. Didn't touch me one time. That, that went well. I completely forgot. I would have brought a magnum, I think. Uh, one fucking herb, because when he gets you, he fucks you up, and he fucks you up good. That went well. I kept my dish. I'm, I'm proud of this fight. That that went amazing. Thank you. A round of applause. Good, good, good. Let's look at his dead body one more time. I, I love, look, look at this. It's so cool you're going down. The, the atmosphere here is fantastic. I'm very happy with this fight. Uh, the upgrade came in handy. This, uh, of course, I, the screen froze. Of course, did it? Did, was the fight gone? You didn't get the fight on. Oh, no. That was my moment, man. This fucking Elgato has gone too far with the bullshit. How long has been frozen, you son of a bitch? Did you see any of the fight? Cool, I that didn't take a hit. Really? How long has it been frozen? I was concentrating on the fight here and shit and breaks and I didn't No yeah, fucking it. It's the best I ever fought him. Of course the fucking Elgato's gotta be frozen. What the hell's the matter with you anyways? The fucking thing is either a black screen or freezing. We're fixing the internet now. There's this jackass to deal with. The whole fight is gone. It was awesome. I kicked ass here. Come on. Son of a bitch. Don't ever fucking tell me that Elgato's fucking making awesome products. Cause this fucking thing is dog shit. 
Yeah, the screen is up because I gotta go here every time a fucking Elgato can handle this shit. I gotta come here on OBS and change the source and change it back. And it, it picks the fucking time, the whole fucking game, walking around looking at the spiders. Then the fight with William Barker, Birkin, whatever the fuck the name is, the, the fight with William Birkin, it fucking frees the whole fucking fight. Are you fucking joking me? I gotta have, I don't know, I gotta have some sort of alert so the screen freeze people can tell me already. Because the internet is good, the internet is not freezing anymore. No fight is gone, I'm sorry, I don't know what the fuck, what, what, what am I to do here? What a bunch of... I'm tired of Elgato's bullshit. You ought to see me here setting up this camera. You move this camera a tiny bit, and you lose a tiny bit of the signal, Elgato goes red, that's it. It doesn't like anything that drops a signal, even for a momentary fucking nanosecond. It wants to drop off. I have to go unplug the fucking thing and plug it back in. I'm so fucking sick of it. You know how many times I had to unplug and plug uh, this fucking thing today while setting up? Well, I didn't fucking count it, but a lot. Stole my thunder, ruined my moment. Elgato, I'll never forgive you for this. I'm sorry, I'm not reloading the save. This this fight was awesome. I I, I think the save was how long? No, fuck off! Not happening. Fight him again. Do it over. You're not fucking doing it, little shit. We do it again. We we'll do it by the numbers. We we'll do it by the book. You're seeing the fucking fight. I'm not here to beat the game. I'm here to beat the game so you watch it. What's the, Otherwise, what's the fucking point? I turn this fucking camera off. I go to the living room. I play on my fucking 34 inch. Come off it. Do it again. We're doing it again. We're doing it live this time. Play the intro. I need a fucking cigarette. We're doing it again. I'll kill the bastard again. Nobody's missing a fucking thing here because of fucking Elgato's bullshit. No way, Jose. Not tonight. Not after the things I've seen. It's happening. Make peace with it. We're going back in time to a simpler time. A time where I, I beat William Birkin again. Now watch me take a bu Let me tell you how the fight went now. I took no hits and I fucked him up. Watch me fight now and get fucked. Watch this shit. I need, I need a system here. I need something that tells me that the fucking screen is frozen. But I'm not putting a responsibility on you. It's just that, you know, I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm in the middle of a fight. I'm not gonna be... Uh, 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 to baby, I gotta babysit Elgato for... Uh, how long have I been streaming here? Eight hours? Eight hours looking at the screen. Might as well play with a, with a monitor here. Don't even look at the CRT. It's just, you keep sh make sure that Elgato does the job that has, has been paid to do. Son of a bitch. I ought to fucking shatter your thousand pieces right a fuck now. And you know, you're fucking disposal of me. I use you, man. I got another one of those. Because I can't get enough of trash here. Because I usually have another one for the capture. I may have a smoke here and we'll do it again. I saved it just before. I need to do this. Get the keys. Do all the boring shit. I know. It's... Fuck me. Right. But at least you see the fucking fight this time. It's an awesome fight. He throws a pipe at you. You know, not everybody knows this game. Only people that are here, maybe they they never seen this part. And I want to see it. Look, I'm not that angry, I'm just annoyed. It's fucking annoying. We'll do it, we'll load it up again. Fucking Elgato, making me fucking repeat this shit, you fucking piece of crap. Oh god, am I past the fucking killing all the zombies bit? I hope so, because that shit is making Ada waiting for Ada to kill everything. I'm not complaining, I bless their heart, just helping me here, but we do it again. We get the H parts, we get we get everything here, my good sir. Let's go, we do we do it again. Do it over. Keep an eye on this fucking Elgato now. We're gonna fucking babysit this piece of shit. What's up with products nowadays? Nothing works, man. Just fucking work already. Hey. Whoa. <laughs> Pay good money for this shit, buddy. 
You know, I knew it wasn't trouble. You know what Mike Matei said in one of his streams, and in my heart sunk when he showed the thing. I was watching Mike Matei one time, and they're talking about capture cards, and he's complaining about Elgato, so I'm not the only one. And he pulled. I said, I have a bag of those things. They 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 fail. I throw them away and get another one. It's kind of crazy when you think he would change a brand. But no, he, he says he has a, ba a bag of them, and he pulls it up and is the same fucking thing I'm using. I was like, well, I'm in for a fucking freak. I mean, I plug and unplug. That's what I do. But I shouldn't have to be doing that shit. And you know, when you're playing a game here, well, when it's gone, it's gone, isn't it? Fuck it, we're doing it live. I, I, I fucking sincerely hope I don't miss the. Uh... Did I upgrade already? I upgraded it. The shotgun. So we we'll watch the cutscene again. It's okay. It's mostly Balani. We can, we can do it. Let's go in there. Should I bring a Magnum? No, I beat him without the Magnum, so I don't need the fucking Magnum. I want to beat him the same fucking way if I can, but watch that piece of shit is going to hit me. Ada? Uh, seems you have a bit of an issue here. Ada. Ada. There's an object. Ada. There's an object in front of you, Ada. This is not how geometry works. This is a physical object. You've got, you've got to go around it. Thank God she's a good shooter. She's a straight shooter, one might say. Okay, let's go to the can. There's a magnum here. There you go. Sitting by the commode here. Okay, and uh, yeah, man, let's do the Birkin. Do the Birkin just like that. Ba -ba -ba. Just like that. You'll be hooked on the Birkin. We'll do it again. we we'll deal with that bastard again. You're not stealing my thunder, oh God, and I'm keeping my fucking eye on you, you bet. All right, let's get to hear this sound again. I like that sound, I don't know why. Bump, bump, bump. Uh, this one here. And notice, I'm not, I'm not bringing fucking new, because I, I know I should have. Uh, bring more uh, healing items, but I, I did it without it. So now the mission is there. So it has to be recreated the same fucking way. Otherwise, no way. That should be the same. gonna do some praying for me boy and you better pray good all right equip it not time for an itch and nose not now it's the battle of the ages here what are you on about all right bastard don't fucking freeze No, I want you to see the battle. There's no way I'll continue. I, I, I thought of it. I was like, no, this is bullshit. All right, I seen it, so. Okay, that, my favorite part here throws a pipe at you. <laughs> and you get the head and nipple thing. Okay, keep your distance. That's right. Let's focus. Focus on the shit. Let's go. No, no, no. The angles are. I knew you hit me, you fuck. I knew it. Look, it can be replicated. I knew it. Look at this shit. This is so much bullshit. I didn't take a single fucking hit last time. Fuck you, Elgato, you fuck! 
I hate you. I hate you. I hate you, you prick. You fucking prick. Fucking goddamn prick, you. Oh, fuck. The, the, the battle's going horrible. It's going horrible. I'm gonna fucking die here. Look how fucked it is. It was perfect. Fuck you, Ogato! I hate you! I fucking hate this fucking capture card so fucking much! What are you doing? What are you fucking what are you fucking what are you fucking doing, dude? Oh my god. He every step of the way he has hit me. This is fucking incredible. There was no hit last time. There was no fucking hits. No zero, dude. Zero! Because of this shitty ass fucking capture card from hell. Yeah, it cost me a nerve. Guess it's not that bad. Nah, I'm not fucking redoing this shit. It's dead and I use one herb, it's fine. But it, it fucking goes, I told you, I told you I would be get hit. It was a, it was perfect. Well, I hope you're happy, asshole. Are you happy? You're laughing, aren't you? Digital fucking laughs. You fucking sack of shit. Disgusting. I'm so tired of this fucking Elgato. Fucking have somebody, mm -hmm, Elgato's fine. No, it's not fine. It's not. It's pretty fucking far from fine, dude. Do you even know what Elgato product I have? Maybe have a different product? It sucks. The fucking thing sucks. Cost me an herb here. I think herbs grows on trees? <laughs> no, it's fuck. I got hit many times. I'm not fucking redoing this shit. Ruin, ruin everything. Let it, let it, let the fucking aftertaste of Elgato shit linger in my mouth forever. Motherfucker. Don't die on me, Ada. Come on. Wake up. Come on. Welcome back. Uh. Hey, take it easy. We're inside Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound, so just rest here in the meantime. But I'll only slow you down with these injuries. Go, save yourself. I told you, it's my job to look after you. But you would be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time, but I really enjoy being with you. I... I know I'm not capable of caring about anyone, but I don't want to lose you. We're leaving this place together. Wait here for me. I'll be right back. I hope you can hear the tune while well. it's not so low, but... Listen to the sound a tiny bit.
I listen to this tune very often. I really like it. It's very peaceful to me. <clears throat> Alright, we're at the lab. Had a nerve stolen from me by Elgato, but okay. <clears throat> to be honest, I fucked up. I don't know what the fuck I panicked. First, man, the first battle was so good. Perfect. Didn't touch me one fucking time. I'm overwhining here. I'm just gloating up. I've, I've, I've always been hit a few times, so. Not this time, but too bad that, you know, that shit happened. What are you gonna do? No, we're burning bridges here. <clears throat> we're we're going we're going we're going forward with it. Uh, I think one herb is not too bad. You know, think about it. It's just just one fucking well, a mixed herb. Right? That's a lot of green herbs, there, feller. I oh, should have grabbed the, uh... Now, let look around here. I think this is now when I get the naked zombies, right? I think in the remake they're called Pale Heads or something. I'm trying to get comfortable here. If you check on her, does she say anything? Oh, you can't. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, we'll do a save here. Yeah, it's a good miss. I think they're using one of the remakes. What are you doing? It's here. Oh, I reload everything. This here really. It's sorry. It just pisses me off in the land. It's an organizing thing, and it keeps getting fucked here. That's more like it, mister. <clears throat> oh, and there's more ink ribbons. Awesome. Love it. I need more than one. <laughs> there's a lot of birds here. Oh, I got him. Burn that bridge. Not, not repeating that boss fight. Fuck off. No way. All right, let's explore the lab. Alright Ada, I'll see you in a bit. <clears throat> Stay sweet. Yeah, the pale heads are here, I think. Are they here right now? All those fucking shitty ass plants, I just remembered. They're fucking miserable existence. <clears throat> the shitty ass plants, they poison you? I don't no, they spit on you. I don't know if they poison you. Uh gotta get the flamethrower. Uh is good against the uh I forgot the name, the plant people. I did a, I was session FW900 with, um, with the Resident Evil 2. Uh, you know, my other monitor, because uh, it's washed out, it's got some problems. It needs an adjustment. And I figured Resident Evil 2 would be the perfect game for it, but I didn't want to start the game. Right. So my wife had her save file, so I think it's just before the last fight or something. And I saw the plant zombie things that I think is the equivalent of that. And man, did they do, do a good job. They're fucking terrifying at the noises they make. I find that game scary as hell. I look forward to playing it, but at the same time, I don't, because <laughs> it's scary. It's a bit scary. I hear most people don't get scared again, but then they tell me amnesia, and then amnesia, I don't find it scary at all. All right, we gotta go somewhere here, but let's go here, I guess. Oh, is this shit here? Okay. Mm, uh, yeah, but what's in here, though? I want to check that other place first before I start going crazy here with, it, with this place. <clears throat> yeah, maybe we'll go on then. Maybe we'll... You know, I think the path we're going is, is good enough, isn't it? Where people come from, man? Okay, yeah, we, uh, we, we go on the, let, let, let us move us, let us move this way here for now, for now. 
<laughs> oh man. Yeah, uh, yeah, I get scared with games, thank god. Um, Resident Evil 2 Remake. Okay, I know the plants are in here. I found it beyond scary, that, that game. I play a tiny bit of it. So, because if you're wondering why I, you haven't played, I played it. I played the demo, and then yes, I did pirate it. I bought a physical later. Piracy don't always lead to more pirates. So let me tell you, it, it just doesn't. Not for me, at least. So I I bought the game physically later, uh, but I, I played a tiny bit of it uh, around the police station, and I found it very scary to me. But then again, I got scared easily with games. Yeah, Resident Evil, Resident Evil 2 Remake. But if you want to ask me, the, the scariest game for me is Fatal Frame. Okay. Uh, security measures in case of an emergency. In the instance of an un uncontainable biohazardous breakout, all security measures will be directed towards the underground, toward the underground uh, transport facility. In the instance that any abnormalities are detected among cargo and transit, all materials will be automatically be all materials will automatically be transported from the loading zone to the de designated high-speed train, at which point all materials will be isolated and disposed of immediately. In the instance of a Class 1 emergency, the entire train will be purged and disposed of without delay. In the instance that the lab itself becomes contaminated, the northernmost route currently used to transport materials to and from uh, the facility. I like to and fro better. I like saying to and fro. I have a thing with to and fro. Uh, the facility will be designated as an emergency escape route. This route will secure passage to the relay point outside the city limits. Disclosure about any information regarding the research con conducted here or the existence of this facility is strictly prohibited. Since uh, it is top priority to keep all research classified, escape access may be denied under certain uh, extenuating circumstances. <laughs> Anti BOW I guess Frank or we're gonna turn on the switch. Now let me just, just wait a tiny bit here. User registration. Yeah, I wanna I wanna write that down. I don't trust my own memory. <laughs> I'm not a fucking pro with this game, you know? So okay. Okay, I put right lab. Username. I like how username you should be separate. A lot of words you should be separate. You know, it always amazes me. Today you should be set two separate, like with a hyphen. Back in the day, before my time, I reckon. But I read a lot of books that today. Okay, it's weird. Password none. Valid for twenty-four hours. I know it's easy to remember, but I, I'd rather write it down. Better, rather be safe than sorry. It don't cost me nothing. Original Fatal Frame is scary, very intense, when you're having to let the ghost get right up in your face so you can snap title or title to a team. Nah, it's very scary to me. It doesn't uh, embody the head floating around. The, the, game, the game is disturbing to me. But again, J Japanese horror does get me. Asian horror, Thai horror, uh, Chinese horror. Okay, um... I think the gas is gonna make me... I don't know. Is that gonna work? I feel like if I stay there, would I die? I don't understand. I hope I'm not taking damage here. I can't remember this bit. I think you have to use... That did... Did that do anything? Well, There's a hard wall here. I'm not, I'm not going nowhere near you, buddy. Well, not sure what that gas did, but uh, I hope, I sure as I hope it's not hurting me in any way, shape, or form. This here's closed, yeah. Okay. This is going to open at some point here, this thing. I don't know, man, right now. Let's see if we can find that. Let me see where I'm at here. I know the fucking plant things are in there. And they do grab you. Let's try the other side first. Let's try it. Then we'll come back here. 
We'll, we'll get back to that. We'll get right back to that. I like this area here. Very cool. What does it say here? It says something here. A huge breaker system that regulates all the power in the lab. The main fuse has been removed and the power is not active in some areas. So I gotta find that fuse. But there's gonna be some zombies here, right? Sure as hope that's not the part I came from. Um, I remember here playing... Was it N64? Yeah, liquor killed me. It's fucking annoying. So this will open here. Uh, card key. Even this game I, I still uh, a bit scary to me. In some parts it is. I get suckered in, you know, the, into the game like that. This place is pretty cool too. <laughs> the NL7 movements, Doc. <laughs> Q Pain 8787 87 follows. That got me that one. <laughs> Alright, it did get me a tiny bit. Wasn't expecting it. First aid spray, welcome in, Oz. Ooh. Got a fuse case here. All the knickknacks and doodads. I think I, I remember playing Resident Evil 1 and I fucked up at the, <laughs> the end boss. I couldn't see the. I couldn't find a flare. And I thought it was like automatic. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. And the time ran out. And I reset the console. <laughs> this idiot. I got the fuse cage, but you have anything else for me? I like this place here. It looks pretty cool. Very unique. Yeah, let's use that. I don't, I don't know if you play, if you place the main fuse right now. I remember the, the giant moth too. There's some crazy critters around here. I think this is as good as it gets. Let's see if uh, any enemies. Uh, well, we established that you can move, open the door, come back, and it'll be enemies, right? So, just trying to hear anything. Did I? I have healing items. I didn't bring hit on those. What the fuck am I doing? Yeah, and if I'll open that. Where would I get the flamethrower? I think I um I tried to just yeah, so this here is a corridor. Somebody out in the corridor? Remember called Veronica. Wait a minute. Hold a mo. Go here. This place is locked. Might as well come back and kill those fucking zombies, man. I need to go back to Ada. I can live a bunch of naked zombies run, running around there. You know? It ain't right, man. Just, it ain't right. So, blue, red, white. Yeah, let's kill those bastards. I hope they don't keep respawning. Yeah, Ada, there's no Ada here to save your ammo now. <laughs> Sit down. Sit your chew all ass down before I make change. Disgusting. I feel like popping some hats here. Let's do it. We got you for the press on. No. Do I hear liquors? Come on, fellers. Oh shit, it's doing the fucking <laughs> the half half thing. Alright, fine. Come on, bitch. Fool me once, shame on you. 
Fool me twice. Can't get fooled again. Oh, this motherfucker got shot from, from afar. Okay, uh, yeah, because there's a, an, an explorer place here. I do remember get, getting killed by a liquor, but I can't remember if it was scenario A or B. I've heard of Extreme G. I, I can't remember if I played it. Is that like F0 or something? Something to that effect? Yeah, uh, let's put the first spray away. Uh, first spray away, because uh, I saved that for the last boss. I'm aware to get the ranking. It's very tough. You gotta. You gotta. You can use the first aid spray. I seen you start playing it. I could get rid of this right now. This. What is this here? Can't, I don't know what that is. Uh, carry one of those. There should be enough. Hmm. Don't know about saving now. I think it's too early for that shit. I think I played it once uh, a long time ago. I think. Because, uh, yeah, I do remember it looks a bit. Hey, Chilicon 1 is here. I don't know if there's any mods left. Uh, if you could give Chilicon 1, it's been good to me here. Give him a shout out as well. Thank you, uh, folks. Welcome in. Good to see you. So, we're playing some, uh, some PS1 here. Uh, Resident Evil 2. <laughs> see. You know my favorite line of and in Spanish I like it because I can understand I understand Spanish okay uh, speaking is a different thing I like si quiero matar <laughs> I love that line in Resident Evil 4 I say it around <laughs> cogelo, cogelo. And go, cogelo, cogelo, cogelo. Morire, vivir. Morire, vivir. Morire, muere, muere, muere. sometimes I go <laughs> I go around the house going, muere, muere. And then my wife is like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> muere, 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 muere. Okay, I guess we can do that. There's a fucking flamethrower. So welcome in, y'all. You're playing Resident Evil 1 GameCube. Oh, you did it. How how, uh, how were you playing it? Like in what? Uh, a CRT? And you don't have to say CRT. Uh, if you're playing on flat panel, sign. I use flat panel shoe. Uh, I was just wondering how you're doing. I'm uh, I'm excited about the GameCube one because you can uh, it's higher assets, so you, you can force it to 240p. I learned that from Digital Foundry, and Jerome confirmed it here earlier. Si quiero matar, matalo, agarralo. Oh, and I like this one. Vayan por detrás. <laughs> I love that game. I'll be playing it here. Flat panel with a retro prism. Well, but you got 480p then, yeah? So that's good. That's good. No, that's good. That sounds good. I know I said 480p doesn't look good on a flat panel. I have said that here before, but I'm talking about very big flat panels. I think if it's a smaller one, it's okay. Sorry, it's okay. I think things are getting a bit too spicy for the pepper here. I think I have a lot of uh, ink ribbons, and uh, I'm gonna just save. Yeah, why not? You know, I got them. We got the ink ribbons here. I don't know. Don't, I don't feel like repeating a bunch of stuff. Yeah, 27 inch. I think that'll look good. Yeah, it's on the smaller side. I think when, for me, when it put for it, it's not horrific. Well, no, 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 dude. Stop it. So yeah, uh, I think uh, when I put on a 55 inch here, and it's an LCD, right? I don't have OLED technology because I, I don't have money. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it didn't. I don't know. It didn't look horrible, but where the fuck is Zeta? I just not, <laughs> just not as good, a good caretaker I am. Hey, Chips is here. How you doing, Chips? I heard, uh, I heard you've been streaming out on your. Uh, your BVM out there. Uh, folks, if anybody here and you into that sort of stuff, Troops has been doing, um, right? You've been doing CRT stuff, right? So it don't matter. I can uh, give, him a, give him a shout out, Chase. I know it's not much, Troops, but it's something, right? Take it home with you. Uh, Troops is a good feller and I uh, appreciate him being here as always. Uh, I think my wife was watching your, your, uh, your stream. She 
it was a uh, you were live I think was it was it I think it was earlier so yeah you got that uh, got the BVN BVN going huh? so yeah Troop's out there using CRT issue he's he's been sold in the, in the idea of doing CRTs I, I don't know what I'm doing here uh, let's put the fuse in there uh, that's the first order of business here Dragon Quest V I'm kidding I know it's five I'm not that dumb I'm dumb, but not that dumb, you know. I know Roman numerals. To an extent. Don't start a countdown or something, right? So, oh, trader shaking here. So what, that uh, restores power, I think. But the elevator, would the elevator work? I'm just wondering. Yeah, I'll check your VOD, definitely. You'll have the VOD up, up in YouTube. So, Chips, do you have problems with the beat rate on YouTube being lower? Uh, I don't know if you do past 1080p. Nah, doesn't do anything. Yeah, I got 7500 bit rate here, but, um, and then with the audio goes to 70, 76, right? So, but on YouTube, yeah, three, uh, 3K, and a uh, feller to help me sort my internet problem said that, um, uh, yeah, so how come I can't... Uh, what resolutions are you streaming at on YouTube, though? Because uh, he tells me that... What is up with a 1080p premium? Yeah, but then I download the Twitch. That's true, but I, I download the Twitch VODs, and I, I think they run a 75. Is that just what I have here? So I keep hearing that, but yet my archive videos are shit. They're at 3K. Uh, it, YouTube is not respecting my uh, my bit rate on on OBS here. It's not. What the fuck do I need to do? Hmm. What's dick do I need to suck here to get more bit rates on, on YouTube for crying out loud? I'm not sure what's happening. I, I can't. It's important to me because they they stay there forever, right? Those videos. So I want the bit rates. I need to see which which place is this one. One of them at a is that the power one? Let's try it here first. Whatever. Don't know. Yeah. So what's going on with 1080p selling a 1080p at a premium or some bullshit? Because the guy looked it up and he was pretty convinced that it was capped to that. But you're saying you can go pretty high. But are you streaming past 1080p? That's the thing. Because are you streaming at 1080p or way higher? Are you doing 4K, 1440p? Because that's, that's the thing. I think if you go above that, then then yes. So I got nothing out of this. There's nothing here. If I open here, the fucking plants are going to come out. I know I have to do it, but does it have to be now? So 1080. Okay, here's a quick question for you. How do you change? Can you, I'm, I'm on YouTube right now. Can I change the beat rate? Well, I'm not on YouTube right now. I mean, I'm live on YouTube. Can I change the beat rate now, or you have to do it before the stream? I'm not understanding. Because I'm doing restream. Have you ever simulcast before? Simulcasted? Because I do on restream, and I set the beat rate for Twitch, and it respects that, but YouTube does not. You do it on OBS. So it's not letting me. I, I said, have you ever used restream? Okay, so... Look, I, sorry, y'all. I'll, I'll put on a quick break here, if you don't mind, Chips. Where do I know it's impromptu here? But if you don't mind telling me, because I, I, I've been to settings and it's, it's not doing it. I, I know because I download the, I have downloaded the videos from YouTube and, and they're 3,000 bit rate. So do I have a cap here somewhere? I, I'm not sure because it's set here. So that if I go to settings, right, and I go uh, output or streaming, and here. Encoder settings, CBR, and bitrate 7 to 500. So why is it YouTube not? I just had for 8,000. What about the audio though? I think I did 8,000. It didn't do it for me. So I don't know what the fuck is happening, man. With, the, with... Yeah. Oh. Is that because I'm... Uh... Okay, it says here ignore streaming setting recommendations. But I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I clicked that before. Is that what that is? Right now it's not. 
I'll try that tomorrow, though. Weird. Very weird. Very bizarre. What did I activate here? I thought I activated a break. I didn't activate shit. That's the break. Fucking around here. Don't see now. Well, it's not working for me. Uh, no scent wrong. And it pisses me off because, you know, I'm recording here. I'm recording on streaming on, on Twitch. Twitch is way higher bit rate, but the VOD will be gone in 14 days, so... For my own personal record here, I have them in, in, in higher, higher bit rate, but YouTube is just not, not having any of it. You wish Twitch would go higher? Yeah. Why not? I'm going to give it the option. And, and they don't start a VOD, so I don't... What's the problem here? What am I doing wrong here? What? Okay, I pushed the fucking switch. Bring the plan, shit. They're not even here. You pansy. I was sure the plan things were, were gonna be here. This is Nathaniel Bard. Open the door, please. <laughs> it's, it's not working. What if I go to the other side? Is that the other side is the plans, right? I'm kind of, kind of a bit lost here right now. What the fuck am I even doing? Kind of just going all over the place and that's not, not doing anything. So let me, so we used a few, there's a, there's a key here to this and it's liable to do something. Um, Stream G is awesome. Played a ton as a kid. I've also been playing a lot recently. All right, something's got to happen here. There's a ladder somewhere. Where is it? I'll go to the other side and open the thing there for the plants show up. I don't know if you can kill them only with fire or if you can shoot them to death or whatever it takes, we'll do it. I think we've got enough ammo here. I think I've been... There were some points in the game that I struggled with ammo a little bit. Even I try as I may, not you. Lose everything, but... I wonder if there's going to be leakers here. There they are. Fucking things. Can I? Okay, I think if you exit here, there's a chance I can bamboozle them. I'm gonna try to bamboozle them here. I think they, they do go back to a default position. I think there'll be one right here, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. 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 I remember that. I remember fire is good for, against those things, but is that the moth? No, no, no. You can keep that uh, green herb, my good sir. You, you can't keep that. Good luck with it. I, I, I have, I think I have enough green herbs. Thank you. Thanks, but no thanks. That's the, that's what I'm, that's what I was missing. I was being a pussy there. I was trying to avoid it if it didn't need to be now, but instead I just wasted a bunch of fucking time here. Lakers, that's it. They killed me here one time. Confront them. Fuck you. Fuck you too. Reload that shit. I'll kill all of you, you fucks! Shut up! You shut your mouth! Don't you sass me? Kill me that one time on the N64! Piece of shit, caused me a lot of fucking trouble, little fuck. God, I had to go back all the way, it was a bunch of shit. Son of a bitch. You fuck. Fucking thing freezing again, huh? No. Who's that bastard? Was that. Is it the second or the third one? No matter, we kill both of them. Fuck out of here. Hmm. 
Yeah, not about the fucking bid rate shit. Hey, Woogie Boogie. I think someday Twitch will go higher. Yeah, it's liable to happen. I mean, there was a time, if you think about it, YouTube was like 10 minutes, 480p. That's it. I remember those days. Hmm. Come on, this is floppy disk. This is where we'll go confront the last feller. I love this game, man. It's <coughs> so good. It's cozy. I think we're gonna see a net now, I think. Is there things hidden here? Secrets? Pew! No. Thought a net was gonna be here. Oh well. Map of the lab is here. Yes, please. Fuck me. Fuck me sideways, man. I think there's a uh, stuff here and things. Do you have a ink reader? Don't give you no ink reader. Doc Doc Thal Chinaman. Uh, follows. Thank you. Welcome in. Thank you very much. Uh, hmm. So we got some green herbs here, right? We, not, we have them. What happened with the uh, red herbs here? Does uh? Seems to be a scarcity here. It's like a freaking Amazon here, man. What the fuck is this shit here? Oh yeah, I'm saving. I'm not fucking walking around lost. So we, I think we're nearing the end here soon, I think. Mm -hmm. Making sure I have all the supplies. For the last boss, I'm bringing a fucking magnum here, bet you as I'm saving that the best for the last, you know? If you see me looking up here, I'm constantly being afraid of Elgato freezing again. Okay. Check here then. It's always a good feeling after your save. Looks like liquor territory. Fuck him up. No? Huh. Speaking of the devil here. Oh, this is the moth thing. Oh, fuck me. tap on them. <laughs> okay, the lab is here. Oh, there's a few zombies here. They're annoying. There you go. Finally use the fucking key. What do you got? Magnum parts. Oh my god. I haven't even used the fucking thing. We're gonna upgrade already. Oh no, we're heading back, sir. Uh... Yeah, it's not that far. It's fine. It's right here, right? Yeah, there's a few zombies in there. They're kind of annoying. Quite a few of them. Can try to avoid them. Save some ammo, but at this point here, I don't know. Let's upgrade that magnum. I'm eager to do it. <laughs> I despise. Chris. <laughs> fucking Rasker. Finally got a fucking green herb here. Sorry, red herb. Mix them up. I can leave one behind here. Superman. Super cop. I'm super cop, remember? Here's fine. There's just a few zombies in there, so let's, let's go ahead with it. 
Oh, it's time for a quick bake. Stealth bait. Still expecting a fucking liquor to come down from there. I don't know, I don't trust those bastards. Let's go to the lab here. Extreme G, I gotta... I would check that by making my fucking... And 64 crap that out, you know? Not much you can do about that right now. Oh, look at uh, Jerome sent me instructions. I'm killing this fox. Bullshit. Coming through the door. Can they open the door? Another one. Shut up! There's another one of them in there. No, I'm not going through the reload. There we go. Shut up. I kill one of them. This asshole here. Oh, fuck. What? I'm gonna blow your fucking head off. Come here. I've got a card. Say, maybe I don't have to. Don't touch me, you fuck. What are you doing, Ed? <laughs> okay, I said, Ferris chemicals. What kind of experiments have been performed here? A lot of nasty ass shit, man. Dude, are, you, are you going towards it? I can't fucking see. That's it, you're dead. Both of you. I had enough. Get out. Get out. Fuck out of here, you fuck. I'm gonna blow your fucking head off. Oh! <laughs> that went more than the head! You. You fuck, come here. What are you doing? Where am I headed here? There we go. Fuck away from me. Son of a bitch. I hate getting bit by zombies. Bullshit. I couldn't see I was going the wrong way or fuck me. I'm holding my, my side here. It's already 6 a.m. here. The fuck not okay right now. I will another 20 minutes. <laughs> Still awake. All that bullshit with the zombies for nothing. There's not a fucking cotton picking fucking thing in here, man. Wait, 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 wait. Is this. What is this? A fucking Kleenex? What is this shit? Ah, oh, whatever. Well worth it. Is it not worth getting bit? I think that was bullshit. Anything here? That was it? Just a card. Well, next time, try to remember. Waste your time here. I guess that's it. It's okay, we got a nerve here just in case of any baloney. So I got a card, now there's a moth. Motherfucker. Yeah, there we go. Let's go in there. Just be careful, you don't cost you. If I take a hit here, I gotta heal immediately. Fuck off. Can't play Vita files in the Wii? Where's the fucking uh flamethrower here, dude? Fuck off. Oh time for your bullshit here. Did I kill it? Fuck out. I'm gonna God, I thought it was another enemy here. It's okay, though. We're saving that. Ah, oh, this shit. The fuck? Where's the fucking flamethrower, dude? I know there's a fucking flamethrower here somewhere. It's horse shit. Can I shoot those things? Oh, 
working in reality would wreck the computer. <laughs> there goes the keyboard. No, you can't. Get off my fucking hardware. So username was guest. other crap here. And there's Marty. They put those little maggots there, those grubs. So I think we can go in a fingerprint place now. Try to remember where the fuck that is. Washington Pro Lakers and all kinds of shit here. If we memory card, I, I gotta look into that cat crash because that sound I'm, I'm always trying to play Vita files off consoles to be honest. You're doing a lot of cool shit on the Wii there that I need to do. My Wii's modded, but it doesn't have some of those cool things, I don't think. I don't think, no, I know, I know for a fact. Wii MC. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking put this on a tab here so I can, I don't forget it. Wii MC. Yeah, 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 that's hot. There we go. I, I, I never mind, I'll educate myself on that thing. PS3 does a great job of playing Vita. It's, it's just a, such a power hog, man. It's, it gets so hot. You know, it kind of feels bad doing it. You know what I mean? The Wii runs nice and cool. It's not that powerful. My PS3 is like fucking a heater. And it's this lamb, you know? But yeah, the PS3, I expected to, to be good at doing media stuff. Okay. Hmm. Did spend some bullets here. I was remember where the fuck that place is. The lab, we're done with this shit. No, I'm gonna quit this just in case the Lakers showing up out of nowhere. Calm your fuck. Kind of expecting the Lakers to come out of it. They do those things on purpose. They'll put a hole in there, and you're, you're gonna expect something to come out of it. But it didn't, so that's fine. I gotta pay mind to where... Where is the, uh, when is the last battle here? Okay. Uh, yeah, I think we did enough to warrant a save here. I know I'm going kind of hog wild with the saves here, but hey. How many, how many green herb? I think you got enough healing stuff. See if I can use one green herb if you'll make a difference, uh, and I'll go to fine. Just curious about it. It's waste one. So I'm gonna ca caution yellow. Yeah, I did. Uh, that's good. That's good. That's that's cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, save it here. And as the fingerprint stuff, I think I have to avoid those plant things again. My Wii is a doorstop and my PS3 is a jet plane. That's true. Mine, it's hot. It's like it's, it's concerning. <laughs> I think maybe opening and doing a little cleanup wouldn't wouldn't hurt, you know, maybe the fans are clogged up. I'm not very familiar with the PS3, I never did any uh, like hardware stuff on it. To be honest. Not as much as the dogs, though. What the fuck? They got me. Son of a bitch got me. Got me good. Gonna be another one. Watch it. Hmm. You fuck with your mind here. Mind freak. Mind freak. Mind freak. Okay, I gotta be quick here. I'm not getting a fucking herb. This bullshit. That herb is crap, I'm not, not even looking at it. 
Yeah, good luck with that. Oh shit, I, to, I think it, it's the other way. Wait a minute. I think I need to go here. So I got a card reader. I got a fingerprint. But no, I need, it's a card reader, I think. Let's go to the card reader. Pop my PS4. Part last year, difficulty playing and everything, still goes into jet mode. I thought I ruined the power supply at one point because of those stupid little metal, metal tabs. I hate plastic tabs when they break and you can't put them back for shit. How about uh, thermal paste? Would that, would that do it? I did change a few thermal paste here and there. It was, not, it, it was not as hard as I thought it would be. I was scared of it because like it's, you know, I'm not really confident on that. Yeah, discard. <laughs> Can't imagine if you didn't keep, if you kept everything, you didn't discard. You you run out of space in the fucking chest. Oh god, okay. I think I'm gonna go with a shotgun here. No, 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 no. Use a, use a, use a gun. There's another one there. I bet. get you on the camera here, so I'm gonna wait a tiny bit here. I'm gonna file for that one, asshole. Oh, no. No, we, we're doing this. Okay. Shush. Y'all done? Okay. Who? Hiding there, huh? Oh shit. How's the research? How's the fucking re You fucking son of a bitch. Is he gonna grab me? Think again, bitch. I sat down. Fucking. Mm. Man. Okay, looking rough here. But it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. There we go. Look at all this pile of meat. Let me try a new pace as the ne next option. Because it tries to take flight. Even the lowest demand in games now. Yeah, the new consoles are complicated, man. They are. There's a lot going on in there. Wait a minute, didn't you not go to the table here and get all this stuff? What the hell's wrong with you? First aid spray. And there's something else. Nagging them bullets. Fucking barking, you're gonna get fucked. Okay, stuff in here. There's the ammo disc. I think once you get ammo disc, that's the final battle here. Okay. This has been great. This has been uh, great. It's, it's, it's better than I thought it would be even. Really, really forgot how much I enjoyed this game. It's my favorite Resident Evil ever. Although, like I say, the fourth one, man. I'm a Johnny come lately, but that one was that. That's so, such a great game. Chase, I think you'll like uh, Resident Evil 4, man. If you like action shooting, that game is just fun from beginning to end. If I if I was to suggest any game to you, have you ever played Resident Evil 4? Remember the time I suggested you uh, play Silent Hill? Uh, and you play it and you fucking loved it, right? Maybe not the third one. I tell you one game that I know, I know, Pigeons, I know 100% that you're going to love if you haven't played Resident Evil 4 is incredible. And I'm a guy that came late, like, to, to, to that game. 2017, I think. It's just absurd how good it is. Criminal. Okay, I think I gotta go to the uh, fingerprint stuff. There's something in there. You. You murdered my husband. I know what you're looking for. You came for G-Virus. 
this, didn't you? Take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. Now, where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. The only reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. What happened? Got piped, bitch. You got the the virus. Excellent. Self-destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat. The self-destruct sequence has been activated. This sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. There we go. Um. Okay, I'm always bamboozled by this. This is fine. There's not a real timer in right now, to be honest. Uh, what happens to your house? You know, I got the fingerprint, but you need two people, though. I think this is a scenario B sort of thing, right? Yeah, okay, it's not, it's not the time. Okay, uh, so, okay, so let's, let's get real here. Where is my safe? Card is here, right? The safe is here. Yeah, we gotta we gotta get that magnum ready. Yeah, I, I, I fell in love with that game. It's fucking awesome. Fucking awesome. I want to play that game again, man. I play it on the channel. It don't matter. I'll play it again. It's, it's just good. It's so much fun. God, I had fun with that game. I played it twice and only twice, but still. It's just, more zombies here? Or? No. Okay, so let's get prepared here. I think I think I should get prepared for it you now for the final battle. I think. And yeah, we'll go save because I think this will be the final one. And we need to bring the ammo disc. So I think uh, the gun, the time for a gun is over. Here. This is this is gone. Uh, no gun. So magnum bullets. We have quite a few. We're gonna fuck that guy up. Uh, let's organize everything here. Let's organize. Let me. This is the final one, right? I'll try not to use a first aid spray to see how that goes. Just use herbs. I don't. I don't know if it matters with the ranking, but. Eh. Um. So I need the magnum. There we go. Uh, magnum, and we get. Uh, what do we have here? The magnum rounds. There we go. Bullets. I don't know about bringing, about bringing a shotgun. I, I think the Magnum is fucking enough. 40 shots of Magnum. There's no fucking way you can survive that. Um, let me take a look at that. I think if you combine three herbs, three green herbs, they're equivalent of a full heal. So let me use some of those herbs here. We're not going to find red herbs at this point. Do a little glass clean up here. So I think, yeah, combine three of them. I'll do a, I don't know, like three of them. Should be, should be good. Play it on stream. Yeah, because I actually did not stream that game, because uh, at the time I was making videos and the microphone was shit. And, uh, I think I'm actually going to play on the actual GameCube, but no, no chainsaw controller. I played the whole game with a chainsaw controller. I 
think three is enough in the first eighth grade. I think that should probably do it. No, fuck off. Uh, more. Okay, so there'll be one. Okay, okay that should do it. Yeah, no, that game is, is it's one of a kind, man. It really is. I'm actually, like, eager to play it. Yeah, that's a lot of uh, herbs, so I think that actually will do. Um, I don't know. Uh, MO disc. And put a first grade, just in case, just in case of any bullshit. And the MO disc. I think there should be enough. I'm more prepared here. So. Oh, wait, I still, still have one of those. <laughs> that's a lot of healing items. Fuck it, I, I right? This is. I don't think I need to pick anything yet. Did I put the MLDI? I did. I don't think I need to pick anything up again, so I think that's it. There's no shitty ass zombies waiting to waste on my Magnum here, but I think we have enough rounds. I saved literally every round. I haven't spent anything on the Magnum. Let's go, bitch. I think it's time. There's some other shenanigans before. We gotta, there's the Ada scene, right? Which is kind of sad. Okay, let's do it. First, we'll take a nap here. <laughs> Can you imagine? No, let's go, let's go. Demo disc! Use that floppy drive. This game is so good. It's just, it's just great. No, it's not, it's not a good. Is it never open? Where's the MO disc stuff, right? I thought it was here. It's not here? Where the fuck am I? Is that it here? No, this is the one here, right? Is it? What kind of fucking lost here? What the fuck am I doing? It's not that's the elevator. Bottom platform. Alright, just just go somewhere, you find a place, you find a place. As soon as you see you've seen it before, anyways. I didn't realize when I asked if you knew what the regenerators were, the chase and the link. Yeah, the regenerators are the creepy as fuck. Uh, that's the one part of the game I was like, not as scary, but that part of the game was a bit. I've been waiting for you, Leon. What are you doing? You know what this is about. So just hand over the G-Virus. I don't believe this. Annette was right. About everything. That's why I told you to leave without me, but you wouldn't listen. Now hand it over. Don't make me shoot you. You can't do that. This is what everyone's been dying for. 
Yeah, that's kind of sad. No rounds in a magazine. I made her do that. Bitch. Oh, yeah, yeah, I did play it. But it wasn't a stream, actually. Yeah, it was a, a video. Um, at the time, I couldn't stream at all. There's ammo disc here. I'm looking for the ammo disc. What the fuck? What the fuck is that, son of a bitch? Where's the fucking place? I'm lost here. Why am I lost? When does fucking door never opens. That's it, motherfucker. <laughs> fucking asshole. What are you doing? Where's the fucking ammo this shit? It's not up there. I came from up there, right? Wait, it is. Okay, fuck me. Yeah, it's here, it's here, it's here, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's here. Where's the other asshole? What the fuck are you doing? Give up! It's over, buddy! Okay, I think we need to go up there. That's, that's the only way. Step over with the G-Fire, server forever. Yeah, I, was, I, I thought it was on the bottom platform. Duh. Fucking slap me? After being dead? What the fuck is wrong with you? This fucking plant. Vagina plant here. Oh, this fucking thing doesn't freeze at the end. <laughs> Fuck off. This is good. Eh. Oh, fuck. Nope. Fuck you. Jesus, waste of a fucking magnum. Way to go, you doofus. Okay, use that. Smell it later, pig fuckers. Elevator. Bitch. Yeah, it's gonna go crazy now. Got a lot of rounds here for you, even though I'm wasting them. Get your bitch ass down here. No, 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 fuck no. Like, fuck you're doing that, you fuck. Heal, heal immediately. That's, uh, fucking, we got, we got the herbs here, bitch. You son of a bitch. Fuck off. Get out. Where are you aiming at? Get out! Fuck! Fucking do- You're gonna lose all your shots, dude? 28 shots left. 
class. There you go. Outstanding game. Obviously, we're going to do a scenario B um, with Claire. Yeah, it sucks about it at all. Grab a couple of stars, Super Mario Galaxy. God damn, this is still an amazing game. It is a good game. But it's time to retreat. Yeah, get yourself some, some sleep in there. You need to. <laughs> I always step it with the Jew virus, your reviver. Outworld, how, how, how goes it? How you doing, mate? Just in time for the end. Yeah, is this a scenario? So I, I think, I'm not sure if I'll do it tomorrow right away or, or give it a game in between. Nice to see you here, by the way. Um, thank you. Check pressure, have a good night. Have a good good night of sleep. Yeah, so I, I don't know. I think while I have the setup here, I might as well do the scenario B, uh, B on Claire. It was my intention to do Claire A and Leon B because I never done it, I don't think. Paul Haddad, rest in peace, uh, original actor for uh, Leon. Scott Kennedy uh, died, uh, passed away a few years ago. Rest in peace. Good fella. Seemed like a cool guy you know, in interviews. Hood and a holler. I think he even played once with some fellers, played the game. It's pretty cool. So, so many people are taken so early, you know. Uh, thank you for the GG's. Yeah, this is an outstanding game. If you haven't played, I strongly recommend it. Yeah, past, I know a lot of modern folks that don't want to deal with the tank controls, but it's not, it makes sense here. You know, it's just it's not that bad. Shinji Mikami, awesome dude. Of course, involved with uh, Resident Evil 4 or 2 as well. Right? It's his baby. Guy's a genius. Yeah, this is awesome. Yeah, I think I'll play um, play Scenario B tomorrow. See how it goes. Scenario B, I think, is a bit harder. There's more stuff though, and you get a true win. You know. Yeah, the ranking is not going to be good. I take my time with those games. If 
you know, if you wanted to, you could get good. I, I just, I'm not into challenges that much. We can see, put your game, we on A, number save 17, total time, eight hours, 28, six minutes. Next, you see how many so I spent about, oh, with the breaks and all, about, about an hour, that's pretty reasonable, I'll say. I've been trying lately to focus more on the actual games. Claire B. I did Claire B on the N64, so that's why I want to do the opposite, but maybe I'll do it when I revisit that. I'll do what I wanted originally. Claire A, Leon B, which apparently a lot of folks say is uh, the canonical, the canon, right? Um, way to go. Some people debate that. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, see how it goes. Uh, all right, let me see who is here to rate. I appreciate y'all being here. Meeting Ark is here, Outworld, so many great people, Christine, it's been fantastic, uh, really, really a hood and a holler, um, see here, Christine was here way earlier, I was trying to see if I could, I think it's long gone by now, click on her name, yeah, Ark is here, let me see, uh, uh that's the limit, trying to find Christine here, I wanted to follow her. She here, she here, Christine, Christine. Damn it. I'll find her, I'll find her. They're, they're, uh, I saved the chat anyways. That was very nice of, uh, of her. That was a not, a nice. Oh, Chase is streaming, I'll send you out there. That's a friend of mine. So that was another awesome stream, Rex, and awesome hanging out. With everyone is always been a blessing. Thank you, Salamander. Always good to have you here. Should have come one. How do you like the PlayStation version? The PlayStation version is better, but the N64 is just so crazy on how what they were able to pull off that it certainly commands respect. It's for me the most impressive port ever done, to my knowledge. You know. So let me check here. I'll check my uh, my channel here. No, Chase is not. He's not streaming. Uh, ba, ba, ba. Oh, Scumbong. Scumbong is streaming. Chase is not streaming, is he? Okay. Chase? I don't see him here, so it must not be. Because I have, I have the thing. So I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to raid somebody here. Uh, Scum. So. But Chase has been streaming, so check him out. You know, he has been streaming. He bought a CRT and is doing cool stuff there. I hope he gets to play... Oh, no, he ain't. Uh, I hope he gets to play Resident Evil 4 soon. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna I'm gonna head on out. Um, I love that. Uh, thank you for hanging out here. Thank you for the rage, everyone. Thank you for, for everything. And I really appreciate it. I'm very thankful that my internet is working now. Uh, I feel truly blessed, and if you're here for the race today, and it was not a bit, not a lot of it, I can, what can I say? I'm a happy man today. <laughs> so okay, God bless you, and uh, have a good night, good day, wherever you are, and I'll see you next time. I'm gonna send you to Scumbo. Okay, thank you. All right, just just hang loose here a tiny bit as I navigate here as a big old boomer. Always awkward for me to end my streams. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. It takes forever for everything. And I, I make sure I start it here before I end my stream. Because sometimes I do shenanigans. There you go. And that should do it. End of the stream. Thank you. Thank you very much, everyone. Have a, a blessed day.